We are hardwired. Hard oh, we're, we're live? I better get out of here then. Oh, God damn it, Jeff. Just stay. Okay. It doesn't say live on my phone. It takes a second. Like seven seconds. It's got Big Man Tyrone, like, frozen and looking at me. What? Why is Big Man Tyrone frozen and looking at you? It just is. That's I don't weird. understand why. Oh, there we go. Now it's live. <laughs> I was about to say, why is Big Man <laughs> looking at you? <laughs> Flattered, I guess. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. 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 Ugh. Dream will be starting in about four or one minutes. Hmm. Oh man, I can't yeah. wait until they do some updates. I'm going to work tomorrow and, uh, early, like, I'm going to try to get up early, but since it's, I'm not really on, you know, I just got to get there and print a whole bunch of shit out and make tags and stuff, and it's going to be a good time. Hell tomorrow, yeah. Tomorrow yeah. is my first full day off since, um, I want to say last Sunday. Damn. Not this prior... Not this prior Sunday, the Sunday before. Wow. I mean, some of my days have been, like, four-hour work days just because of, like, rain and weather, but, like, I still had to go to work. Rain and weather? Where do you work? I work at a water park. Oh. <laughs> is that actually busy? Yes, it is. Wow. And even with all this stuff going on? Uh, eat, especially because of everything going on. People are just coming in en masse. Aren't you afraid uh, that it's like a COVID infestation? Well, I am, but I need to pay rent. Mm. And the last job I had was so terrible for my mental health and just for scheduling problems that like the tail end of working that job, um, I noticed the place where I was working I had sales on rope and I was half tempted to use it. Hmm, that's not good. It's not good at all. Though, thankfully, I got the job at the water park, which is a job I've had many, many years in a, many years in a row. And I'm always like hiding away from people or covered in chemicals. Covered so, in chemicals. Not in like a like toxic <laughs> avenger. Not in a toxic avenger sort of way, but in a sort of way where like I'm always splaying bleach everywhere. And, like, my break room is, like, a pump room that, like, holds acid. So, it's just, like, <laughs> I'm probably going to be fine. You, make, you make your job sound so great. I, I was about to say, I'm not sure that sounds like a safe job, either. It's it's as safe as it can be. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Right? <laughs> Do you have a pet rat, mostly, by chance? The job's mostly just janitorial work, so it's really just a whole lot of picking up trash and picking up, like, bodily fluids and stuff like that. Were you the cleanup crew for, like, a porno or something? Nah. Well, one summer, yeah, but no. Nah. Yum. So, uh, in the water park, we have two family bathrooms, or family slash, um, like, non-gendered bathrooms. It says family, though, like, there's been talk about changing it. But uh, one year, uh, I noticed two women had went in and not went out for, like, 45 minutes, and I came back in after they were done to uh, thinking, wow, they... You can just put it over here. We're, we're live, so whenever you want to huh? sit down. Oh, yeah, yeah. sweet. I want to know how the story is. I need to log in. <laughs> uh, so I went in and the sink was broken. Oh. oh. How do you break a sink? Well, I don't know. But two women went in. 45 minutes okay. later, sink's broken. Huh. And no one came out? Well, no, they came Greetings, fellow Magic the Gathering fans. Big Man Tyrone here to welcome you to my favorite Twitch stream. MTG Lexicon. They are the stream to watch for casual physical games of magic. That's right, real cards, live, unscripted, and most assuredly, 
not sober. Remember, MTG Lexicon is for mature audiences only and it is in no way affiliated with Wizards of the Coast or Hasbro. <laughs> MTG Lexicon does not condone drinking unless you are of legal age. Come join the stream every Saturday for live play. Give a I did not know as much of that song as I thought. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I was like, oh, wait a minute. Yeah, that's right. Oh, this happens. No. <laughs> I think My you is... combined two Metallica songs. <laughs> <laughs> My day is getting weirder and weirder. <laughs> yeah, it, fa- it suddenly sounded like a show tune in there. It didn't <laughs> sound like Metallica. In, no, in a I matter of, like... like is Metallica not, not a show tune band? Yeah. <laughs> in a matter of this 45 minutes today... Up. I have gone to publishing furry artwork, to pestering the mountain goats, like the band the mountain goats, yes, to course. listening to Metallica on Kazoo. Yes. Oh my god. You are cultured. <laughs> I guess. You are a person of good taste. I think this thing may be. This is, I don't know, man. Is that, I just tried streaming here. Is it coming through at all? Uh, not yet, it looks like. You've got the little green light there on your OBS, right? No, it's doing its thing restarting the computer didn't do it mm. all right just a second my friend we'll get to try to, we'll try to get that figured out for you well i uh we could try and do discord do you want to do you want to see if you can stream your at least camera through discord are you able to get that into your obs i can do anything baby oh yeah Brandon has powers. Right. don't question that yeah, the thing is, is this okay is not spinning yet. it yeah. should be but, Let's so, uh let's, let's see what we I've never done the Discord end before so let's try that. Did, did you try to test disk? All right, it doesn't matter. Like the device pops up, but if it's not gonna hit through here, that yeah. means it's not recognizing it like as an actual valid disk type. Yeah. So. I, I mean, gotta tell you right now, I'm Brandon made these margaritas that are like. It's not worth oh, so tasty. So I would say try and see. If I, you think, I think I uh, think Dale was having these last time still, when when they were here on Saturday. They caused it piss yeah. juice when it's and. Like a, Oh god, I fucking love it. <laughs> yeah. And it should be like slowing down. Swallow it all day. Juice. Oh, we also made a brisket so earlier. And it's been resting. It's been resting for a hot is, minute. I'm excited to cut that brisket to, open. After we're done I'm so hungry. That sounds I can't wait. That sounds delicious. Alright, so how do I do this video through Discord thing? Uh huh. Alright, yeah, just a second. Just a second. We can try. I have a, I have a BB machine at home, so. I see, what are you guys playing with today? Yeah. I, I see you have uh, Tibur and Rumia and uh, okay. so Zedru, kind of so the forthcoming the of. Yeah. Fit! It's the fifth coming on of Zedru. Excuse me, that was disrespectful. <laughs> coming of Zedru. <laughs> All right, what's up, everybody? Thank you very much for joining <laughs> us here tonight. We are MTG Lexicon, the dive bar of EDH, and as always, we are here for your filthy, drunken, casual, casual. Uh, commander. 
content. Good job. Da, da, da. I'm very proud of you two. All right. My name is Brandon, a.k.a. the producer, as I said before. And we're joined here by two lovely hosts and two lovely guests. Oh. All right, so over here uh, on the player one Dude, side, Johnny, Horse by the Deluxe. I, I am invisible now. I have been vampirized, as, as they say. Oh. So you will not be able to see me for the rest uh, of the night. I hope that's okay with everyone. Uh, There's not much to, to look at. <laughs> Uh, brisket break will after come game soon. one yeah, yeah probably uh, uh, after this game uh, oh no well brandon has cured me of vampirism yes <laughs> yeah, the space Whoa. jam mascot has finally come out yes space jam time all the day come space on space jam man. mascot <laughs> anyways oh, wow <laughs> player two spot we point. have beyond the machina one of our lovely guests talk about yourself <laughs> uh, yeah anyway uh hi i'm beyond the machina uh and I do Match the Gathering inspired playmats and artwork. You can find me on Inked Gaming at inkedgaming.com uh, slash beyond the machina. And you can use MTG Lexicon or Lexicon 10 Ooh. to get 10% off your order. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, I, don't, I don't remember what the code was. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, you can find me on Twitter at beyond the machina, only there's no E in the. And uh, I am playing either Zedru the Great Hearted, which I have played five times with this channel and have lost five times with this channel. Hey, it was all in the playing. spirit of, of having fun. Yeah, let's keep or that run going. My, my incredible budget t and Lumia deck, which has not ever really been able to do a whole lot, but I, I think maybe someday it could do something interesting. I sure hope so. I don't know for certain, though. <laughs> I believe in it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, on screen before you are some of the proxies I've made in recent time. Ooh. Our oh. lovely hosts have also Wait, why are some of these in color? This is off-brand. Yeah, I know it is off-brand, but, I mean, the, the, they look good in foil. Yeah, I really do like that brainstorm. Yeah. Mm. It's pretty fucking sweet. It does look good. He looks so happy. He wants brain exploding full of colors and rainbows. <laughs> Yeah, you know what? <laughs> Three of these are in complete agony, and one is just a bunch of fucking flowers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Must be the guy on the far right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's me. Oh, Sweet. and this is a box of at least 200 pacifisms. All right, Johnny, we're going to get you in here in a second, but talk about yourself. Introduce yourself. Who are you? I'm this guy. I hang out in the Discord. I talk about movies sometimes, but obviously, if you ask Brandon, I don't know anything about movies. And I play. Hey, hey, hey. I never Commander. said that. <laughs> you just. But no, I don't. You see, I have yet to see Jeepers Creep, Jeepers Creepers. I'll get there. It just hasn't happened yet. And uh, yeah, I, I show up and <laughs> do weird things with magic. You do. Okay. I yeah. show up and some reason they let me play. <laughs> For some reason, they, I keep coming back. They haven't kicked me out yet, so okay. <laughs> just wanders on in here, and we're just like, ah, we don't have, we don't have the effort to kick him out. <laughs> we, op we open the front door, and he's out on the cold, just against the, the door, just. <laughs> I'm barely not homeless. Um, okay, right. so we're gonna uh, get Johnny in here via the, um, the Discord Johnny, you know videos that? whenever he gets the chance to post that. Right, so what do we? How do I don't I have never done that. I figured out OBS and now I don't know Discord. So, I just click so the video the button. Jeepers Creepers. Yeah. Jeepers Creepers is just Duel and Nightmare on Elm Street if you combine the two. Ooh, that's that's all Jeepers Creepers is. Is Duel, the one with the truck, the Steven Spielberg, I believe, mm, right. and Nightmare on Elm Street, and just smush them together and make it like really awkward, and then have like the most mid two thousands actors possible and that's the film hey okay so yeah. i see i see right. johnny mulligan's beautiful face. <laughs> how do i change the camera Look at him. make it stop oh yeah this is hot oh <laughs> it's gone no there's a I gear button animal. that you could just click to change the video like, hello Lefinos. Hi Stark and hello Phantom and DLC two two four. DLC, what's Hi. up? They actually have yeah. another game going off to the side right now. It's with uh what is it? DLC, Phantom, Samurai Dancer, and Man Bear Pig. Uh all are in a game right now. Yeah. Uh off to the side. So that's awesome. If well, you if you're looking for sweet. games, we, we do have a community here where we do, you know, hope that you guys play with each other and hang out and chill and 
I mean, it's up to you if you want to talk shit, but I'm happy to do so. Mm -hmm. I really love it when people get together for those kind of things. Mm -hmm. Oh man, we better shut down the stream right now. It looks like they're they're the real action, right? <laughs> right, right. Funnel everyone over there, <laughs> and let's go to channel five. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I thought you said feather. <laughs> uh, Stark, Brandon, I will always talk shit. Please, please, oh, I love it, oh, and that's the Stark guarantee, right? <laughs> the Stark guarantee, or your money. Oh, back. if I'm if I'm running uh, if I'm running Discord, do I need to shut off my OBS? Yes. Otherwise, yeah, Discord right. will not allow you to use the camera. All right. It is a jealous lover. And she. Fuck these margaritas are good. Mm -hmm. What are you? Oh, what are you eating? Or drinking? It's piss sauce. Oh. Piss sauce is, that where, is, is so that, tasty. Is it there? Yes, I can see it. Okay. Yes. There, uh, there uh, yeah, we can see you now. Except it's backwards. All right. It's it's gonna happen. It's big old muck, but. I mean, I'll don't be... worry about it being backwards. Okay. I'm not worried if you're not worried. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Um... Will still with Emery, Brandon. Have a good stream, buddy. Aww. <laughs> That's very sweet. I love you. All right. Uh, give me two seconds. I'm going to studio mode this shit. Whoa. Studio mode. People never seen it coming. You know, Never seen I think I'm all coming. sly. I think I figured out the whole Discord thing. Like I, I got it. I, I understand it. No, no, no. Never mind. Just get it like this. See, that's the thing. You have to not understand things or even try to. That's that's how you get further. I think what Johnny is trying you know. to say is just stop trying. Yeah. I need to unlearn what I have learned. <laughs> exactly. The less you know, the better. Dun, 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 you thank dun, dun, you, Master Yoda. You cannot <laughs> fill a cup until it is emptied. Oh, that sounds great. If your cup is full, get a bigger cup. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> All right, we got Johnny in here. Hell yeah. All right. Hey. Hey. Oh, my God. It's it's 25 it. months. Thank you. Dun, 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 Massive dun, dun, dun. resub. Thank you for the, for the continued support. We love you, Feast. Thank you, Here's Feast. All right, can you see that okay? I can that see great. Great. Yeah, I meant the chat. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's what I'm saying. I can't see the chat because I got this screen in the way. Yeah, I got you. I got you. <laughs> Looks great. Oh, I felt like the Cuphead guy where he's like, doo, 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 oh yeah, doo, I just I just doo, doo, bought that doo, doo, on the PS4. Doo, 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 doo. Dude, Cuphead's so good. It is. I love it. I I need to play it. I it's so not. Oh, please it's play it. Please, please, game. please. Okay. All right. So we've lollygagged long enough. We're gonna get right into the not shit for not games for this not day. Right. We are going to. Check out which decks you guys want to see me play with. I actually have Snow Islands now. Wow. Yes. Oh, wow. For the entirety of, of the deck. I'm so proud of you. I know. It's uh, it's a little mind-blowing. I haven't sleeved them yet, but we're not going to tell people that. You know what I'm going to do now is switch all my other islands and every deck to <laughs> Snow Islands. Just for and just not, just not say that they're Snow Islands. Just leave them as regular islands. <laughs> oh, yeah, I could do that, too. <laughs> <laughs> do that the whole, Snow like, Island. for, like, four or five months. Just just tell everybody, it's snow-covered islands. Don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Fine. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a second. You finally have the snow-covered islands. Right. To get people to stop giving you shit about the snow-covered islands, but they're not the deck with the snow-covered islands. Exactly. I, what I figure I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it how it is. And then I'm just going to have the snow-covered islands on the side. And then when I put them down, I'll just put them on top of it just to anger people even more. There you go. That's that's brilliant. Give Truly us a little a cutting tin, please. man of the time. Right? Truly a man of the time. Be careful. It's slippery. <gasps> I mean, I've done that too many times. I can't joke about it. <laughs> yeah. This is the commander I'm playing today. I'm playing uh, Gavi from the Precon. Wow. Wow. Ah. Wow. I saw that shit at Walmart. Wow. Snatched that right up. Wow. Wow. Wait, is that is that is that the actual precon deck? Yes, it's a precon deck. Uh, I switched in like five cards. Five okay, if that's the if that's an actual precon deck, I have a precon deck or precon power deck I want to try, but it only does good against other precon power decks. I mean, okay, you really don't have I, to do that. I could go battle cruiser too, but this yes. is in a Layla deck that I just basically added cards to. Just run it, run it. 
Yeah, don't don't it. worry about it. I mean, like I did switch in a couple <clears> cards <throat> that are pretty powerful, consecrated sphinx and shit like that. So it's like yeah, okay, don't, don't even yeah. care about it. <laughs> we'll ship uh, it. We'll, sh we'll ship it good. <laughs> All right. I'll, I'll I'll just stick to good old Zedru then. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I need my mana base is shit, but I don't really care about that. <laughs> All right. So are you going Zedru then? Yeah. Hell yeah. Oh god, yes. You and I are gonna this be friends gonna, again. Right? It's gonna get gonna get so weird. So weird. Alright, and you're doing uh I forgot her name. What is her name? Alela. Alila. Alila. How do we pronounce chat how do we pronounce this? Alilu Dallas. Alilu Dallas. All right, I think this is gonna be Ur Dragon. I don't, I don't think this is gonna shift too much. Yeah, the numbers. Wait, Ur <laughs> Dragon? Don't you mean the numbers are there for the dragons? Ur Dragon. Ooh, no, the thank you, hard dragon. I put an apostrophe in there for the extra H. A hardwire. Hard let me go grab the, the deck. Hard dragon. Hey, Mark thank you very much. All right, let me go grab the deck, and then we'll get started on the first game. The Johnny, yes. please roll to see who goes first. All right, let's roll for in chat to see who goes first. <laughs> hey, that's player three. Johnny, you're going first, you piece of shit. Oh, God help us all. Oh, God help us all. Son of a bitch. And to all a Merry Christmas. Hmm. <laughs> Right. Fuck, I think this is an okay hand. I have a 2 drop, I have a 4 drop, I have a 20 drop. I think we're okay. <laughs> Not <Nani. laughs> Alright, let's uh, I'll do my card draw, and then I'll do my play my concealed courtyard untapped, because it's less than 2 lands, and then I'll play my expedition map, and then I'll pass the turn. Wait, 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 friend. Before before oh, we before have... we get this game started, how about we go around the table really quickly and just describe our decks? Um, makes it easier for D3 oh. to timestamp this shit, you know. Oh. Uh, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna start off with you, Johnny, since you're player. Uh, well, you're player three, but you're going first. So why don't you describe your deck? What's going on? So my deck is an Alela deck, and I got this deck because I've been culling tens of thousands of cards from my of my bulk to my local game store shit. and. <laughs> happened to be like I brought in one of those 5,000 count boxes. It was sitting on the floor. Somebody uh -huh. walked along and thumbed through it and saw all my Urza block bulk that I got rid of and just scooped that up and took it with them and bought it right on site. <laughs> so they threw me some credit and I was like, hey, I'm going to use my credit. I'm going to get me an Alela deck because it's not one of those jerk commanders that has the card draw built into it. Right. And, uh, yeah. Let's see what happens. I so think I got some awesome commander. Took some of my Alara cards and threw it at it. I was like, let's see what Esper does. I haven't played an Esper deck in I a long, long time. Love yeah. Esper. And um, Brandon does like the tradition where uh, we read off a, a card that has flavor text on it. Right. Would you like to read I a flavor text to tradition. us? Oh, oh, I'll start with. Uh, uh, let's find a good one. Uh, I await your donation. <laughs> I, like the, I like the way you said that. Wait, what? <laughs> I await your donation. Hot. I'm about to donate something across your chest. I, so. I, 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 I await your donation. <laughs> Hardwired. <laughs> All right, Brandon, why don't you describe your deck? Oh, by the way, Johnny's going first. He, he just, I saw. Yeah. Uh, yeah All what's right. going on? Well, Dragons, what do they up, do? What's up, everybody? My name is Brandon. I'm <laughs> over here in the bottom left-hand corner of your screen. As you can see out the left-hand window, we are passing Austin, Texas. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm still shuffling my deck, but I will tell you that I am playing the Ur-Dragon, Dragon Stompy. The Ur things Dragon. that I have said thousands of times, which just don't matter anymore. But I, I will tell you something else. Yes, please. There are only nine planets. Oh, sorry, there are only seven planets after I destroy Uranus. <laughs> I don't even know how many planets there are in the solar system. <laughs> yeah, we lost track after we lost Pluto. After that, like, the the entire solar system lost significance completely. All right. Okay. All right. Uh, Justice for Pluto, by the way. And my uh, flavor text is <clears throat> an artificer once dropped one in a vault full of coins. She has just defined it. Ooh. Hey, I know that one. 
<laughs> All right, I'm going to keep shuffling. <laughs> uh, so I'm uh, Johnny over here, Horsefather Deluxe, as you might see me around as um, on Twitch and Lexicon Johnny on Twitter because I'm inconsistent with my brand. Who cares? Um, I'll be playing Gavi Nest Warden. It's going to be a cycling deck. Um, I want to draw cards, throw cards in the bin to do a lot of dirtling. That's essentially my goal is to dirtle for a long time and hope that all my dirtling amounts to something eventually. Um, let me read you some flavor text. Amaket's desiccated land, thirst for blood. I almost thought you said Amaket defecated on the land. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, kinda. Amaket, you see, I don't, it's not. It's not the, inaccurate. The, the, the whole avatar <laughs> of Amaket literally just like took a shit on something. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> That's exactly what happened. Pluto is word for word in the story. Dwarf planet. Oh yeah, that all whole right. Rick and Morty thing. That was Beyond hilarious. the Machina. Describe Zedru. Uh, hi, I'm Beyond the Machina. I'm playing Zedru the Greathearted. This is a group hug deck that Did you say can... group hug? Group hug. Group hug? Group hug. Group hug. <laughs> yes. Group hug. Everybody gets a Everybody gets, everybody a, gets a pug. God, this is the best open uh, screening ever. <laughs> I know. Yeah, so this is, a, this is my... Uh, this is my... Um, large gathering of French pool deck. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And, <laughs> a large uh, gathering. Mm -hmm. Its goal is to uh, draw some cards and give people permanence, and then, uh, depending upon how friendly we all are, all are I can quickly shift Ooh. into a moderate stacks deck. I like how you moderate stacks. stacks. <laughs> how do you moderate stacks? Moderate. Filet mignon with a with a twist of stacks. How do you Moderately. Do you like your stacks? Mild, medium, or hot? a mild touch of stacks? It titillates oh the tongue. Two <laughs> pet stacks. <laughs> but yeah, that's, that, that's the deck. I have played this deck five times on stream. I have lost this deck five times on stream. And Let's we see, intend we to keep, keep that going. Going. All right, all right, all right. Now we're ready to go. Johnny, start that okay. shit off. All right, I do my draw. I do my upkeep. Here we go. I'm playing my concealed courtyard and playing an expedition map, and I'm passing the turn. Pass. Oh, I forgot to say a flavor text. Uh, the flavor text says, It is the force beyond the horizon, the mountain waiting to be climbed, the new land across the endless sea. Ooh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Expropriate. Yeah. <laughs> Farron, what's up? Stark, how's it going? <laughs> Garador. Thank you. The sculpting seal, yes, that was sculpting steel. Good thing I kept shuffling, because that would have been awkward if that was my opening hand. Uh... Feast, how's it going? Uh, I'm going to go ahead and play, before I continue down this road of torment and torture, Vivid Meadow into play tapped with two counters on it. Pass. Mm -hmm. All right. Irrigated Farmland in tapped pass. Phantom, how's it going? Lafonos, John, me brother, how's it going? DLC, what's up? Did I miss anybody? I got them all. <laughs> True. Dude, I love that Still puggy mode. To kill us. That puggy mode is All amazing. Right. So, untap, upkeep, draw. Uh, I am going to play a Golden Tarn. Ooh. Uh, it's a very fancy 16 bit proxy made by the amazing at ShapeyCutie on Twitter. I love it. Yes. Start going to play some Ur Dragon 2. Fuck yeah. I'm going to lose a life, and I'm going to search for a plateau. A plateau? Yeah. Keep track of my life total over there. Whoop. Got your friend. Uh, there's Plateau. Also made by the same artist, though. I have a real Plateau behind it. Or no, the real Plateau is in the CDH deck. Lame. Who uses a real Plateau? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, it's the CDH deck. You got it. And then on top of that, for a Wayfarer's Bobble. All right. You're a Wayfarer's Bobble. Yeah. You love right. the Wayfarer's Bobble. <laughs> you love the Wayfarer's Bobble. <laughs> and go. All right. I'm going to tap. I'm going to draw my card. And then, uh... 
Are the bets open? Oh, of course, of course the bets of are course. open. What kind of stream of would it be if we didn't set that up earlier? Right? You know? What just... kind of monsters do you think we that are? That would just be dumb, right? Yeah, That's what I'm saying. Ridiculous. Madness. I'll open it up again just in case you yeah. missed it the first time. Well, that's on you. That's how gracious <laughs> I am. I don't bet anymore after I bet it on myself one game and lost everything. <laughs> All right. That's I'm what gonna, you get. I'm Why would you bet on yourself? My ex I'm going to crack the expedition. I'm going to go searching for my land. I'm going to pass the turn. All right. Sure. Farron, other Pogue emotes. Oh, now i got to look at these other emotes. Oh, I like the hype one. Dude, dude. The hype one's hype. All right. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm going to do hollowed fountain tap. Draw. Gotcha. I'm going to put down a shrine that jungles. Ooh. Not to be confused with the jungle gym. And pass. Oh. Okay. Damn, Chuck E. Cheese shut down, Jungle Gym shut down. Is everything that gave me, like, herfacipolades when I was a child just huh. gone? Omnices? Uh, whenever you draw a card, put a foreshadow counter on Omnices. Remove eight foreshadow counters to create an 8 8 blue Kraken creature token. I'll pass turn. Brandon, are you sure All which right. Chuck E. Cheese you went to? It had to have been, people? like, it was the Jungle Gym, Chuck E. Cheese, and Scandia. Those are the three places I went when I was a kid. Uh, island. I'm going to tap both, sacrifice Whiffers, Bobble, and we'll look for a uh, mountain. Mountain. We'll look for a mountain, and that's my turn. Damn, everyone's ramping. Uh, everyone? Everyone. <laughs> everyone. Everyone. Everyone! <laughs> well, it's good to know where I stand, Brandon. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Oh my god, Gary Oldman. So good. He is. What am I even doing with life here? Uh, yeah, that's what's gotta be. We'll go three for a Pilgrim's Eye. And I'll search for another basic land card, reel it, and put it in my hand. And I'll Stones. play that card. I want. I'm actually gonna play an island. And <gasps> then I'll pass my turn. You're a monster! Ready, Mew? Hey, Johnny. Um, ah. So. Between between Bruce Campbell and uh, how the fuck could I forget his name right now? Jim Carrey. Between Bruce Campbell and Jim Carrey, who do you think is better at contorting their face? No, the real question is who has a bigger jaw? Who has a better chin? Huh. That's what I'm I mean, saying. If, you, if, you, if, you, if the competition is chin, it's Bruce Campbell, hands down. Right. Contortion and, of face? Yeah, I but mean, wait, 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 wait. You can't take anything that happened in the Army of Darkness series, because that was Claymation. <laughs> what? Wait, I'm not, I don't know. Uh, wait, wait, no, no, Evil Dead 2, those little scenes were like, he's just like... Army of Darkness. Yeah, I know about Army of Darkness. That's what I'm saying, that was Claymation. It's your turn. Okay, yeah, but... Uh, by the way, I play Dragon Tempest and Crucible of the Spirit Dragon. All right. That does do things. Um, okay. Yeah, I, think, I think in facial contortion, I think Terry is a bit... He's got... He's more... Sp Rye and agile, like he's got more like I don't know Gumby characteristics going on. I, don't, I would say Jim yeah, Carrey probably has a better face. I'm gonna cycle. Like when it comes to making faces, I think he has more expressions. I suppose, for God Gary. but like Bruce, Bruce is called the fame. Part of it was his chin. I it mean, was think like, about it was like the mask. Chin. Think about yeah, all the facial think expressions in the mask. mask. It's and a then, mask between our uh, and then Cable Guy. Yes. Cable Guy, he did a ton of facial expressions. Also does it. MTG Strategist, what is up? How's it going? If you all missed it, I believe MTG Strategist did the um, get the whole like event thing. Was that yesterday or day before yesterday? Uh, yeah, content creator remember. awards. It was yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday. Okay. Cycling so, uh, Vizier of Trumbling Sands. Go, having a go check what that out. Time? Untapping Command Tower, drawing a card, the encounter on Ominous Seas. Meanwhile, Johnny's just going ham over here. I'm, I'm kind of doing He's a lot ramping. of ramping. Look at that. He is out of control. Someone shut out of control. this man down. Mr. Korpachov, turn. shut this man a down. Monster. <laughs> hey, shut uh, them all down. Since it's your stream, you can gladly say that you totally won a small YouTube audience, and I totally won best mark aftermarket artist. I mean, I'm not going to lie about it. So I think we got the award for best everything. Yeah. I think that seems very accurate. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was an award. <laughs> uh, I, I think it would be, but um, Spice 8-Rack nearly swept the entire show. 
so it's good no i i really like the awards i really like that it gives people an opportunity to have some face time with not just people solely in their community but other communities as well as well and kind of gets everyone kind of in the same space we did the same thing with the content creators reunion had a lot of fun doing that getting people like in like a giant pool to share experiences to talk about things to to kind of allow people to share knowledge and i think the next one we're going to do we're thinking about doing it in six months the next one we're going to do we're going to rotate everybody out so a whole new bit of people we're not looking to see the same people again we want to rotate everything and have people like you know show face in the sweet. community be a participation and in... sweet whose turn is it am i it is beyond's turn okay that was my turn yes sorry yes oh always strategist always uh, we try and be involved in our community as much as we can. Obviously, you know, whenever we have time, but uh, we're huge supporters of everyone in our community. Speaking of which, uh, just, you know what we didn't do, Johnny? Got to get those things. Ooh, yes. No, c continue on. We're just going to turn on some lights. All right. Uh, Raugun Trium enters and tapped. I'm not cycling it right now. And then tapping three for Darksteel Citadel. Or Darksteel Inga. Oop. Disturbator. Yeah, that's my turn. I just I'm just trying to get the manas. And get and get and get it. I'm gonna untap and upkeep and draw. Chewy, punch it. Snap. Do laka baka. Um. <clears throat> I'm gonna play my lanes like a boss, and then uh. I'm not even doing I remember when that song was relevant. <laughs> It was quite a bit a while ago, wasn't it? It was at least ten years ago. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give this a shot. I'm gonna go for it. I'm going for this. I'm gonna go Don't ask do it. her. It's a trap. Don't do it. Here. It's a trap. I'm gonna play my Alela. <gasps> there it is. Gross. Ooh. Commander in the field. Broken. Um, disgusting and broken. <clears throat> not as broken as Corvald. Come on, come on. I'm not drawing mm. cards off my. How's that a selling oh, point? Weeb. That's true. That's like saying, Listen, well, this pistol isn't as broken as a nuke. That is true. Uh, See? <laughs> let me tell you the something. reason with that, Corvold Johnny and Trash Lane, Master. You cannot build suboptimal Corvold and Chulains because they are just draw engines and you just get hated out. This one just, it, it poops Did you out say fairies. you just Big get deal. heated out? Just fairies. Little one ones. Don't, don't forget about it. That's the turn. Forget what, about what, it. There's a... There, well, you see, one fairy is not scary. Two is a little bit annoying, but once you get like six, then it's like, like I'm you know like so, like somebody isn't going to play a wrath at this table, please. I took that out. It was too oppressive. I mean, <laughs> oath to never board wipe ever again. Yeah, I can uh, I can believe that. I consider Brian. putting. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, when's the last time you've seen me legitimately throw down a wrath of God, a damnation, or any board wipe? Good question. <laughs> mm. Oh my I god. Cast I gotta tell you. Um, and you're turning the cycle. Um, Buna the Wishgiver, gonna draw a card. Put a counter here. And then oh. untap and draw for turn. So, my favorite thing is magic players who refuse to swear. That's usually not that bad. It's Fuck a up. personal choice. But, um. <laughs> so, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> not judging, but judging. <laughs> yeah. So, I knew, I knew a magic player who refused to swear ever. But the thing is, he loved playing Bono Black, or he loved playing, like, Black Green. So, and also, he was a wealthier player. So, of course, he could afford a very specific board wipe, but he didn't swear. So, he never called it Damnation. Huh. He called it Darnation or That's Tarnation. <laughs> I love Darnation. Yeah, gosh darn nation! Tectonic reformation gonna cycle it. Hey Squirrels Nest, thank you very much for darn the sub. Nation. Sorry I missed that. Oh fuck me. Oh, oh shit. Man. Fuck me. We're, get, missing, a, get we're missing a land drop. I drew so many cards. Get <laughs> fucked. Missing a land drop. <laughs> Pass and turn. <laughs> hey, fuck you, Brandon. Untap, up keep draw. A Johnny Gay Pride mate, what's up? Hey, what's up? Hello. Johnny Gay Pride By the mate. way, if anyone was interested. We did a uh, Jackbox Games the other day, and a Johnny and his lovely husband uh, was there as well, and we had a great time. It was really fun. Also, such a miss that dude. It was a blast. 
Um, I think we're going to try and do it again. So if you are a patron or you are a supporter, uh, oh. we're going to try and, I think, do it again this next upcoming Friday. Fuck so, yeah. So uh, join us for that. And, uh, yeah. That would be lovely. Yep. Uh, Chasm Skulker. Whenever I draw a card, <clears throat> I put a one on counter on Chasm Skulker. Ooh, I like Chasm Skulker. Skulker. Yeah. Um, Chasm Skulker. Yeah. And then I'm going to pass the turn. All right. That yeah, full untapped. art Thailand is so oh, hot. Yeah. P. Frizz, what's oh, up? Yeah. I so have I had these. Once upon a time, I had considered putting World Purge in this deck, and then I read World Purge and realized that's more annoying than Cyclonic Rift. Well, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. What does World, World, World Purge do? World Purge, it's right here, I wanted to show this one off. Turn all permanents to their owner's hands. Not non-land, all permanents, everything. The whole table everything. goes to your hand, and then you pick seven cards and put the rest into your library. Yeah, so you like, restart pretty much everything. A lot of <laughs> devastating restart. I was like, oh, yeah, no, it's a nope, fucker. I don't, it's a fucker I don't hate card. my friends like that. I'm not <laughs> that guy. Thank so you you're so gonna, much. So you're going to retrace it. He's <laughs> 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 uh, so funny. All right, uh, let's go ahead and... I'm going to laugh. He just plays it right now. <laughs> no, no, I didn't put it in the deck. It's not in the deck. Do it, oh, do it, do it, do it. I would fucking love it. Not... He just top decks it. He's like, I'm going to play it. I need land drops. Uh... <laughs> I'm going to play a Courier's Capsule. I'm going to get a Fairy. Hot. Then I'm going to play Pharaoh's Enlightenment. And when I get the Fairy, I'm going to throw a Pharaoh's Enlightenment back to my hand and put there's a counter right there, so Layla is there. And then, uh... I've got a Pilgrim's Eye that can be a 2-1, and... Excuse me. All day long. All right. Who's gonna be first blood? First right. Brandon, blood. you're 1-2. One, Johnny, you're 3-4. Three, three, I mean, and just Dion, type in, you are five, Just type six. in, like, exclamation mark, space, roll, space, 3. Exclamation mark, roll, space, 3. All right. Brandon, Pilgrim's Eye is coming at you for two. Okay. I take two. All right, and I pass the turn. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Drowl. We're going to put down a Temple of the False Dog. Actually, wait, wait, wait. End of your turn. Put a token on Spirit Dragon. All right, and then now I'm just going to play Temple of... Slight retraction there. <laughs> Sorry. I don't work here. All right, so... I'm then going to tap all of these manas, and I'm going to put down a Mirari's Wake. Wait, is uh, Temple of the False Cost activated yet? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, you, to, you just have to have five lands. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. People crap on Temple all the time, and I'm like... Pass. It's not gotcha. bad. That's fine. It's fine. That's yeah, not that bad. Draw a card, put a counter here. Oh, wait. There's only six numbers on this die. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, we're seven. <laughs> Use one of these infinity tokens. Woo! I'll get a marker for this in a second. I like uh, how he's like, no, fuck that. <laughs> Just a second, I think. No, it's okay. Do. It's okay. Ah. No, no, no. no. It's, apparently, it's not good enough for you. What? Well, I mean, it's not a land, but I have <laughs> an arcane signet, so we'll fucking take it. <laughs> oh, bastard. Sweet. Sorry, someone like messaging me on Discord about a commission, and you know what? I'm not gonna say no. You should you should just tell them to watch MTG Lexicon for your response. Hmm. <laughs> Don't do that. That sounds terrible. Yeah. <laughs> Why would that's a good do way to, that? That's a good way to lose a commission. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so uh, on top of keep. Uh, actually, at the end of your turn, Corrupt, what's before up? untapping, because I realize I have a thing I can do. Uh, at the end of your turn, blue and a one for a words of wisdom. I draw two cards, and everybody else draws a card. Ooh. Ooh. And TG Strategist says you should play EDH with your right hand and do your art with your left. That is sound advice. <laughs> I have, I, I, I have tried, but um, it doesn't end well. Oh, I'm sure it ends perfectly, and that's probably your most valuable work. You really need to put that on the market. Yeah, why nice. are you wasting your time, bro? 
My most valuable work probably <laughs> I have done sitting in nothing but boxer briefs, watching very weird claymation videos, and listening to Tool. Wait, wait, wait. Wallace and Gromit is not weird claymation. No, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not talking about Wallace and Gromit. I'm talking about weirder than that. Chicken Run? Weirder. What? That's talking, talking chickens. Like Vin- you can't get weirder than talking chickens. No, no, no. Oh, Are yeah, you talking no. 1970s claymation? Like off brand cartoon claymation? Coraline? I'm talking <laughs> the adventures of Mark Twain. The adventures what? of Mark Twain. <laughs> what, what was the one of Max and what, what was it? Max and something? That was another good claymation. Oh, oh I know you're talking Mary, about. I think it was Mary Max and Max. Yeah. Mary and Max, yeah. Mary, yeah, also, that movie is actually one. really wholesome. That's one of my favorite movies. I mean, Great. probably the best claymation ever made has got to be Nightmare Before Christmas. It, it doesn't feel like it holds up well, though. I, I tried to rewatch what? it. Are you kidding me? No, I'm not. Dude, I, 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 tried I have recently. that. I have the OST, like, burned in my head. I bet. You know, it's fair. I mean, it's, it's not bad, All right. but it definitely so, didn't feel as good rewatching it. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, that comes up three. I'm going to say in a one for an aid to the gods. I have hex proof. <gasps> Kill him. Sweet. Uh, topping a mountain for a soul ring. It's an Animal Crossing altar, also done by CB Cutie. Beautiful. This is my Animal Crossing deck. I just haven't changed it. See, there's Tom. Mike. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hell there yeah. There you go. Baller. Yeah. I just called uh, weird claymation, and Mark Twain was like number one or two. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah oh. exactly. Then tap four for a font of mythos. At the beginning of each player's draw step, that player draws two additional cards. Sweet. Hmm. Ooh. So you're going to give him an 8 8 giving... squid billy? Eventually. So, so this is. Oh, Jesus. All right. Yeah, but the Adventures of Mark Twain is overall pretty benign, but one scene in the Adventures of Mark Twain is so goddamn fucked up that the rest of the movie is just like, whoa, 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 whoa. let's go back to there, let's talk about that. No, the movie doesn't. It just happens. It's just a weird, it just happens. crazy scene, and then they never reflect on that, they never talk about that. It's like, here's here's this weird shit meter and on with the story. Huh. Alright, so All right. here's, here's the gist of it. Uh, Tom Hawk, Huckleberry Finn, and like uh, another character, forget her name, meet Satan, and then Satan builds like a society, kills the society, and says, "Get fucked." That's the gist of the scene. Doesn't seem like it needs explanation. Seems pretty wholesome. Yeah, there's no I lying in it. Feel like there's a full story arc there. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm fine with that. <laughs> Willy Wonka boat scene. Oh, that's the best. A goose, goose. Oh, yeah. I just love how he falls in and gets sucked into the like the thing. A goose, goose, no. <laughs> and he's just like, he's like now like a, I don't want to yeah. say a, yes. a cork. But. <laughs> I, put, I, put the, I put the link to the scene in, uh, I put the link to the scene in chat. It, it is that weird. Now I got to watch it. <sighs> Turn is it? It's Johnny's turn, right? Yeah, I, I, I played a are. I played a Phantom Mythos and the, called it. Okay. Oh, I didn't realize you passed the turn. I'm sorry. I'm here. I here I am holding. You are drawing up. I draw two cards. cards. I'm drawing with two cards, right? So three, three cards draw. total. Yes. Oh wait, I draw two additional. Yes. Yes. You are a yes. madman. Good God! All right. This is group hug. Madman. Monster. <laughs> You mean there's an Applebee award? Huh. Yes. Yes. Okay. 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 What was the other one? Looking good. My man. Uh, my man. Huh? <laughs> yes. The video, not group hug. <laughs> Corrupt, gonna... what's up, baby? I want to play Ethereum sculpture. <laughs> I told you it was weird. My token. <laughs> There's Ethereum sculpture. All my artifacts cost one less, and then I can oh, hell get the yeah. crap out of my hand. I'm gonna play with this count. I'm gonna play a guild globe. I'm. Oh. I'm sorry. Alayla really is, is a. 
she's broken. She's the she's the worst. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> MTG strategy. Give me one second. I can, I can help with that a little bit. I've done claymation a long time ago, but uh, I, one of my like in development projects is a claymation thing. So I can I can probably do a short though it'll take a very long time. I got a fresh. All right. Um, Johnny, yeah, I'm gonna do. I think I left my phone in your I'm sacking the globe, getting my two mana. Then I'm gonna go ahead and say, we'll wait here. Uh, Maybe Monson? not a whole presentation. Okay. So I'm casting Champion of the Helm. I'm going to equip that to Alela. And that's a... One of those. Jesus. I'm going to also play a Dispeller's Capsule. Then Ooh. bring another one of those. Jesus. All right. Anything horrible happen? No. Uh, I'm, apparently, I didn't... I didn't know this was going to do this... So this is holy crap. Okay, so I'm gonna go after Johnny for two with the Pilgrim's Eye, and beyond, I gotta come at you for four, cause this is madness. Okay. Uh, for four, I'll take four. Wow. Oh. Oh no, my butthole. What a problem. Wow. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, oh no. god. <laughs> and I have seven <laughs> cards. Okay. Good. If you do a presentation that doesn't have Satan in it, I'll put it in. That's great. Now I kind of want to put Satan in it. So how thick is that Alila right now? Alila is currently a 3-4 uh, becomes a 5-6. It was a 5-6. Gotcha, gotcha. Stronk. Proof legendary. Okay, yeah. All right. I'm, bar I'm uh, buying Brand some time because he's going to my car to find his phone very quickly. Boo. So we'll be back in a couple seconds. But in the meantime, feel free to talk as much shit as you want. <laughs> Speaking of. Speaking huh? of. Oh, I don't think I. This is. Uh, I'm. I'm happy with what. A, I like playing the aggro style. So now that I've got an Esper deck that I can make this little swarm of n maddening marauding fairies, I'm okay with that. They are pretty gross. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty. I, I'm like no infinite loop combos. I can do that. No problem. This is fine. This everything will be so fine. So you're swinging at me? Nope. Oh. No, I uh, sent now. two to Johnny <laughs> and I sent four to Beyond. It is your turn to. I'm gonna do an MTG rated claymation. Time. Ooh. Slap those dragons, Brandon. One minute. Slap them on the table. Takes about a week to shoot. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of crazy stuff about that. Okay, untap, upkeep, drow. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Um. Look, I'm. I'm gonna be honest. Uh, look, J Dog. What are you going to do with that giant squid billy? Fucking try to survive. <laughs> what if I make it easier for you to survive? I would appreciate that. Are you going to swing what? the squid billy at me? No. How about you? I have incentive how about not you? to. You. What? How do you have a squid billy? I have a squid. Well, no. He's going to have a bigger, thicker squid billy at the beginning of his thick turn. Squid. Oh, yeah. I'm supposed to draw three cards. Mad, two more. mad thick. Mad thick. Like... A thickness I don't think you understand. Okay. Uh, Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah, baby. All right. So what's happening? Okay, so uh, we're going to tap this and remove a counter, and we're going to make two black because of Mario's Wake. Ooh. Oh. Uh, okay. And we're going to tap three. 
four five with one left over. Mm. And we're going to play Deathbringer Regent. Flying, when Deathbringer Regent enters the battlefield, if you cast it from your hand, and there are five or more other creatures on the battlefield, destroy all other creatures. Ooh. Sweet. Sweet! I am. <clears throat> so... Oh, shoot. That just... That does it. I'm thing. okay with this. I you see know, this as an absolute win. You know, after you mentioned that you didn't have any board wipes in your decks, I was not expecting this. This is, this is a very pleasant surprise. It's not a board wipe. It's a creature. <laughs> All right. 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 I see how you whisper yourself to sleep with those sweet, sweet little <laughs> collective lies. It's okay, Deathbring. Deathbring a region. You're not a board wipe. You and what I should have done, can. because I'm an idiot... I should have played Sarkhan's Unsealing first and Dragon Horde first before I played Deathbringer Regent. I'm going to pass. That would have been smart. What? No. Oh, wait, 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 wait. 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 Yes. I can smell it. Uh, wait. I'm going to swing at Johnny the Trash Master for six. Oh, yeah, it's haste. And I'm going to deal one damage to Johnny the Trash Master's face. Wait, which, who's the tra which one's the Trash Master? Am I the Trash Master? You oh, are the yeah, trash baby. master. It looks like. I think I'm the trash master. I guess I'm taking. I'm blocking with my face. Nice, smart move. So that's uh, six total. Six total. Oh, seven. Sorry, seven. Because of the one from uh, Dragon Tempest. Yes. I can change so, your name if you want. I pay, I put you as trash master from the last time you were here on a Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, that's going on. I'm gonna draw some cards and put some counters on things. Nah, it works. It works. Okay, yeah. You know, just let me know if you ever want to change it. I'm happy to change it for you. I know I was Wasp Whisperer. I'll be Trash Master. I think that is that is that because of the the Grumgully deck I went and pulled the whole. Um, yep. That was pretty funny aggro. though. That was some. That was some good aggro. I had fun with that. I that truly, was a lot of fun. I truly believe. I no. I truly cannot believe. I'm not drawing lands right now this is ridiculous i thought you were gonna say it's not butter it's it's not butter i can't, I can't believe it's not butter it's practically a land cannot believe it one two three four five uh... okay i got five mana but what do we do with it i've got five on it five on it I'm just gonna sit here and drink my balls Smart move. Good, good for you, bud. Good for you. I'm proud of you. All right, I'm going to. It's good balls. I'm gonna cast a chasm skulker. Ooh. I believe. By the way, beyond, I believe you get three squid billies. They're right there. Don't forget, Johnny, to draw Jeez. three total. I did. Okay, good. Uh, so I'm chasm skulker, and then. For two, I'll cast a Cryptic Trilobite. Uh, Ooh, so what is that? Comes into the battlefield with X11 counters, which is going to be one. Uh, remove a 1-1 counter to add two colorless to my mana pool. I can spend this mana only to activate abilities. And one and tap it to put a 1-1 counter on it. Uh, Fascinating. Right. I like that. Okay, going to go to end of turn, discard down to seven. I'm going to discard a what? Crystalline Resonance. You're having land issues and not Pass Brandon? Turn. Brandon, which god did you blow before the stream? Dude, I blew all the gods before the stream. That's the only way I get Every mana. One. Yeah. And if I'm sloppy <laughs> on one of them, it just cascades all the way down, and then I just get no mana. Mm -hmm. That's how it works. <laughs> Some would say it's a mouthful, but I say oh, yeah. it's just dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's terrible. I can't believe it's not Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> it spreads uh, on smooth and goes on thick. I want to play Gyrate Sanitarium. Uh, Gyrate Sanitarium, it, I can tap for colorless, or I can tap two and tap it. Each player draws a card, then discards a card. It is a lovely altar done by my good Ooh. friend, Mike Sod, of that playing nice. with power. Or at Invocate on Twitter, but the I is a one, so at a one Vocate. What Vocate? I love it. It's it's invocate, but the I is a one. Thank I don't know how to like verbally say that other than like it's invocate, but with an I. With you a, just say one one vocate. One vocate. At least it's in English for you. 
<laughs> yeah, are you going to read is... that Italian card? <laughs> what? I don't have any Italian cards. Uh-huh. <laughs> what, what does it even say? Does it say pacifism? That's not even Italian. God. <laughs> How Italian are you? I know. I, I think that was a horrible French impersonation. I'm sorry. I apologize to the full country. <laughs> I apologize to France. You've like insulted two countries at the same time. Pretty impressive, Brandon. <laughs> we got to hit right. some GTFO um, soon. Hell yeah. Um, what if uh, red, blue, Story. white, and soaring for a one? How about colorless floating? Play it, Zedru. Oh. Uh, Kill him. <laughs> <laughs> Yoda, kinky you are. Mm. What was that? Uh, there was that Dave Chappelle episode where it's like Yoda getting busted for like child or underage. Do you remember that on Dave Chappelle? I don't remember no, that. I missed that one. Uh, we're 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 all friends here, right? No, uh, we're all lovers. Well, okay, well oh, then he's made the decision. <laughs> Uh, blue, a colorless, and a colorless for a back to basics. Wait. Oh, you wait, wait, fucker. Wait, 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 wait. What is back to basics? Oh, God. Uh, Non-basics don't untap. It's an enchantment, right? Yes, it is. You absolute fucker. Okie dokie. Non-basics. And this is okay, not, okay, wait, this wait. This is how you die. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. The first person to get rid of non-basics, I will punch in the face beyond for as hard as i can the first person that gets a non base that gets rid of that shit i will happily leave you for last and punch this man directly in the face hey i asked if we wanted to be friends here and you and said i said no. no we're lovers which is definitely a lot better yes. than friends you said no it's, a, it's it's at least three steps up i cannot believe Easily. this it's okay. It looks like I get to win that bet. <laughs> so anyway, played back uh, the basics into my dispellers capsule. I'm fine with that. It's okay. Yo, you're you're you're, you're you're go you're go, Mr. Mole again. Uh, Johnny, you only okay. have two usable lands. I have three basic lands. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, sorry, three. Wah. My nuts have been capped. So back to basics is uh what's the what's the deal? So un- non basics have to stay tapped, and then and am I still drawing the three cards? Yeah, yeah, That's you're still, still drawing on. three cards. Drawing three cards. Mm. And non basics don't on top. <laughs> right. That's it. All right. Well, this jacks up everything. It's it, it's all um. It's all not your fault. <laughs> <sighs> all right, we're gonna dispel this capsule and get rid of the uh, back to basics. Fuck yeah! I am gonna punch this man in the face as hard as I can, and Johnny, what I will is, save you for last. Is, now I have to do. Dispel this cap. It's it's disenchanted on a stick, so I pay two oh, and good. a white. It's a one one white mana artifact, so. Pay two and a white sack tap sacrifice the capsule destroy target artifact or enchantment. Oh yeah, well, yeah, that's that's good. You yeah, can well, thank Charge of Alara. Yeah, yeah, that's a thing. You got. Yeah. Did you just that's do the, the Chuck Norris like thumbs up? Yeah. <laughs> what? Sorry, jo- Johnny. Johnny did the Chuck Norris thumbs up. <laughs> now I have to discard stuff out of my hand, and that makes me sad. Okay. Brandon, can you see my 36 month sub? Hell yeah. That is true, big dick energy, corrupt helix. True, big dick energy. The biggest of dick energies. <laughs> uh, are you done, Johnny? I am done, yes. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Draw one, two, three. I'm going to put down a command to weir. And we are going to persist to punch dick and face simultaneously all right what are you doing over there 
Hey, that's the combo to my luggage. <laughs> okay. All right. Did I think this. Works. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. I think this works out the way I want it to. Okay. So I'm gonna tap 15 mana. Zoics. Actually, we'll go like this, because that'll leave me one floating to put a counter on the spirit dragon. Okay, we're gonna play Dragon Lord Dramoka. Cannot be Ooh. countered. Flying, lifelink. Your your opponents can't cast spells during your turn. Sweet. Uh, Sarkin's Unsealing. I will deal four damage to your Zedru, right? Because it's only got four toughness. Yes. Okay, Zedru's dead. Dragon Tempest Trigger. I've got two dragons at the moment. I'm going to deal two damage to your face beyond. Uh, yeah, I'm going to take in two damage. John A. I'm then going to play the Ur Dragon. Sarkin's Unsealing triggers for a seven or greater. And it's going to deal four damage to each opponent and each creature and planeswalker they control. Whack. All right. So, squidbillies are gone. All the squids are gone. Bummer. Dragon Tempest trigger. One, two, three. I'm going to deal three damage to Beyond's face. Ow. Oh, no. Wow. All right. I am then going to go to combat. I'm going to swing at Beyond for 20 uh, wait, 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 let me do this right. I'm going to swing at Beyond for 22, Commander. Six. Holy shit. <laughs> and Jesus. 12. So I'm swinging at you for 38. 22 yeah, is Commander. I'm just fucking dead. Wait, you're, Attack you're, trigger. Commander has double strike? Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry, not 22. Woo! <laughs> Wrong card. I'm swinging at you for 11. I don't know why I thought I had the other commander. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so 11 commander and 12. There you go. Okay. So 11 and 12. Yeah, so it's 20. 23. 23. So 23 total, 11 of which is commander damage. Sorry, upon attacks, I have an Ur Dragon trigger, three dragons. So I'm going to draw three cards. And I get to put a permanent from among them onto the battlefield. Um. We're going to put down, sure. I'm at three. Okay, we're going to put down Scourge of Valaketh. One, two, three, four dragons. I'm going to deal four damage to your face. I'm at negative one. All right. Well, that happened. (laughs) Uh, End of turn, take off eight counters, make a squid. Or a kraken, rather. Then I'll untap. Oh, God. <laughs> I um, love Magic the Gathering. We, we love Magic <laughs> the Gathering. <laughs> well, there uh, goes all my card draw. Hey, Corrupt Helix, I saw your message. Uh, yeah, I'll definitely send them uh, your regards. They're good friends of mine. And they uh, one of Some of them live down the road from me, and I've met up with them multiple times. They're super awesome. And they were doing a stream with Mana Curves earlier, oh, and it was god. really enjoyable when I watched most of it. Oh god, horrible things are happening. Well, I'm gonna die very quickly. I don't even, I don't really know what the fuck to do. Oh god. <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> let's just see, shall we? One, two, three, four, five, six. So many dragons. What, what have I done? <laughs> horrible things have happened. Uh, this is all my fault. <laughs> Yes. Anyways, I'm casting News Perspective. I'm going to draw three cards. As long as I have seven more cards in hand, I'm going to pay zero rather than pay cycling costs. I'm going to draw three. Get three counters here. Oh, please. Uh, Cycle, crystal, draw a card, get a counter. Oh. Cycle for sick the worldly. Worldly, draw a card, get a counter. Let's just keep on dirtling. We can do it. Okay, cycle, decree of justice. Counter, draw a card. Cycle, lonely sandbar. Do the same last shit. 
We're just cycling. Okay. We're just spinning our motors Sorry, trying to do nothing. Dude, I told you not we, to play we, back to basics. Alright, move to combat. I said our Swing I said our refers, but you said no. Uh I'll chump block. Okay. Oh wait, 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 wait. <laughs> it doesn't have haste. Uh well I did it at the end of your turn. Oh I missed that. How much life do you have? Uh thirty eight. Thirty eight. How much mana do you have available? None now. I'll take it. Okay. I will play a prairie stream in. Uh tapped. And I guess I passed the t turn. Yeah. Okay. I'm passing. <laughs> okay. Discarding down. Three day we're passing. Discarding. So we're not drawing we're only drawing one card. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, uh, you, you can you can um thank Brandon for that. Uh mm -hmm. excuse me, sir. I said that we're better than friends. I said we're lovers, and you persisted to play a back to basics. <laughs> I just want to Those point that thoughts. out. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I refuse I wanna, to I accept wanna, this reality. All right, I want to sacrifice my courier's capsule, capsule to draw two cards. See what happens. Uh, <clears throat> good God. No one respects the fun place. <laughs> I want to right, gain one life with my, my scoured barons. Hell and then, yeah. Uh, He's a loo. All right. I mean, what? What are you gonna play, Johnny? What do you mean? No, not you. Oh. The other, okay. the other Johnny. Come on. Oh. <laughs> um. Jesus, Tina, you what? fat lord. Uh, let's go. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to be this. And then what's the biggest, scariest thing over there? Is it uh, my commander? My my commander. It's a 10-10. Uh, it gets plus one, plus one from Marari's Wake. So it's an 11-11. Oh, and it also gives good. me the biggest ability buff, which is uh, whenever it attacks, I may draw X cards where X is the number of dragons, and then I may put a permanent from my hand on the battlefield. Okay. Uh, that's pretty bananas. I I'm going to go with B I'm gonna go with tried and true. An old happy. I'm gonna play Oblivion Ring and I'm gonna target Ur Dragon. Smart. Because we still have a whole Smart. lot of other board state there. Yep. I know you're saving me for last, but jeez, it's not gonna be long. <laughs> Are you done? Yes, that's my turn. Alright, untap. Upkeep draw. God, I gotta pitch. Put down again. a planes. And so we're gonna tap one, two, three. Four. So that's two, five, six, seven. I'm going to have one floating. I'm going to play Lathis, Dragon Queen. Whenever a non-token dragon enters the battlefield under your control, create a 5-5 five, five red dragon creature token with flying. One red, Oof. one other. Dragons you control get plus one, plus oh. So it's fire breathing, except for it's all dragons get it. All right, I'm then going to persist to tap... Uh, Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Play Kindred Summons. Uh, before I do that, though, Lathis Dragon Queen, Tempest Trigger, one, two, three, four. We're going to do four to Johnny's face. You two decide which Johnny that is. <laughs> well, uh, I don't know, Johnny. I think since you got 38 and I got 34, it seems... Sure. Fair, but I don't have control over the actual like buttons. Fair. And then let's be fair <laughs> about this. I've got a Scourge of Valakis, so I'm going to deal four more damage to somebody else as well. You two figure it out. I guess it's my turn. Okay. All right, then I'm going to play one. Kindred Summons. I have one, two, three, four dragons. I'm going to reveal the top cards of my library until I reveal X being the number of creatures of that chosen creature type, which is dragons. So I'm going to reveal four dragons off oh, the no. top. We've got uh, the Victus Osmati. We're just dead, aren't we? Yes. I think we're just dead. We've yeah, got Ojitai, think... Soul of Cold. Teneb, <laughs> the Harvestier. And we've got Atarka. Yep, that's game. Yep. Oh my god, yeah. Okay, let's... All right, yeah, we're just going that one up. <laughs> and they're that's all going to observe each other coming in, so 
Uh, Dragon Tempest, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight dragons. Stop, stop, he's already dead. <laughs> and that's eight, one, two, three, four times. It's and then I'm gonna make uh, Lathis Dragon Queen is gonna trigger four tokens. Uh, so those four tokens are gonna come in and trigger Dragon Tempest. And then the Scourge of Alicus triggers are gonna go on for the, and it just says another dragon. So for the tokens as well, for each one coming from Lathis Queen. And then they all have haste, and so uh, they're all going to swing, and then Atarka gives them double strike. Uh, we've got Victus, and that should be extra. And then all of them trigger Sarkin's Unsealing, which will do an additional four damage for each one of the non... Oh, it doesn't even say to token or not, so that's another eight times yeah, four. Yeah, you, you see, Brandon... Um <laughs> In in America, public masturbation is is usually <laughs> frowned upon. <laughs> 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 hey, wait, I came in here for some casual commander, not some like uber casual commander. <laughs> you you guys let him live. Don't, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't think I don't think I know you well enough for like fucking strip magic, bud. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Show me it. What was it? Uh, Oh, ding dong, ooh la la la. Ding dong, ooh la la la. Oh, you're talking about the Gunther song. Yeah. <laughs> you touch my ooh la la. No, my tra la la. Your tra la la. You touch my tra la la. My ding, ding dong. Ding dong. <laughs> oh, Gunther. <laughs> Magical person. All right. We're going to pay out our winners. Yeah. Uh, I know what deck I'm playing, but while you guys decide and get that set up, um, I'm going to go cut that brisket. Right oh yeah, I had I told mm, Tamara to, to buy some rice at uh, Panda, so there should be some rice for us. I don't know how much she bought. So, all right, well that was fun. Uh, I'm sorry, I used dragons to beat everyone's face in. Um, I was really expecting a board wipe to happen, to slow me down. Um, I was for one, eh, it didn't happen. It's fine. I had a fine, really good start though for this deck. Um, which was nice, so it was appreciated. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and get started on the next game. That was actually pretty quick. That was under two hours for us. Wow. Yeah, it was yeah. like an hour wow. 15, less than, even less than that. I think it was less than I was 45. Shocked. I, was, I was shocked, Literally, legit shocked. Legit shocked, yeah, because we started at like, what, 6.30, legit right? 6.30? Yeah. Wait, no, no, no. Closer seven. to seven. We started at seven. Yeah. And then we didn't get the first game off until like seven twenty, right? Oh shit! Less than an hour. We did this in less than an hour. I know. That's what I'm saying. Like, this is an achievement for us. Record set. If I knew we were playing this level of casual, I would have brought something out. Oh my god! Come on. <laughs> this has one purpose in its life, okay? And it gets it gets stomped out quite often. <laughs> I think, yeah. All right, so yeah. thank you very much for everyone who's joined us thus far. We are MTG Lexicon, the dive bar of EDH. We're going to get started on the next game. Right now, I'm going to put a poll up on the screen for you. That's going to be the decks that I have, and we're going to vote on which deck you would like to see me play with next. So really quick, I'm going to go through the decks. We've got Jalera, which... Master Poly Stuffist, Mono Blue, Big Cheaty Things. We've got Zur, the best creature and commander on the planet. They say the only game that people win is in Zur because we win in our hearts. Daxus, The Return to Did, Orzov Control. We've got Mizix. Is it asshole or is it not asshole? <laughs> and then we've got. Reaper King, 26 Changelings, and a bunch of Lords to just add to the shenanigans of a tribal tribal deck. By the way, I made this before Morphon ever came out and was a thing, so this deck is a lot of fun, a lot of crazy inter interactions. I don't think I've legitimately ever won with this deck as, like, I feel like I've I won wonder, accidentally, if that makes sense. I wonder how that feels like. Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> just... You know, accidentally, someone just opens the door for me, and I'm like that dog that just never sees the light of day. I just like, Poof. somehow I, <laughs> I went through that open door. I believe I can fly. Yeah, yeah something like that. Uh, okay. Um, did you add Obelette, Brandon? I did not. Oubliette. 
Oob omelet. I did not add omelet. Oobly omelet. I think people pick Daxus because you will lose. The funny thing is, though, my Daxus slaps. The, uh, everyone just like misgages my my Daxus like completely, and I just go through and I just backhand people with Daxus, and no one sees it coming. The fact that I've been able to mill people with Daxus is an even bigger feat of a. That's hilarious. <laughs> You're watching me draw cut out. Oh, sorry, sorry. Hey, we can, I, we can go back to it. We can go back to it. Just go ahead, continue. Just continue. I want to pick Daxus because he's my husbando. Hell yeah. Husbando. That, that's uh, cold Daxus, as uh, as Davey likes to call it. We can see you taking the picture, Beyond. I know. It's, it's <laughs> someone... A very a very good friend of mine runs a primarily like D and D server, and someone's like, "Can someone draw me a weapon?" And I'm like, "I need to practice drawing weapons, so I'll draw a weapon." And then they're like, "Here's a scythe. It's a death scythe. Can you draw in blue?" Oh, uh, you know what you should have said? Here's a death scythe, and then you should have drawn the Gundam Wing death scythe. I don't watch Gundam Wing. <gasps> Uh, somewhere around like Blue's Clues and Bionicle, about there. Oh man! And then, de- then <laughs> wait, the Gundam Wing was right in that time. What happened? You have no excuse, sir. Also, my mom thought Here's anime was I satanic. No yeah, my mom thought anime was satanic, and uh, I what? was actively. Yeah, no, I I actively got like corporal punished, I guess for watching a lot of Japanese media. So she also thought SpongeBob would make me mentally handicapped. <laughs> Does it not? That's not the word she used. She used a way worse word to describe what SpongeBob would make me. Canadian? <laughs> no. I can't think of a harsher word. So I never I never watched SpongeBob, I didn't watch a whole lot of Japanese media, but, uh, so, yeah, no, I didn't watch Gundam Wing at the time. It was humorous is a friend of mine, uh, when I turned, like, eight, got me, like, a, a figurine from, like, the shittiest Gundam show, where, like, they're all chibi, whatever, and I had no idea what it was or what it meant other than they had, like, a cool gun, <laughs> so... I had just have, like, this, like, Captain Gundam figurine somewhere in my house... Just, just there. That's funny. <laughs> That's great. All right, so it looks like I'm going to be playing with Daxus, a.k.a. Cold Daxus, as Davey likes to call it. So I'm going to go ahead and load that up. Johnny is currently cutting up a brisket. Who wants to see this brisket being cut? I you would be for it. to cut up brisket, I'm, I'm, yeah. We'll take some food porn. Okay, let me see if I can make this work. <laughs> I'm gonna see if we can do the briscot cam. Briscot cam. <laughs> briscot cam. I'm gonna bust out my Alessia who smiles at death. Is I like that uh, deck. I'm, okay. I'm Lightning Q. So, I am not a weeb. My fiance, on the other hand, very much so is. It is, um, it is, it is definitely a thing. Oh, brisket cam, that's that's cooler. Smoky is good though. I got all the way over here to do the brisket cam and now I can't even do it. <laughs> Slipped away in his little cave. <laughs> I can hear it. Right, let's go back. Yeah, that, that was uh. Sad and upset. Listen to it. Okay, Samurai Dance rules. L- hear me out, bud. I really don't watch a whole lot of anime. I just I don't. walked in there and. He was walking out with the brisket, and I guess the best thing I can do is just show you the brisket. I was going to give you the brisket Showing cam, it. but Johnny ruined it. Yeah, that's so, what I do. So, 
so jealous. It smells really good. Right. Mm, it looks good. really good. Just put it in your mouth. <laughs> it's our first time smoking a brisket, so we want to see how it turns out. Uh, oh, my ear holes. Hey, Roger, what's up? Uh, <laughs> do you watch anime? I do. I'm in. I'm a straight up anime nerd. I watch so much anime. I literally probably could explode from anime. I'm on the cusp. <laughs> well, here's a question. Absolutely not never. Do I'm you have anime it. titties? Of course. Look at these I anime know. titties. Look at these. Mm-hmm. I know someone who has anime titties for the reels. Wow. Now those I will watch. <laughs> No, you will not. That's my wife, you bastard. <laughs> that was bait. Total bait. Damn, he I'm fell cool, for it. man. Got him. All right, cool. So we're going to uh, shuffle up with the brisket and um, hopefully get ready for this next game. Again, thank you very much, everyone who's watched us thus far. We are MTG Lexicon. I'm going to do what we normally do when we try and buy time. I'm going to tell you a little bit about a little place called Flipside Gaming. It's on the, the, the hidden treasure trove of what people know as buying shit. <laughs> you can use the code Lexicon at checkout and save 10% off on purchases, $10 or more, excluding Warhammer stuff and things. That's right, you can save 10% off. Let's say you're looking for that new Double Masters. You can use our code and you pretty much save the entirety of shipping. Uh, on that, which is which is actually kind of cool, a lot of fun, uh, and in some cases you'd save like taxes depending on how big the order is. So definitely head over to FlipsideGaming.com and check that out. Oh yeah. As well as, in case you guys missed it, we have some house rules here at MTG Lexicon. To go over them really quick, we'll start with the one they call number Juan. No turn four or earlier wins. We originally did this to uh, discourage, I think is a good word, people from playing yeah. Flash Hulk. Um, well, good, good thing good thing I died on turn five. Right. <laughs> Wait, that was turn five? What? It was turn five or six, yeah. It couldn't have been turn five. What? It was turn oh five God. or turn six. Oh. That sounds uh, about right. Yeah, see, I, but no, no, wait, was, to, be, to be fair... I to did board fat. wipe, to be fat. and then there was a turn to after the board wipe before I went ham, and so to, rudely to threw fat. pineapple at your face. <laughs> to be fair, <laughs> to be fair. Uh, so yeah, number one is to discourage the use of um, like CEDHX and stuff like that, and give people a chance to respond and do stuff before the coming. <laughs> Uh, number two, no infinite combos. If you are running infinite combos in your deck, you get three iterations of a single infinite combo, and that is it. Afterwards, if you continue to keep going, we will persist to break your legs and leave you outside. Number three, no mass land destruction. No one wants to watch the game start over on turn 25, back to square one. So typically, if you can mass land D and win the turn after, that is acceptable. If you cannot win two turns after, we break your legs and we leave you outside. Number four, mulligan until you get a keepable hand. Do not abuse it. That is right. We do not want you to start the game with four or five cards because you got a shitty hand. It sucks. Uh, we are a casual stream and we play casually. So we want to have you at least have a keepable hand. We're not looking for you to have like a god hand or the hand that defines the deck. You know, We're looking for you to at least have fun, have something enjoyable, and you know, be happy with the deck that you're playing with. That is about it for our house rules. I think I bought enough time for us. So we're going to go back over to... Oh, Johnny. Oh. Johnny. Did you change your mat? Eh? Yes. Wow. I. Yeah. It's so pretty. You know, what's humorous is I make Magic the Gathering play much. I don't actually own one of my own. I just, I just don't. I mean, it's smart. You don't you don't snuff your own product, right? Uh, well, I mean, I kind of wish it do. They do smell quite nice. <laughs> I, have, I, have, I have had some of my own, but then I went on to sell it or give it away. No. Oh. Seems, seems reasonable. It's fair. For everyone else here, please go check out Beyond the Machina's stuff and things. You can check them out on Inked Gaming over at Alters. What? Sorry, Altered Sleeves. And Alters. he does 
a bunch of his own tokens as well. A lot of fun. Absolutely love them. We have some here. We've got like the zombie one. We've got I think we got another one. I think it's like an angel or something. I can't remember what it was. He hooked me up with uh, Mercer uh, and zombie um, There, there oh, it yeah. was, yeah. Yeah. Did I send you did I send you all Kalia? Um, I don't think so. Okay. I know I'm going to send you guys a bunch more after I do like my next really big print run. I just haven't decided what yet. Hell yeah. All right. So we're going to get into the next round. Uh, let's see who is going first. This is a good brisket. I'm glad you like it. It's my first time cooking one, so I'm glad it turned out okay. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, weird. I will keep this. Uh, hmm. <clears throat> no response from. Oh yeah, no, I'm keeping my hand. It's it's good. No, it's just really weird. No response I... from MTG bot. Oh. I mean, I can I can roll a d6 uh, more time. No, it's fine. We'll just give it a minute. Also, uh, Polly went down, and uh, so did a, our chat room connection keeps going down. Hmm. Um, I'm wondering if one of the major uh, server clusters has gone out for like Cloudflare or something again. Uh, maybe. Possibly. Well, at least I guess I have more time to eat. Right. I love it. That'd be a reason. <laughs> I ain't gonna why about like this. my stream connection wasn't so good. I need to get some food after the stream. Oh yeah, I, it was really good, Johnny. I had, a, I had a bunch of peaches, like farm fresh peaches. I got a farmer's market at like at like seven. I had a bunch of peaches at seven, but it is now so seven where I am. It's eleven thirty where I am, so uh, that's when I left. It was seven. Yeah. Oh, you're that's pretty extreme. Too. All right. Yeah. Five and six so, are rerolls. Okay. Player three. Oh, you already went. Fuck that. Rerolling. <laughs> Rigged. Player one. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Sounds good. All right, we're gonna take a look if we are keeping. I know I am. But what I about my hand? Were amazing and yeah. But I cut them up. I made myself a cocktail. Had a cocktail. Had some peaches. It's not a bad. Hand. That Definitely sounds great. Usable. Okay, I can yeah. I can live with this. All right, all right, all right, all right, I got it. Okay, all right. So as per usual, we're gonna go around the table. We're gonna describe our decks, introduce ourselves, and shameless plugs, if you would please. And don't forget oh. to read off a lore off your card. All right, I'm player one, a horse by the deluxe, Johnny. Um, I'll be playing Thrasios, Triton Hero, and Kaidel, Chosen of Crew Fix. Uh, draw cards, okay. do simic things. Okay, 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 wh what do we read? Um, if that brain can't figure out the secret of the serum, then add more brains. Ramir, Hand of the Augur. Uh, I gotta go to the restroom, and I'll be right back. Anyways, what, what, what? what? Oh, that was yes. a hell of a flavor text. Here you go, right? <laughs> it was weird that someone would say that on a card. Ooh. I know. Beyond, you go. <laughs> what is it, like amateur auteur? That sounds like an amateur auteur flavor text. I know, whose go is it? Uh, it's I think yours, it's so go ahead and introduce yourself. Oh, yes, hi. Hi, I am Drew, also known as Beyond the Machina. You can find me on Twitter at Beyond the Machina. There's no E in the the. Uh, or on Ink Gaming at inkgaming.com slash Beyond the Machina. This time with an E in the the. Uh, you can use the code Lexicon10 to get 10% off your order. Aww. I have a bunch of new play mats on there. I submitted it like a month ago. Yeah. And I also uh, make Ultra Sleeves, which you can find on Ultra Sleeves. And if you just go to like their Ultras, I'm like right near the top because it's alphabetical. So it's A, B. I think there it is. And uh, recently I've also been making a lot of uh, proxies, which I do not sell proxies legally cannot sell proxies and do not sell proxies but i make these and give them out to friends or on giveaways for people who are patreons and so here's a brainstorm buying brandon uh buying horse father some time Ooh, brainstorm, nice. which I'm very proud of ad nauseum which 
is, I, is one of my personal favorites. Let's see if we can zoom in a little bit better. Are you going to play back to basics this game? I'm just curious. Uh, I had no problems with <laughs> And then N2. <laughs> yeah. And uh, for something really spooky, let's see if I can actually pull this off. I'll show you the actual physical artwork for my uh, brainstorm. There's the actual artwork for Brainstorm, just kind of vibing. Ooh, I like it. That is yeah. hot. Oh, snap. So How much for the original? Uh, 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 I haven't decided yet. The originals, I try not to give away because I like them. Though a few choice originals I have given to the people who suggested them. Or as, like, surprise gifts. So the only originals that are out are my Time Twister Paradox, which is in the hands of my friend Walter. No, that's the original. My um, Spike Feeder one, which is currently in the mail to the Spike Feeders. And... Um, oh, man. I feel so happy right now. There's a few others I can't think about. Nice. Johnny put some sleeves on. Oh, yeah. I left my sleeves at home. I'm sorry. But yeah, you guys can also find Free me on Patreon arms. at Patreon slash Beyond the Machina. And yeah, it's the best place to see all the stuff I'm working on as I'm working on it. I'm a bit lethargic just because of work. But I try to get stuff done pretty regularly. And I work with a lot of content creators like Beyond the Machina. Well, I work with myself. But I work with uh, MTG Lexicon, Playing With Power, Spike Feeders, Mana Curves. And I'm friends with most Alterist. Hot. We yeah, like that Beyond and, the Machina guy, too. Yes. Yeah. And uh, your go. Now that I've shilled a bunch. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. So I'm uh, Johnny the Trash Master Mulligans. <laughs> I lurk and linger around the Lexicon Discord and occasionally show up uh, with John Dunning over at They Said We Said doing some movie review. We, we watch bad movies, and we'll be watching more bad movies trying to justify their existence. In some form or fashion. Hey, what's why, why what's they're the not worst bad. movie in your opinion? Samurai Cop. So far, Samurai Cop. I that is pretty bad. Like, uh, Evan Boy, very, Evan Boy very held the crap, held that seat for a while, but like last week, I sat down. I was watching Lexicon stream and Samurai Cop. By the way, Samurai Cop with Lexicon dubbed over worked really good, uh, but <laughs> it's um. Anything dubbed over Samurai you know, Cop. That's actually a, <laughs> that's not the first yeah, time I've is, heard that. I heard it was kind of like uh, you know Dark Side of the Moon, Wizard of Oz kind of deal. If you play Lexicon yeah. over Samurai Cop, it syncs perfectly. It it synced up just fine, and I got through most of it, and need to go back. <laughs> <laughs> I like I said most of it. I mean, it's true. It's just like <laughs> it's it's like the same repetition over and over. This. I it's like, I get, oh, it's so painful. I told it's okay, you. no need to relive the pain. It will break that record. It's gonna happen. We're gonna figure it out. We'll like do like a private in the Discord kind of like live stream of me gluing my eyeballs to this atrocity of a movie. Like, what's it? Fifty six minutes? Oh, God. It was it was in the forties, dude. Like uh, no one lives <laughs> I, that long. <laughs> I can get there. I can hold it. I can hold off on the booze. I can make it. We can make this happen. We gotta. What we gotta do is we gotta put you in a rocket and shoot you into space. <laughs> <laughs> With a couple of robots. Oh no! Absolutely. Oh my <laughs> god! Shoot me! Dun, 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 so, dun, dun. Right. So you can also find me on the twitters. I'm on the twitters at Johnny Mulligans, and that's uh, a yeah. I'm keeping it really basic and simple right now. Gotcha. Hanging out with these guys, doing a little movie reviewing ish. We're gonna be fourteen. And loading all of my house into storage units. Feel that. Yeah. Also, Brandon, if you're still hungry, feel free to get more. Oh, I will. Yes. <laughs> oh, are we talking about the decks or anything, or is that next? Uh, that That's completely up to you, baby. Yeah. We're doing that right now, so... I'm kind of free-balling right now. <laughs> and, and as we get into game three, since we're lingering and loitering here... Game three, this is game two! Little... Yeah, I was like, where are you? <laughs> I I'm lost my freaking mind, man. Uh, it's Alesha who smiles at his pi her it's pi my pile of death. Uh, it's basically. Her. Oh, I'm playing Zedru. 
Yeah, I'm playing Alesha because I just like some aggro. I like some Mardu graveyard shenanigans, and so far I like where this deck is at. So we're just gonna we're just gonna go there. Just gonna Alesha. go there, huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm playing Zedru. What about it? My other decks are either taken apart or they are not going to like hold any sort of weight at this table. <laughs> <laughs> More, all the Zedru. All right. All your Zedru are belong to us. Oh, yeah, I already described what I'm doing, just to make shit. <laughs> and, Bren, what are you doing? All right, so I'm going to be playing with Daxus the Returned it did, a.k.a. Cold Daxus, as Davey likes to call him. Uh, it is an Orzov Mill Control Enchantment Tribal? Question mark? <laughs> There's, a, There's a lot of weird things happening with this deck, but it's, it's surprisingly good at what it doesn't know what it does everyone's like oh you never win with the deck and then i come out and then people like kill him and then like i die and then it's like well and then everyone's like well you never win with the deck and it's just <laughs> <laughs> you have what in the deck see just doesn't even remember just occasionally cage of hands debtors and hell that kind of thing where it's like it's not winning the game but it really pisses you off <laughs> <laughs> It just straight up just aggro's people, like, it instantaneously. It is very frustrating, yes. Um, okay, uh, <laughs> that's going to be it for me. Player one, since you are starting, let's kick this game off and All right. get started. Let's do it. Uh, fucking drawing card for turn, playing a Temple of Mystery, scrying, and passing turn. Ooh. All Keep right, on top. Keep draw. That. Neat. Uh, this, is, this hand's Did you nutty. say neat? Neat, mm. neat, N E A T. Huh. We are the knights who say neat. <laughs> are you talking about my gray skin? <laughs> Not that pale. Anyway, uh, mountain, crypt. <laughs> Brandon picks a deck. Everyone else, kill him. <laughs> uh, <laughs> fell war stone, which can tap for nothing right now. Hell yeah! Hooray! Uh, and okay. then. Yeah, that's it. Yes. All right, I'm gonna draw my card. I'm gonna play my planes. My white passing turn. Hmm. It's not what I wanted to see. We're gonna throw down a vivid Medio. Comes into play with two counters. Hey, I, I can do a color. Woo! <laughs> Island two Thrasios pastern. Damn, that, that was, was fast. Yeah, all right. On top, upkeep, uh, roll for crypt, odds or damage. One. I lose three life. Okay. 37. Oh, yeah, Brandon, Burn. I made this hot sauce, too, that you got to try. Oh, hell yeah. I oh, know I'm down for oh, that shit. Pretty spicy. Did you bring it with you? No, I didn't, unfortunately. What, how the fuck am I supposed to try it? I can bring you some sometime, dude. Terrible. Uh, a blue and two for a noble benefactor. Uh, All right. If it's put in the graveyard from anywhere, I know if it's put in the graveyard from play, each player may search his or her library for any one card and put that card into their hand. Each player who does shuffles. So if you kill it, everybody gets to two to first thing. Hell Sounds yeah. That's good. Kill him. Uh, and um, yeah, that's my turn. So uh, when are you <laughs> building a green included version? Like, you know, maybe, maybe uh, what was it? Kenos and Tiros? I forgot how to, how to pronounce their name. But it's essentially your Zedru, but with that and Tempting Worm. When are you when are you putting Tempting Worm into the mix of this? Uh, we are I don't like green. Fuck yeah. Fair. You're a man <laughs> after my own heart. Yeah, I agree with that. Uh, I, I, <laughs> I dislike green so much. My playgroup has gotten annoyed with me, so they said next time, like we do a league game, because um, I used to be like the head, like judge and manager for a uh, budget commander league. All the players said, "Stop playing Is it or Jeskai? Play Golgari or Green, please, for the love of God." And They're all bad that friends. Those Negative. are bad influences, so, <laughs> right? Negative. So I, I'm, That's right. So uh, I'm building budget Gitrog. Don't even do it. You know what? Actually, you know, Gitrog. If, if you know I'm, what? If I'm gonna talk, be honest. Gitrog is the only green acceptable commander. Make a five color tech and have all the lands of all five colors and still persist to play. Is it? Yeah, do that. <laughs> I'm playing. I'm playing Golos. 
Oh, that's that's cool. What what go though? Uh, it's is it, but with one exploration. No, 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 yes. no. You get the hybrid colors. You get the hybrids that have the other colors in it, but you still only persist to play the blue and the red. Oh yeah, there you yeah. go. That's the way to do it. <laughs> yep, nailed it. Oh, then in that so, case, I'd have to do uh, Gigantho the Wellspring. I could get away with that. See, you're already halfway there. Oh yeah, Johnny, don't, don't even worry about talking over us. Just do your thing if you need to. We talk okay. a lot. Yeah, yeah just fucking <laughs> just trample over us. So I'm gonna dread board that thing that gives us all the party tutor. Hell yeah. <laughs> okay. Wait, we all got a tutor for a thing. Awesome. Wait, except oh, for Beyond. No, I no, get to do. Just see everyone. Yeah, everyone. So everyone. It's any card, right? Any card. Everybody no, tutor now. Anyone. Do, 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 Anyone do, 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 gets anything. But you have to shuffle afterwards, just in case. Oh. Damn, I honestly have no idea what I want. Huh. Feel that? So many options. Mm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. What would be the most humorous pick? Also, Dexos, you forgot to reset your life total. Ah, uh, fuck that. I mean, Dexos if you want to, if you want to start at third of the thirty, though, I'm not going to be opposed to it. I don't even know what I want because, like. It's like so early for two. I know that's what I'm saying. I'm like, God, I don't even know what I like, get. I I have a game plan, but like not like a solid one. And like we're all friends here. This game. Uh, excuse me. Some of us <laughs> are more than friends, and some of us just refuse to believe it. Hmm. Wonder who is in which category. Oh yeah, you don't have to reveal it either. You just gotta like look and put. Right. I like how he changes the subject. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I'll just, I know. I just went for a yeah, wind yeah. drop. Very modest. <laughs> <laughs> I went for a two drop. Oh, also, a whole and modest. well rounded modest. I, I too and I too am extraordinarily humble. Yes. I'm extremely humble as well, and I'm going for a zero drop. It's Black Lotus, kill him. Kill him, get him. I uh, 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 <laughs> Putting his mortgage on the line. <laughs> Cut please. Sure. Give me your deck, you cheating son of a bitch. Sure. Here you go, buddy. Now pre be prepared to do 98 card pickup. You know that fucking um, hot sauce I made it turned out surprisingly fruity. I didn't, I didn't really put much fruit in it, but it's just like it has such a fruity like taste in the front, and then just mellows out into complete burn. <laughs> all right, Johnny, are you done? Yeah, I'm all done. All right, cool. A hor horse Understand? father. I am so excited for that potential project we're working on. I don't want to say a whole lot about it, but. Oh, Damn, no, that's going to be fine. Good idea. I'm going to put down a P lanes. And let's, uh, what is that, a 2-2 two -two or something? It's a 1-3. God damn it. What does it do? Uh, I can pay four to scry one, then reveal the top card of my library. If it's a land card, put onto the battlefield tapped. Otherwise, draw a card. Oh, Tharsios. Yes. Uh, no one won the last game. It, we, we all just cried. <laughs> I didn't. Um... I'm going to play Greater Oromancy and pass. Okay. S Dragons won immensely. Let's who played, who played play what? Island. I, oh, I okay. blame my cast training grounds. If I counted it out, I was already up to 60 damage before I even did the Valakut. The Valakut? Oh, you mean the dragon? Yeah. Yes. He, he, he had enough to kill us with that. Um, let's see. Uh, I guess I'm gonna roll the dice. You wanna attack? Beyond is one. Goes in turn order. Let's see. Uh, oh yeah, it's not happening in chat, is it? Let's try it one more time. There you go. Roll three just came through, and Fuck. no response. That's fine. Burr, just, burr, burr. Here, just take it down. I got a response to mine. I got a response to mine. Oh, you did. What did you say? Um, uh, 
roll again, just just to be sure. Oh god. Okay, just roll it, Johnny. This All guy. right. There's so, Brandon just sneaking in. Oh my! One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, if you're four, I assume you beyond. You know, we'll count like that. So I don't have to re-roll. All right, it's four beyond. I'm swinging at you for one. Fuck. All right. Yeah, I'm at. Uh... <laughs> you're at thirty-six. Big damage. Okay. Damn, get wow. wrecked beyond. Holy Passing. shit. <laughs> <laughs> all That's right, yeah, terrible. all right. Cool, my turn, I guess. Great. Oh, man, that makes me sad. I do want to see the beautiful commentaries, but it's okay. I think I think one of the servers is down. That makes sense. Uh, for Twitch. I think there was a massive outage because the pulley went down. Twitch has been up and down. Like, uh, when I try and load the Twitch website, it actually does not load. Right now, I'm getting this for our pulley. Ah, oh, gotcha. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, uh, untap, upkeep, draw. I forgot to upkeep first before draw, but whatever. Uh, odds or damage? I'm at 33. Uh, hmm. Let's see. I'm going to I'm gonna open bets because someone said I didn't, so I got two. Uh, I'm going to tap two for a howling line. Sweet. Ooh. Hell yeah. And then I'm going to do a red and a one to play a Wheel of Fate suspended. Ooh, interesting. You're going to put us on a clock, huh? Mm. Yeah. It's what, uh, four, three? Yes, it's four. Okay. All right. Yep, that's my turn. Everybody's drawing two cards per turn now. Yes. Right. Do my draw. draw I miss playing modern yeah. FNM. That was so much fun. I made a sweet like suspend deck with that card and a couple other weird things like the balance, the star balance. It was it was a great time. I miss it. Is everyone I... seeing us okay? Are there any issues with people getting like dropped uh, dropped connections or anything? Because for us, like half this stuff isn't loading like whatsoever for us, but. When I look at OBS, it says we haven't dropped a single frame and we're uploading just fine. So, all right. I'm just making sure. Well, I'm just happy to be here. Right. <laughs> Sorry. Continue. Keep it going said over one us. One for the bot. Okay. Yeah. Just just to show Johnny, what does it say that the bot responded with? Um. It says, "Fuck you, Johnny. I swear to God, if you look into the face cam one more time, I will." Oh. Oh, wait, no, tell me not to read that part out loud. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see this, but on our side, uh, chat stopped and came back, like, several times on this side and several times on that side, and then we have another chat window over there that is working but isn't, like, over here. Very weird. All right, well, it seems <laughs> fine on that side, so we're fine. <laughs> hey, I have no idea what's going on. Okay, sorry. Keep going, Johnny. You, you can just talk over us. Yes, please. You okay, kind of have so I'm to. Just gonna... <laughs> I guess I just gotta elbow my way into this conversation. Exactly. Oh yeah! <laughs> right, I'm gonna go ahead and go red black and use the black mana. Create my soul ring. <gasps> and then I've Broken. got the extra Kill red him. floating. Get him. Get the, get the, Sounds yeah. like you just took um, a shit. <laughs> Alright, so I got a red floater. <laughs> Another root root floater. <laughs> he didn't say no. <laughs> so we're going to take all of them floaters. Ooh. I'm going to cast one Cultivator Caravan. I still got one float in red. Right. I'm going to go ahead a Figure of Destiny. I'm going to float another red and throw it at the Figure of Destiny and give it a little bump. There we go. It's now a 2-2 two -two Kithkin Spirit. God, I love Figure of Destiny. Such a cool card. Wait, I just realized something. Jo Johnny, what? who's your commander? Lesha? Oh. Okay. <laughs> like, it was a conversation. We talked. <laughs> that was a whole we conversation. Walked. That was an intro. He put on a Lesha costume. I mean, like... <laughs> Of course, of course I would have the right commander for you since the beginning of the I, game, but I just wanted to make sure because, you know, it's not like I would put the new one in there. Mountain Mage, <laughs> new name. Good to see you. Hello. Mountain Mage. Uh, is that it for your turn, Johnny? Mm-hmm. All right. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> All right. So we're going to put down a Sea Womp. And... 
<laughs> wow. I did not need to hear what it sounds like when you take a shit. Is, it, is that the sound you assume I make? <laughs> it's like fucking intrigued fucking character from the dinosaur TV show. Um. So, Johnny, as I look at your board state, uh, you have a vehicular, right? A vehicular? Uh, what, the, the cultivator scarabin is technically vehicular in nature, yes. <laughs> uh, and it's technically a... And it's... When until it's end of turn. Okay, so it changes its... Five, five. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, and that and creature GTA you have, what vehicle? is it? The Kithkin is currently a 2 2. And the next level up is a 4 4 Kithkin Spirit Warrior. Level after that is an 8 8 Kithkin Spirit Warrior Avatar with flying and first strike. Yeah, he, okay. He, he's mad to turn into something else. I'm going to play Visions of Brutalité on it. Uh, Mountain Mage just bastard. living vicariously <laughs> through you. Oh, yeah. I feel it. Uh, okay, so oh. Visions of Brutalité says whenever this creature attacks, it deals that much damage to its creature's controller. Sorry. Its controller loses that much life. So right. you can't even prevent the damage. You just straight up lose that much life. Yeah, pleb. Okay. Um, okay, and I will pass. And a turn, I'm going to activate Thrasios. <gasps> Scry one. Put on bottom. Reveal top. It is a uh, lore skill quaddle. Whenever I draw a card, put a 1-1 one -one counter on it. And I draw it. Untap. Nice. Draw. Put a... Oh. I'm going to put a force into play. I'm going to tap four. Four. Did you say you're going to put the force into play? Yes. How many midi chlorians did you tap? Uh -huh. At least two. <laughs> Wilderness Reclamation. I've been oh, on my end step. Untap wow. all lands I control. Someone needs to get rid of that bullshit. Uh, I'm going to move to combat. It's going to be between uh, Beyond and Brandon. So uh, Beyond is even and two, Brandon's odds. If it's just flip a damn coin. No, we don't flip <laughs> coins around here. Coins are oh, cursed. Oh, my God. Okay. Roll it up. Evens. All right. Evens. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Beyond. It's coming at you for one. Great. I'm at 32. All right. Um, going to go to end step. Untap Get my fucked, lands. bro. Pass and turn. <laughs> yep. I'm sorry. Uh, untap, just... upkeep. Uh, this goes down to three. Uh, I... Oh, I was um, supposed to draw it. two cards. Oh, yeah, oh good. There's a damage that, that time. That's a plus. Just draw it. Then draw have two. Discard down. It's not a May. Wow. In that that case, I would discard my jar. Not what I needed. But it will have to do. Um, You hmm. gotta do do the voodoo. That's what you do. Do you remind me of a babe? A babe with the power. <laughs> the power of voodoo? <laughs> voodoo? You do. Do what? Oh, voodoo. man. That gives me, like, weird fucking deja vu from the Scooby-Doo movie. <laughs> <laughs> Can uh, we talk about how life. oddly sexy that uh, Scooby-Doo movie was? There were a lot of innuendos in that movie, yeah. Smothering Todd. <laughs> like Matthew. Ah! Lillard. He said the magic word. And by that, I mean the very, very bad word. I hate it. Matthew <laughs> Lillard and Freddie Prince Jr. version. Do you remember that? No. Oh, man. Actually, wait. In response to uh, Smothering Tithe, um, I'm going to activate Thrasios twice. I don't get completely fucked by this. Uh, scry to top and then reveal. Forest comes into play tapped. And then do it one more time. Um, going to scry to top and draw it. It's Wait. gonna be a rewind. Oh, because you're getting the two dollar discount. Yep, got it. So I'm drawing a rewind. 
Okay, then your smothering tithe happens. If it must. Uh, that's my turn, by the way. That's it. I'm not drawing uh, lands, so that is now my that is now gonna be lands. Huh. Okay, so I'm gonna untap and I'm drawing two cards, right? And I'm yes. not paying and, the uh, two uh, on either of them. So go ahead and have your little treasures. Oh yours? Go have yeah, your treasure. Sure. There. Uh, Windbar the the will be represented by these pebbles. Step. These pebbles are mana. Oh, that sucks. Still good though. Yeah. I thought it was every Nah, that's the other fucked up piece of shit. <laughs> Alright, so I've got this little curse counter on. You got a little curse counter there, yeah, there you go. Shows it's cursed. It's cursed. It's got this little curse, of which I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna play my Smoldering Marsh on tap because I got my two basics. Right. It's a basic. Very good right. card, yeah. Red, white, red. I'm gonna level up here, so it's now, uh. Level two, it's a four four. But, but it's gonna jump in the cultivator's caravan. It's getting in its sweet ride with the spinners. <laughs> Hell yeah, that's right. And it's gonna roll on over to Brandon's block and say, "Hey, what's up? This crown hurts. Screw you." For five. That's right. Ooh. Uh, well, I, I'll take five. Uh, uh, five to the weenus. The weenus. It does look like a weenus, doesn't it? Mm, 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 mm. Very phallic, yes. Then on the second main phase, I'm going to play Alesha, and there it is. Wow. Wow. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Drow. One. Drow. Two. You'll play two for either of those. Um, No. Thank you. I guess it's up to you, Johnny Mulligans. You're going to have to Vandal Blast overloaded. How about you not? <laughs> I'm going to put down a swamp as my land for... Uh, no, I'm sorry. I'm going to put down a Sarah's Sanctum as my land for turn. And... Ooh, fuck, I just dropped my hand on the floor. But before I go pick it up, one, two, three, four, <laughs> five. We're going to remove a counter from this to make black. We're going to play Black Market. Whenever a creature dies, put a charge counter on Black Market. At the beginning of your pre-combat main phase, add one black mana to your mana pool for each charge counter on Black Market. Uh, that's pretty much going to be it for my turn. Uh, I'm going to go pick up my hand that is now on the floor. Yes. I mean, I don't want you to look at it, but I mean, look, it somehow made its way all the way over there. <sighs> <laughs> this is a very elaborate way like, of cheating. I, no, no, no. <laughs> I mean, I, honestly, I don't see what, I don't care what you see. Look, Johnny, look at how far away it is from me where I dropped it. How do you do that? It fell in my lap right here, too. But... Some sloppy uh, hand holding. I don't know. I, I've taken college physics before. I don't know how this happened. Yeah, I just saying, dude. I, I don't know. I don't get it. To fucking wake Newton <laughs> up from the dead because he was wrong about something. I gotta get some ice. All right, drew my card for turn. Uh, gonna play a. Oh, your other card for turn. Oh yeah, draw another card for turn. Excuse me. Oh man, are you gonna pay I two am for a each? Dumb bitch. No, well, unfortunately. Thank you. Let it grow. Let's see. No, C was kind of like the last game. No, it wasn't quite C level, but it was close. I'm going to cast a Psychosis Crawler for five. Good. Very good. It's currently pretty big. <laughs> um, move to combat. Swing at Brandon for one because I haven't poked him. With a thing son yet. of a bitch. That's Commander, right? Yes. All right, got it. Uh, going to go to end step. I have to discard down. I'm going to discard a full rost and then untap my lands. Uh, on your end step, I'm going to sacrifice a treasure to Mystical Tutor. Sure. I'm going to look for a Chaos Warp. 
All right, is this in response to any of the triggers? No, it's not. It's just at the end of your turn. Gotcha. Also, I'm pretty sure I can build, like, I think out of the stuff I have, I could build, like, two CD, CEDH decks for when we want to do that in the future. Yeah, I definitely recommend trying it at least once. I mean, I'm down. Even I don't really mind. Yeah, even if it's not quite your taste, it's, like, it's worth trying just to say, oh, yeah, yeah, I tried it, wasn't a fan. No, I mean, I'm definitely down for that. I have, I have no qualms with that. Um, I, yeah. I do miss playing competitive formats. I loved playing Modern so much. Yeah. As degenerate as it was. What I'm putting on top of the library. And uh, then I'm going to what sacrifice... Is I'm putting Chaos Warp on top. Oh, right, right, right. Chaos Warp. You did say that. My bad. I want to sacrifice three of my treasures to Oblation a treasure. Okay. So I got to shuffle one. Uh, oh, I don't want to do that, actually. Nope. <laughs> Because <laughs> I, want, I want to draw that card. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I mean, I was going to let you do it. You could have if you wanted to. Oh, bad idea. Oh, well, now you know that's in there at least, so that's good. Yeah, that's okay. I'll just go to my turn. Uh, untap, upkeep, draw two. And remove two counters, and then roll for crit. All of your damage. Six. I'm fine. You don't have to reveal Johnny. It's scry. Uh, well, I mean, if you draw it, you do. I think, right? So uh, when I, when I scry, I can I, I scry and um, yeah, I don't have to reveal that. But once I I do have the card on top, I do have to reveal what it is. Um, and if it's a land, I put it on the battlefield. Otherwise, I draw a card. So regardless, I'm gonna reveal my library. I just don't reveal what I scryed. Uh, I'm going to tap crypt and a treasure. For a temple bell. Then I'm going to Temple Bell I can it's cost three and I can top it. Everybody draw the card. I'm gonna pay three and I'm gonna do Chaos Warp my own treasure. Ooh, smart. Sure. Shuffle and then I reveal top card of the deck. It's permanent, I'm gonna play it. Uh, there's another bell that uh, if anyone has a token creature deck, I highly recommend it. It's an extremely underrated card, but it's called Junkyo Bell. Uh, you sacrifice a creature. All creatures of that creature type get plus X plus X, where X is the sacrificed creatures, whatnot. Um, it's really good if you have uh, things like coat of arms out, or you pump it when you do, and it just makes all those creature type, all those creatures of that creature type. Just insanely like strong. It's really good for for token decks. Highly recommend it. Okay. So deck is shuffled. I just realized that I have not played Magic since February. I feel that, dude. I mean, I feel, I feel like if you want to, I definitely rec recommend pursuing like any kind of webcam magic if you have the ability to. Oh my god! Yeah. All cameras archive. Yeah, Ooh, making we're drawing magic lots happen. of fucking cards. Or at least you are. Yeah, I was about to but... say. I don't, think, I don't think we are. Well, I mean, we still are. What's <laughs> mm. uh, the problem with a lot of mana? Just what, didn't know how many cards am I drawing? Creeper? It's a question. Uh, any creatures? You're only drawing two cards per turn, until I say so. Hmm. Oh! Until he says so. I, I love that, dude. dude, until I say so. I can play more Hounding Mind effects. It's not a hard thing to do. He's really he's really getting uh, that Dom mode on. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. May I have another? Uh, I want to play a white for an Enlightened Tutor. And then you're going to make us draw? Yeah. But let me find what I'm looking for first. I'm looking for Font of Mythos. And then I want to tap that. Everybody draws. Do you each want to pay one? Or each want to pay two for your draws? No. No. Wait, Negatory. Each opponent will lose one Three. life from my psychosis crawler when that happens. Four. Ooh. 
Ooh. Oh. Uh, nice. And then I'm going to pay the three treasures and tap the mountain for Fonta Mythos. Um, how many counters is left on the wheel? Two. Two. Okay. And uh, yeah, you're go. So whatever we do, we got to do it soon. Yeah, you're drawing four cards per turn. Oh my hey, god, it's this is a madhouse. Though. I'm going to draw my four and not pay anything. Thanks. I feel kind of bad that you're giving us all this card draw. I don't feel bad And we're all. giving you so little. That's group hug. Like I said, it's group hug. That's what it does. That's how he does. Okay. Wow. What do I do with all of these things in my hand? Uh. I was really hoping you were going to say, what am I going to do with all this junk? All this junk inside my trunk. Mm -hmm. What's in my head? God, I swear to God! All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so anyone playing Urborg yet? No. no. Damn. Put my planes. How do I want to do that? Is your girlfriend on our Wi-Fi? Yes. Is she streaming a game? She's streaming on Twitch, which is, uh, she's watching a DJ set, I think. I wonder if maybe that's why, because I just lost Scryfall. Oh, maybe it is. Cool. I mean, she's stuck here, so I guess it's not that big of a deal, as long as our our stream doesn't go down. I think it's fine, but yeah, I can't get to anything right now. Everything just keeps going up and down, up and down. Like that's, our that's our chat is just we but, just lost chat again. But, but being on Twitch would do that. Well, we have a very very small internet pipe here because of how much it costs for business internet. Ah, uh, well, there goes chat. Uh, okay. <laughs> gotcha. Well, wh all right. So, so here, what are we? All right. Don't, what, don't what's make the her get state off, of creatures on the board, board right so. now? Who's got what on the creature board state? Johnny, what do you got? I have uh, Thrasios and Psychosis Crawler as creatures. Crawler, crawlers untapped right now? Yes. All right. Um, uh, mathing is hard. All right. I think... I think... No, I don't think it would be that, because she was here when, like, Dale and I were here. and like using I have absolutely no creatures. Hmm. I think I gotta do it I think something else was happening tonight. Yeah, like I, I said, think, I think so. A lot of these servers are just going up and down for us. It's really weird. Mm -hmm. So it wasn't just me with my. I don't think so. Minutes. Okay. All right. So I'm going to do some self-inflicted pain in the process here. I'm going to play Archetype of Courage. Then I'm going to go. There's my wheel of uh, the, the uh, soul ring goes into the shadow thing. There's three. And the, da, da, da. I'm going to go ahead and play my Falcon Wrath Marauders. What does that do? Alcarath Marauders is a 2-2 vampire flying haste whenever it deals combat damage to a player. Put two plus one plus one counters on it. Archetype of Courage gives all my creatures first strike. So, purposes of... All right, Johnny, do you have a flyer over so there? Who, who are those marauders coming at is the question. Who is what? Who are those marauders coming at? Who's asking that question? Is that Johnny? Me. You're asking, what, yes. where Johnny, Johnny, yes. where do you want him to go? Uh, not me. All right, all right. Wh who would you be willing to? All right, you don't want Marauders going after you. I I do not want that. God, I can't even okay. spell Marauders. Beyond, what do you got over there for creatures? I have no creatures. Seriously? All right. Okay, so I'm gonna send Alesha and the Marauders at Beyond. Brandon, I'm gonna send my figure of destiny for four at you, and I will take the four. But it has the first strike. And just, it's coming over there, it's walking over there, strolling over there in its little Crocs. You know, like, hey. Crocs. I can accept I it if he's one. wearing Crocs. Wearing Crocs. <laughs> Playing Crocs, not that bedazzled crap. Just, like, straight up <laughs> OG Crocs. 
So I'm sending five to Fion, four at Johnny. I'm I'm taking four myself, and then uh, everything's got first strike, and I pass the turn. Did I have to discard or anything? No one did. Okay. <clears throat> All right. I will draw oh, four. Thing. Right. Mm -hmm. I am not paying for either of the. Oh, sorry, any of those cards. Hmm. I really don't want to wheel these away. This is upsetting. We're going to put down a Temple of the False Dog. Oh, yeah. Did you want to play the... the Eight mana. <laughs> I already said I, I'm not going to do it. I already said it. Okay. Well, I'm spaced out. Did you pay oh, the eight? eight mana. I know, You're right? going to pay the eight? You, you passive aggressive. Actually, I could theoretically pay the eight, but I'm not going to do that. In theory. I made a meme about the mountain goats, and the mountain goats liked it, so I got distracted. <laughs> How many creatures are on the board total? Got uh, two, two on mine? Three, four. So six creatures? I'm gonna pay Kaya's whatchamacallit wrath. Or is it Fumigate? Hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm going to tap for three. So one, two, three enchantments currently out on the battlefield for me. So that's three, four, five. Four, five, removing the counter. <clears throat> Six. And I'm going to play Deadly Tempest. Destroy all creatures for each... Oh, sorry, each player loses life equal to the number of creatures that were destroyed this way. I'm going to rewind that. Uh, counter target spell, untap up to four lands. I have a response <laughs> to the rewind, actually. I'm going to pay three of these, an obelation, uh, one of my treasures. I'm going to shuffle it in and draw four cards. All right. So I really just shuffle and draw four. I want to see if I can get a counter, because I actually want that board wipe to go off. I figured you would, because it puts you in like the best position here. Uh, I wouldn't say the best, but it doesn't put me in the worst. That whole fake humble is just so annoying. The what? <laughs> that fake humble. What fake humble? What fake humble? Oh, humble. Oh, it's not the best, but it's not the worst. Yeah. I'm <laughs> oh. sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. That's that's the that's the scotch talking. <laughs> I'm like, I sure hope I didn't make him upset. <laughs> oh, this is Johnny Walker good. So, Johnny Walker black, so good. Uh, yeah, Johnny Walker it. is pretty good. Uh, I'm to pay two and counter spell. Nice. Oh, god damn it. Well, you don't untap your land. So, the board wipe goes off. Yes. Um, so, in response to the counter spell, I'm going to pay two to activate Thrasios. Ooh. Reveal it, forest, put it into play tapped, and it yep. goes off. Yeah. All right, so you lose life equal to the number of creatures that were lost this way. One, One two. two, a three, a four. So the number is still six total, correct? I guess. Yeah, he's losing four. I had four, my, four of my creatures went to the bin. Yeah. All right, and then two of yours. Yes. All right, so six. All right, so. Uh, Johnny, you are losing four. Johnny, you are losing two. I did. Nice. Um, and, uh, we'll, uh, we, uh you can go. Sure. <laughs> uh, I got to discard down. How many cards am I drawing? Okay, Whitney. Four. Four. <clears throat> got to get four cards. Sure. Or three cards, so one. Lo looping back to the uh, the carry Bruce Campbell debate, just so everybody here at the stream knows, 
Evil Dead is available on Netflix. Please go check out the original. That is uh, a movie I watch every Christmas. Well, at least the mm. second one I do. The Beyond White Knighting. Ooh, damn. Grinning calling you out. Uh, you had to do it. Yes, I, I literally did. Beyond you fucker, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> I'm the one that casts the board wipe, but he's yelling at Beyond. <laughs> yes, yes, fuck that guy. <laughs> he certainly ruined your life, Johnny. I don't even think I've got fans. Oh, no, he did. No, he did. God, my collection's in such disarray, man. All right, I'm going to tap five for, wait, let me see. Actually, should I do that? No, I should do something else. I should tap four for for Thrasios again. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, Three for Lore Skill Quaddle. Oh, what is that? So, uh, whenever I draw a card, put a 1-1 count on it. Um, then I'm going to go to end of turn. Um, before I just go down, I'm going to Wilderness Reclamation. Untap all lands I control. And I'm going to cast Nexus of Fate. Just take an extra turn after this one. Oh, you're putting that on the stack? Yes. Nice. Uh, I'm going to have to discard down regardless from my end of turn. Uh, I'm going to discard... Omen of the Hunt. See, okay, one, two, three, I'm sorry. Four, I'm assuming you didn't pay for the treasures at the beginning of your turn? No, I did not. Okay, so I have a response to um, the Tyrant spell. Yes. Uh, I'm going to pay one. I'm going to brainstorm. I'm going to draw six and put two back. Sure. I'm going to see if I can get a counter spell. Okay. Hell yeah. Stop this monster. This guy's ramping every three seconds. He's taking extra turns. He's trying to stop board wipes. He's literally the epitome of the player we never want to see. What? Never. <laughs> never. Anyone who plays oh, green should burn. You're talking about, <laughs> you're talking about Johnny, not me. Okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, no, you're, you're doing great. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I I could not dig for a counter spell, unfortunately. Aww. Sweet. Uh, so oh, I'm gonna hunt and I'm gonna be discarded. I have seven in hand. I'm gonna untap. This gets shuffled into my library. I'm drawing what four cards again? Mm -hmm. Four cards. <laughs> That's a lot of cards. Extra turn instant spell that gets put back into your library though is incredibly broken. Yes, it is. That it is. Let me just get your deck so I can throw it on the ground here. Of course. I think, I think Grinna needs to clarify which Johnny's slurring. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's pretty clear. <laughs> the Trash Master, I believe, has uh, got Two, a little bit of a three, slur. Four. Uh, no, I am not paying. Silver is a bird. Ooh, Beyond gets more tokens. Get four counters here on my, my little buddy. Yeah, buddy. Buddy, 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 buddy. Let us play an Island for turn. Should I play an Island? Why do you have that over Chasm Skulker? Uh, I could have both. Oh, I was just curious because I think for the same cost you could put out a Chasm Skulker. Yes, it is better. Also, probably because I didn't have a second one on hand, I just threw this together really quickly, to be honest. Ah. Um, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight manas. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, snap. So when is that Wheel of Fate going off? Nexus of Fate? It already did. He's on his next oh, turn. Oh, no. Wheel of Fate. Wheel oh, of Wheel fate, of Fate. fate. We've got two, two turns. turns. Yeah. All right, man. Sorry, I'm, I'm just trying to think of what to do right now. And that seems so ten turns ago. <laughs> All right, casting a seaboard muse. Oh my god! I swear to God, you monster! Don't ever complain about freaking 
reclamation and whatchamacallit again. <laughs> I'm not complaining about anything. Because <laughs> I'm doing it. <laughs> He's living the dream, boys. <laughs> Shoot him. <laughs> Swear to God. Filtering for a blue. No, it was funny. Like, when um when Nick was on here, God, months and months ago, was uh he was... <laughs> He was playing the mono green deck with the Seedborn Muse, and every time he's like, oh, it's the worst. He's just, it's just the worst every time. He's just untapping every turn. He's like, oh, it's the worst card. They should ban it. But he plays it. No problem. <laughs> yeah. He just starts, you know, sweeping us with his little Nyx Bloom thing and oh, yeah, that Seedborn makes sense. thing and right. such a dick. Wave Break Kibble Camp. <laughs> Whenever I cast my first spell during each opponent's turn, draw a card. It's a 2-2. Two -two. Uh, I'm going to move to combat. Swing over at Beyond for six from the lore scale Quaddle and one from Thrasios. Seven in total. Damn. Uh, yeah, I'm at 19. Zoinks. That's a dick move. And I'm going <laughs> to discard down, or I'm going to untap and then discard down. Cool. Is that your actual, like, end step? Yes. Are you good? Yes. Okay. My turn. Yep. Uh. I'm going to untap off for your turn. Upkeep. Uh, odds are damage. Five. Matt, 16. Uh, I'm going to draw one. That's my draw for turn. And then I'm going to draw one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. This game somehow got out of hand very quickly. Huh. Uh, I'm going to tap Temple Bell. Everybody draws a card. I draw two. Do, we, do you want to pay for the treasure? Nope. nope. Oh, I'll okay. pay for mine, actually. Uh, yeah, I'll pay cool. for mine, actually. That sounds good. Cool. Draw two. How many cards are we drawing? One. One. Okay. EK right. plays cards. Thank you very much for joining us, and you're never late. You was, you arrived exactly when you meant to. I want to pay three and play Mirror Maid, targeting Smothering Tithe. Ooh, interesting. Ah, uh, fuck that. Uh, playing six for uh, Torrential Gilhawk. Is that a flash? It does yes. have flash. Alright, uh... Whipper Cup of Camp is also going to trigger, and I'm going to draw a card. Wait, you're playing uh, Torrential I've, Gear I've, Hulk. You need I have a, a response. I have a response to the Gear Hulk. Uh, what is this? I'm casting it right now. Hasn't entered yet. Okay. Alright, uh, I'm going to Arcane Denial it. Ooh. Okay, sounds good. I also... I still draw my my card from Whipper Cup of Camp. Yep. You do. All right. And then on the next turn, you draw two, and I draw two. Right. Where I may. If I want. So there are, new, there are now two smothering tides on my board. Unfortunately so, yes. I love it. It's a madhouse. Complete madhouse. Uh, I'm going to pay two to search warrant. I want to target player reveals his or her hand. I gain life equal to the number of cards in that player's hand. Ooh. I'm revealing my own hand. <laughs> I'm revealing Meek Stone, Praying Sanity, Molten Psyche, Island, Narset, Arid Mesa, Mountain, Back to Basics. Not playing it. <laughs> Smart man. Possibility <laughs> for Forgotten Cave. Gleaming Barrier, Negate, Anvil of Bull Garden, Mountain, Hollow Fountain. All right. And I'm I gain gonna... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I gain 30 life. All right. Jeez. Uh, is anyone else bothered at the fact that when you originally showed your hand, it was upside down? And then, two, you had cards that were still upside down in that? I know what they are. Does that bother anyone else here? I, I just, I'm curious. Not a soul. Oh, this got 
rolled up to. Alright, uh, I'm going to attempt to cast for three Molten Psyche. Dude, that hand did get failed. Uh, each player shuffles the cards from his or her hand, then draws that many cards. Oh. We sh and we then, if I control... You, you shuffle your hand into your library and draw that many cards. Oh, and we take eight damage, or we take whatever we have in our hand. Right. right. Well, no, you you take whatever you've drawn this turn. So you take whatever you've drawn plus one. Ooh, okay. So I've oh, drawn so we take from... damage on the draw. Molten Psyche. Yeah. I remember Molten's... Oh, my God. Someone so I'm going to take nine. Jesus. Does this resolve? That's the big question. Yeah, it does. Okay. I'm going to shuffle in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Shuffling I'm going to draw twenty-eight. Eight. I am taking nine. And do you each want to See, pay for all the treasures you're you're uh, getting? No. No. Unfortunately, no. I cannot do that. I'm going to put this at twenty. Can't. Uh, like I am losing nine like life. Is it I? You're losing nine life as well, Johnny? Yeah. Yep, I did. Beyond is just like, I'm breaking this streak tonight. I Tetris. sure as hell hope so. Tetris winning, goddammit! Swear to six, God. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. That old Homer, it's archived chaos warp is great. There you go. So much ham. Honey baked. Holy crap. Thank you. Hmm. Uh, let's see if I can pull this off. I want to pay three of my 20 treasures for a lab maniac. Are you out of cards in hand? What? Uh, sorry, art of cards in the library? Or how, how many do you have left? Uh, About 60 or so left in library, 60 or 70. Okay. Gotcha. I have about 30 in hand right now. Gotcha. So he just needs to windfall, and he would have to windfall twice. But his next turn, uh, we all yeah. pretty much windfall. Yeah, basically, he's got the tools to... He might have this. I, I have no way of dealing with this at the moment. All right. So um, What is the El I'm a, I'm a hammer, 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 hammer artifact that from that? It, hammer it's artifact. It, it doubles my draws. And gains doubles you your draws. double life. And doubles my life gain. There you go. So is it my turn yet? No. Um... <laughs> Things are going to get very weird. Uh, I'm going to play. I'm going to uh, pay a thing and cycle a lonely sandbar, drawing two. I'm going to. Yeah, might as well. Pay three. Going down to 13 treasures. Attempt to cast Windfall. Ooh. I, I'm i tapped out. I got no responses. Yep, tapped out. Same. Sweet. Uh, everybody discards their hand and draws 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. Everybody pitches their hand and draws 27. I'm getting 27 times 6 treasures. We are just going to say 40. And 26, I mean 27 times 2 is 54? 54. Yep, 54. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty, 
22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48. Cannot get to 54. I win! Alright. Uh, that's it, right? <laughs> Unless someone has a response. No. We all tapped out. You got I'm pretty there? sure. Uh, <laughs> I, I have a response. Um, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> that was good. Good, good job, Beyond. His uh, first win with Zedru on the stream, everybody. Woo! Woo! It wins! Oh, yeah! All right. God! That was like extra smoky scent ham. That that was that was that know, was like, good. Oh, yeah. I loved it. That's the first well, time yeah. we've seen your Zedru win here on stream out of how many games? Six? Five. Uh, this was game seven. He had five attempts prior. Didn't win the last game, so oh, that yeah. was six. Oh, yeah. This yeah. is seven. seven. Yeah. yeah. I've been counting right. shows. So I've played multiple games per show, so I've been counting five shows. So it's probably way more than five. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, at least you didn't troll. Oh. It's, it's, it happened. Savage. You won. Savage. Never last. All right. Well, we're going to pay out the bet. The winner's on that bet. Woo. I don't think anybody bet on me. Spicy little meatball there. You, I just could not get a counter spell off on you. That fucking smothering tide. God. Big tide. spicy right there. Oh, man. The tide was spicy. GG. I am going to go to bed. All Hell right, yeah. you, you've earned some rest, my friend. Going out on a high note. Well, thank you for joining us again, Beyond. We do appreciate thank you. you. Absolutely. That means that we do have an opening for any content creators or anybody else who's previously joined the stream. Now's the time if you want to hop in. Looking at you, Roger. Huh. Roger. Uh, I'm going to do one Roger, final minute still, and then I'll get out of here. Yes, please, shill. Shill hard, my dude. Uh, my name is Beyond the Machina. You can find me on Twitter at Beyond the Machina. Only there's no E in the the, the character limit. Uh, I make Magic the Gathering inspired playmats and artwork. Recently, I've been making some very cool proxies that you can only get if either one you are randomly selected, just get them, or two you are a amazing Patreon or friend. Some of them look like these. So we have Ad Nauseum, Brainstorm, and Entomb. Love the Brainstorm. Uh, you can find me on Inked Gaming at inkedgaming.com slash beyond the machina. This time with an E in the the. And here's the code Lexicon10 to get 10% off of your order. Um, you can uh, find me on Patreon and Instagram as well. Also on Facebook, though I don't use Facebook often. But I'm on there just because gotta make the muns. Gotta make but yeah, thank you very much, everyone. It's been an absolute blast. Uh, Z Zedju cries in glee. At, <laughs> at, at the, the, this I, is uh, this is the night that he takes it apart. <laughs> you I'm finally won, Zedru. You finally won. We can put you to rest out out back in the Everglades where you can graze for eternity. <laughs> Thank you very much, everyone. I'll, I'll see you all later. All right. Well, it was great to have you on. Love to see you, Drew. Thank you. Love to have you on. And as always, everyone else, please go check out Beyond the Machina. He's got a lot of really great, fun content that he makes uh, altar-wise. And um, he's actually kind enough to give us some stuff here and, and help uh, our, our token collection grow. We have, I think, the zombie one and some others and whatnot. Um, Johnny guards that one. It's like a guarded secret. I feel like that, that scene from, uh, what is it, uh, Lord of the Rings? Keep it secret. Keep it safe. Just He, he just guards <laughs> it. Uh, I can play if there's anyone else that hasn't played yet. Blah, 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 blah. Um, I think someone else actually said that they could join us if no one else is online, actually. Let me take a look. I think that was John A. Mulligans, but uh, let me double check. I want to make sure I'm not just... Putting people in front of other people. Oh, DLC. DLC, if you are available, I think you are the first in line for if no one can make it. 
So we'll give DLC a minute here. If you're lurking or hanging around in the background, DLC, please uh, pipe up here in chat. Let us know. We'll have you come in. If we get no response, we'll see if we can get Phantom in. And uh, there you go. And uh, we'll see if we can we can get that going. Uh, John A, I assume you're going to be in for another game, yas. You're talking about me? I, God, we, so, just call me Trash Master. That's so much easier. Oh, sorry, sorry. John A. <laughs> <laughs> I'm game. I'm if uh, if I'm not rotating. I, I actually now that like now that we're getting into it, I think uh, I wanted to share this one with Ooh. chat and stream and all that stuff. This is from Ghostfire uh, Alters, and he went and hooked up me hooked me up with this Ty Merritt, the Murder King. Roxo the Rock and Roll Clown Alter. Oh, I love it. And I think uh, I think for Game Three, we'll uh, go ahead and bring out the Death Clock de deck and and just see what kind of zombies come out this time. I love it. That's great. Um, hey, uh, put that back. Put that back. What are you doing? Freebie. Yeah, I'm gonna full screen that so everyone can see it because that looks pretty sick. Some good stuff. I gotta get around to shipping out a Liliana's Reaper to. He's gonna get the adopted kid from Death Clock. Something, something, put it out. Oh, I gotta send some good stuff. Uh, no response from DLC. Unfortunate. All right, we're gonna have a Phantom join us here. I love that. That's great. I. That's a fun altar. That's a great one, and he's even got some like he's got some glitter in the paint. You guys want to do cocaine? 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 Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm Doctor Roxo, the rock and roll clown. And I like to do I cocaine. I do cocaine. <laughs> Does your Tamarit do cocaine? Natural <laughs> 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 order. What's up? I oh, can't. I can't unsee it, Cole Bear Pig. Every time I see your name, I want to say Man Bear Pig. <laughs> there we go. That's stupid. A more South focused. Park has ruined my life. This is a good one. I got. Let's see what we get. All right. Okay. So I think we're gonna go ahead and get into doing the next game. As part of that process, y'all already know, I'm going to leave it up to you because I don't want the responsibility of picking a deck for me to play. That's right. In front of you on the screen, I have a list of decks for you guys to choose for me to play with next. We've got Jaleer Master, Poly Stuff, as we got Zur the Curse Chancer, we got Mizix of the Assleness, and we have Reaper King Tribal Tribal, also featured on Commander Cookout's Cookout extension of the Beef Brisket. Uh, so go ahead and check that out. A lot of fun. Uh, but really quickly, I'll go through these. Uh, Mono Blue, Esper, Is It, and Five Color. That's that's my quick breakdown. <laughs> Th Thulak, thank you very much for joining us. Simply Fat. Hey, man, it's good to see you. Zach. Or Zetek. Colbert Pig, what's up? Distorted Elk, how's it going? Damn, I destroyed that brisket. Yeah. Very I'm good. I'm glad you enjoyed it, dude. Sure is a shit ton of mess to clean up, though. I swear to God. Yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I saw that bag. It was leaky. Yeah. So it's gonna it's gonna be an effort taking that home. <laughs> Frager, what's up? Is that Frazier or Frager? <laughs> Fenrin, how's it going? This is actually I really like this whole pool thing because I can see people who are participating say hey what's up and yeah, yeah. it was very cool. Solid, nice. I'm gonna natural Gatorade. <laughs> be a rough morning for Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could go and just make you a bunch of coffee and just like have it ready for you in the morning. Mountain Mage, what's up? 
I wish I could go and drink all the brand the coffee brands is making you and then like scream in your face with all the energy I have in the morning. I just piss it out, right? <laughs> yes. The answer is 42. <laughs> Man, that's a book that I need to reread. No, it's not. You know what book you have to reread? What? I was going to make a joke, but then I couldn't think of a punchline. You could have said... Stall, 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 stall. You could have you <laughs> said, stall. <laughs> why read when you can sleep? Hmm. Good argument. I'm going to use that tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I have, like, the Holy Bible version of that, though. Hitchhiker's oh, Guide. Yeah. yeah. I haven't read the book. Heard it's good. It's a... The movie, I feel like the movie didn't do it justice because there's a lot to the book. Yeah. But I think the interpretation of the movie wasn't terrible. I mean, that's good. Sometimes it's the best I've you can seen, hope for. I've seen worse. I've definitely seen worse adaptations of shit. For instance, Ghost in the Shell. Uh, yeah. I, I cringed <laughs> at... Um, I cringed at how they put everything together. Sure, Scarlett Johansson, that's a whole different issue, and I'm not going to get into it yep. in her representation in there. I'm sure she was excited to play the part. I'm sure she did a great job, but that's it doesn't matter. What yeah. I'm talking about is the story. They were kind of like they're pulling bits and pieces from everywhere, and it just didn't fit right. right. I know that they were trying to jam like a full season of like a sack and then second gig into it, and then it just didn't. It just didn't fit, in my right. opinion. The, all the the bits and pieces they were trying to jam in there. And I think if they just stuck to condensing sack, I think they would have been okay. Mm -hmm. I am streaming. Do you see my screen? Uh, well, let me take a look. Go ahead and... Uh... Oh, I guess I'm producing. Never mind. Uh, I will try and uh, press that button. All right, uh, are you streaming to player two or player three there, Phantom? Hey guys, sorry, uh, let me just check real quick. Is it, sure thing. Is it the one with the port number or the one without the port number? Oh, there we go, we see you, we got you. Beautiful. Got me? Yeah. yeah. I okay, see that sweet. that thick, thick rip. Look at those dog. abs. It's Karanos, it's Karanos. Yes. OG map. Mm. So it's not you, because I'm pretty sure you can, I can be convinced no, no, no. that it's you. Imagine I'm not not me. Me. we're just gonna say that's you. <laughs> the misery of silly wank. Let me try and pull down his face a bit so the stream can see. If you're a money um, python Dill fan, looks like you. Wait, if you're a money python fan, I have a a trivia question for you that's really fun. Name the three things the Romans did for the people in the life of Brian. Shoot. It's been a while since I've seen the Monty Python. Eight shit three times. <laughs> I I I got into holy. Grail they they didn't say plumbing Gamera, specifically in the movie. That... So sanitation, yeah, that's one. I don't want oh, to watch Life of Brian. Life of Brian is such a wait. The Trash Master, did you just say you don't know what Life of Brian is? I know what it is. I've seen bits and pieces. I haven't seen it front to back. Come uh, on! And I was, I know, I know Holy Grail, as my brother watched it incessantly. He memorized okay, the okay. damn thing. Okay, okay, wait, wait, thing. hold, hold up. it word for word. Hold up. You, you've got a show about you watching movies and stuff and talking about them, but no, you no, no, haven't no, seen no. iconic movies yet. Don the host has a show about watching movies. I'm that plebe that shows up and watches a movie that's like, hey, watch this movie, and then I give my thoughts on it. I'm the rando. I yeah, am I the right. token rando that shows up and talks about a movie that has no clue what I'm doing. What? So let's be clear about my no. level of expertise. Okay, all right, all right, wait, wait, wait. You know what? Stream, everyone here, we're going to watch Life of Brian together, and we're going to get Johnny in. The Trash Master, and we can get this other Johnny in too. I don't, I don't really care about that Johnny, over there, but this Johnny over here, I can look, leave it. We, we got to get you to watch some solid like cult movies and get this like. 
I, All right, you, I, uh, every I time we talk about work. movies that you haven't seen, it makes me upset. My blood boils <laughs> and I begin to rage at like every movie that <laughs> defines so our generation. <laughs> and you just like, I've never seen it. Never about painting studio <laughs> ass. Are you all less than sober? I am. Okay. I am more than sober. Uh, no, I mean, we've, been, we've been actually pretty chill. <laughs> we, we had the we had the piss. We had yes. the the piss, which was a good start off. By the way, there's still some left. Do you want any? Because I'm about to pour myself a second. No, 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 go ahead. Okay, and then you have a truly. Although I, I haven't had the pineapple before, so that looks really good. That's all right. I don't think it's anything special. It's been coasting off that i think the only one that's really trash right now is johnny the trash master yeah true <laughs> a discord movie night yeah that's what i'm proposing a discord movie night i want to i want to i want to make sure that that johnny can kept i don't want to see okay i want to make sure that johnny can have the childhood he should have deserved in watching the movies that came out when he was alive <laughs> that's that's fair. my goal now totally totally fair i can handle that I can take the homework assignments, The Life of Brian, Here you go, Creepers. All right. I've gotten through most of Samurai Cop. It took Cop you forever. I mean, I was about to say, it took you forever to even start on Samurai Cop. <laughs> so bad, man. I told it's you, dude. Worst. I told you it was like it's the so worst awful. movie ever made. Everything else has story and is like watchable. Like I've, I watched all of MST. I love MST. I think it's great. Um, but that is worse than anything I've ever seen on MST. At least there's color commentary. Oh. MST is like entertaining you. Oh, God. You got you got things like Mitchell. Is that a beer? <laughs> I'm like that's some good stuff. But yeah, it, I don't. It, it's almost like it's almost like you know how like in Star Trek, like it. There was is it is it a rumor or is it true that like they they went and got a lot of their cast from the porn industry is that true? Mm. Or is that just some like like legend of the industry and it's just all made up? Well, I don't know because some of the cast was not um, some of the cast that they had were not exactly originally supposed to be there. Right? Take Harrison mm. Ford for instance. He was a carpenter on the set. He was. Not actually Star cast Trek, as an uh, actor. Right? I'm talking about Star Trek, not Star Wars. Oh, yes. I thought you said Star Wars. Oh, no, he's Star talking, Trek? He's, yeah. Oh, who knows? Uh, a solid pick on William Shatner. By the way, if you have not seen it, uh, I think it's <laughs> Death at 2,000 Feet with William Shatner in... Uh, You're right. The one they always reference with the fucking like, gorilla. It's on Twilight on Zone. On the wing. Yeah, there yeah, you go. Twilight, Twilight Zone. Zone. I blinked on the name of the show, but that is yes. a good episode. <laughs> uh, and he had like... I think... Was that before Star Trek, or is that just that was, after? That was before. Was yeah, really young. Yeah. Um, so I highly recommend going to to watch that as well because that's really fun, and you see him kind of like as his entry into to cinema. It's really. I think he had like funny. one or two things I'm before that. Fucking Yeti on the wing, nerd, just dancing right? around. <laughs> see, I say Star Trek, and in my head, it's Star Trek: Next Generation. But you're talking about original series, so I'm like. I'm a total plebe. What's wrong with me? I need to be really specific. Look, like I said, I want to, you know what? We should make a show out of this where we teach this man <laughs> what cinema is. And we, we go through it. And as a group, we collectively help this man cultivate a little bit of, like, culture. I, I think that <laughs> his not knowing these things means that he's been spending his life the right way. <laughs> and we're about, we're about to undo all of that. I don't <laughs> accept this. <laughs> But you have seen Evil Dead, right? I have seen Evil Dead, Evil Dead 2, and Army of Darkness. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I watch Evil Dead 2 every Christmas. That's what I, do. I, I don't know how to virtually slap you, but if you said you didn't watch any of that, I would have had to. Oh, no. I, yeah, I had, I had some friends growing up that like introduced me to the Evil Dead and Evil Dead 2 franchise. And nice. then, so Army of I Darkness. I, I love how they took Evil Dead 2. And basically be like, hey, remember the first movie? Yeah, we're going to do it again, but funny. Yes. And it's better. <laughs> and I'm like, it. oh, that's, that's fantastic. That's really all that was, was just great. Fixed it. <laughs> all right, I'm good to go. All right. Yeah, okay. Sorry, guys. Uh, I am not been beyond the machina. Machina. Oh, uh, yeah, right. Yes, yes, yes. I got to fix that. And <laughs> 905, <laughs> one of the loyal viewers here. Finally Sorry, play with uh, everyone. Yeah. Distracting them. Good to have you. Yeah, dude. Uh, I'm playing uh, Abzan Commanders, so I don't know if you want to 
give me a Abzan cup or something. We will. Yep, we're yeah, gonna do it. Maybe, thank you for the follow. Cup of the Abzan. All right, so we got Phantom. He's got me thinking, like, what have I actually watched ever? All right, so we got Phantom the Redeemer is what I'm going to put here. There we go. All right, and then you said what, Abzan? Yep, yep Ab Abzan. White, green, black. Azorius. Oh, God. Why do I not see this? God, I can't wait till we go to the new system. I don't think we have an Abzan. Oh no. Oh yeah, there were like. Is there any Abzan? Give me an Abzan, Commander. Give me an Abzan, Commander. Give me an Abzan, Commander. Any Abzan will do. I don't think we have. I don't even think we have an Abzan, Commander. No elephant. Oh, that's wow. madness. The forgot forgotten color combo. The the forgotten. <laughs> it's it's forgotten. Well, it it's for a reason. Forgotten and forbidden. Oh no! Wait, what happened I've... to uh? You know, what? we're just gonna put five colored down, and I'm just gonna uh, say uh, what, whatever your commanders are. Go ahead and list them off. It's uh, Yannick Scavenging Sentinel and Nakara Lair Scavenger. They are the partner commanders from the new C20 set. I highly recommend picking up if you haven't. How do you spell it? It's Xanax? <laughs> Xanax? Yeah. Oh, uh, Yannick, uh, Y-A-N-N-I-K. Y-A-N-N-I-K. There we go, Xanax. Xanax the commander. There we go. My commander is going to be Xanax. And, and then the Kara layer scavenger. Gotcha. Okay, Playing sorry. Allegra. <laughs> All right, you may continue. Sorry to sorry to interrupt there. Who are you piloting, Clariton? Clariton D. <laughs> <laughs> I play Benadryl. <laughs> All right. I'm switching over to Thraxamundar. Please tell me we have a Thraxam. Fuck. Now we don't. It's Grixis. Grixis. You've got go. Grixis. You've got the Grixis Cup, right? Yeah. Yes, we have. We do. The best color combo. We, we couldn't forget Grixis. it. Grixis. You don't have my color. Oh, yeah. I well, know. I mean, Abzan, it has two of the worst colors, so it's like. Ooh. Is it, is it even a color combo? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Grixis is the worst. Let's be real. Mm, uh, I don't know. How do I'm sorry, I can't process this emotion. I don't, I don't know what it feels like to be blatantly wrong, so I can't really sympathize with what you're saying. <laughs> Just straight up. Get fucked. <laughs> All right, so uh, let's roll to see who goes first. Brandon, let's reset your live total. Yes. So rolling in chat. Oh, I forgot that's broken. We're going to re we're gonna have to roll a die. So five, six are re-rolls. Let's see what we get. Player four is going first. That's Brandon. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, Brandon, by the way, a side note, I was I was fucking playing some Call of Duty and I made a fucking sniper shotgun. <laughs> it's a shotgun that, that shoots like across the map. People have been like getting so mad about it. <laughs> like really irate. It's Damn. funny, I have to show you. <laughs> oh, I'm actually interested. Uh, Stark says, Brandon, I attacked a player for 70 and the next turn I attacked two players for 125 with Erd Dragon. Oh, well, you missed the Ur Dragon game. You should go back and rewatch it. Uh, no, don't do that. They didn't even let me attack. <laughs> it was just. We were there done was with a it. Wall of, wall of dragons just being like, raw. And we're all like, that's, yeah, we get that's it. completely fine. I, I do that all the time. I kind of like flip through my hand on, on camera. Just, I don't know, don't put my cards yeah. on, on blast, and we're fine. <laughs> Stark, I had. I really uh, don't care. I had Dragon Tempest and uh, Scourge of Alicut out. And um, I threw down eight dragons, plus the the five that were already on the battlefield, and I slapped someone with Ur Dragon for for beefy. All right, describe your deck, Brennan. Let's go. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so <laughs> before we get too wrapped up, thank you very much, everyone who's joined us. We're MTG Lexicon, the dive bar of EDH. I'm going to go ahead and introduce myself. Uh, 
I'm on the bottom left-hand corner of the screen, right down here, as you can see. I'm going to be playing with the Reaper King today. This is a tribal tribal with 26 changelings and a bunch of lords. We're going to be doing a bunch of shenanigans just to get some really cool cheaty things out, including there is an Ur Dragon in this deck, so hopefully uh, you might see that here. Uh, and that's pretty much about it. I'm going to read off some lore for you guys real quick, though, because I think that is fun. All right, so my lore card is... Few things are truly lost at sea. Pass. All right. Um, well, I will be playing Surgeon General Commander, which is a five-color mutate deck. Um, I'm trying to create some monstrosities based off of uh, mutating creatures, drawing cards that way, kind of having like an enchantress effect through my commander. Um, just trying to make a big old beefy thing. Uh, let me read off some flavor text, actually. Let me see. Uh, what's a good one? Well, I like this one. There's beauty in the uncertainty of potential. I like that. Ooh, that All is right. pretty nice. Phantom, what you got going on? Hey guys, it's Phantom905 here. Uh, I'm playing Yannick and Nakara. Uh, just Abzan, Blink Force. Um, this is actually one of the lists from the Trinisphere. Big shout outs to them. Great content creators. Uh, I think this is one of the, I think, Johnny decks um, just recently made, but. Uh, uh, it's not CDH, it's more so casual, so yeah, it's just uh, abs and blink stuff, and yeah, on to you, Johnny. I'm playing Thrax and Mundar. Thank you. He's playing the role of Nathan Explosion. This is my Death Clock theme deck. Yeah! And there's even a custom Dr. Roxo Tarmeret, the rock and roll clown, Brutal. in the deck. Uh, it's a hot mess pile of just Grixis zombies and all that good stuff. And for flavor, take two steps north into the unsettled future, south into the unquiet past, east into the present day, and west into the great unknown. That's cool. I don't Ooh. know what that is. I like that. Yeah, that's the first time I read that flavor text. I was like, hmm, okay, sweet. See, we're rediscovering magic here. That's right. All right, so I'm keeping. Is everybody else keeping? Yep. Keeping. Yep, keeping. Awesome. Cool. We're going to go ahead and kick it off into the next game. I'm going to start off with throwing down a Wooded Foot Hiles. Uh, I'm going to tap it, pay one, and crack it. Uh, and I think I'm just going to get a Shockland in. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I think Aww. I'm going to get a Shockland in. And then I'm going to play Worldly Tutor, and then pass. Sure. Draw a card. Uh, Prismatic Vista, going to pay one life, crack it, get a forest. And I'll play Glade Cover Scout. Hexproof 1-1. One, one. Pass and turn. Sweet, sweet. All right, draw. I'm playing a tap canopy vista. Taps for white and green. Pass. Alright, draw draw my card. I'm gonna play my I'm gonna play my flavor text card. It's a terramorphic expanse. Then I'm going to pass the turn and I'm gonna go crack and look for a land. And all that good stuff. Alright, Brendan's up. Hmm. Uh, okay. Uh, Did you figure out what you're shocking in? Or yeah, yeah, I know buddy? I know what I'm tuning for, and that's the Risen Reef. I'm just trying to find the land. So I'm pretty much just going to draw this. This is going to go to my hand. I'll just throw down another land for now. Uh, we're going to do a Hollowed Fountain into play tapped. I am not paying the two life for it, and I will pass. Sure. Do you want to cut this or tap this? You can do whatever you want. <laughs> trying to one hand the slippery <laughs> motherfucker is just it's like one of those like fishing feet. videos where the person's like trying to hold a catfish it's just like sliding all over the place ooh <laughs> what a noodle alright untapping drawing a card I'm going to cast a or not cast play a, a watery grave shock myself for that um, I'm going to pay two to cast Fertile Ground on my forest 
In Chant Land, whenever Chanted Land is tapped for mana, its controller adds an additional one mana of any color. Um, I'm gonna roll the dice to, to see who I'm pinging for one. Uh, let's do okay. So player three, uh, that's gonna be Brandon taking one. Ooh, okay. Getting a little tickle. Pass the turn. Ooh, ooh. Hmm. Show me on the card where he touched you. No. On a uh, draw. <laughs> Uh, Leonard War Waste, and then I'm going to tap two mana for a Destiny Spinner. Ooh. And I will pass the turn to Johnny. Oh, Destiny I'm Spinner, gonna... not Fate Spinner. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> that's I'm going to play, I'm gonna play a Tainted Peak. Then I'm going to play... I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play uh, expedition map, and then I'm gonna play a mana vault, and then I'll pass the turn. Sweet. Oh wow, nice. Check while you. I'm gonna put down a polluted delta. I'm gonna tap it, crack it, uh, get a thing, and then I'm gonna play risen reef. If you're unfamiliar with risen reef, risen reef says. Uh, whenever Risen Reef or another elemental enters the battlefield under your control, uh, you may, you may, my green, green, black. What colors am I missing? Black, green, white, and, oh, okay. I guess I'll just do that. Sorry. Um, you may reveal the top, uh, sorry, you may look at the top card of your library. If it's a land card, you may put it on the battlefield tapped. If it is not... Uh, reveal that card and put it in your hand. Do I reveal? Shit. Look at the top card of your library. If it's a land card, you may put it into the battlefield tapped. If you don't, put that card uh, into your hand. Okay, I don't have to reveal. White, blue, green, black, red. Yeah, okay. Can you paint with all the color of the wind? Here you go, buddy. Okay, cool. All right, looking at the top card of my library. It is not a land, but I will put it in my hand. Pass. Okay. Let's be chill. Play the planes. <laughs> Tapping four for my commander. Um, I guess I'm just gonna pass turn. No, let's attack Brandon for one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already at 32. I've done enough to myself. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's, it's kind of funny. <laughs> Passing. <laughs> all right, all right. On tap. Draw. He smells blood in the water. I tap two mana and play a Sylvan Carotid. And then I play an Evolving Wilds and crack it and pass the turn. Nice. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and play a Swamp. There's that. I'm going for a thing. Wait for it. Is it in there? The land card. Okay, I'm going to throw Watery Grave in, untap, take two damage off that. Alright, he's shocking himself for two. Shocking okay. for two. Uh, running on water. Sorry, I missed your message. Which commanders are you guys using? They are in the corners. Oh, I see Mountain Mage already said that. Thank you, Mountain Mage. Thanks. Uh, glad you're all on while I do Death Card Commission. Nice. Nevermore Paint Studio. Welcome. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Mountain Mage. 
I'm gonna pass the turn on that. Interesting. Okay. Untap, upkeep, draw. We're gonna throw down. Uh, actually, we're gonna do this first. We are going to play Imposter of the Pride. And uh, it's gonna trigger Risen Reef as an elemental. Let me look at the top card. If it's a land, I may put it into the battlefield tap. It is not. Shit. All right, but I am gonna play Guy's Cradle. And I'm gonna tap that, because I got two. We're gonna add a third, and we're gonna play Descendant's Path. The De Descendant's Path is a really fun card. I'm gonna read it off for you guys real quick here. Card, great card. Uh, Actually, Brandon. No. Don't you fucking gonna, dare. Don't I'm fucking do it. Your oh, descendants get squalled. Are you, are you sure you want to do that to me now? There's worse cards out there. <laughs> yes. uh, I'm sure, yeah, I get the. I don't counter spells much often ever. So, yeah, this is going to take the opportunity we'll have it. Oh, get squalled. Get squalled. That's right. And, take and you two lose life. <sighs> you get squalled hard. Squall Hard, a Dewey <laughs> Cock story. <laughs> Love you, Brandon. <laughs> I mean, you're doing the right thing. I'm not I'm not as upset I, at you doing it. I'm just I, upset I that seen, you're doing it. I've seen that card go oh, ham. I know what it could do in tribal deck. I'm sorry. You mean when you I have every tribal... creature type? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You went <laughs> you went your dragon tribal ham last game, so Sorry. What? I can do my dragon tribal hand this game too. <laughs> that's the, exactly. <laughs> Alright, uh, that's going to be it for my, my turn. Okay, we on top, draw a card. Okay. I'm just saying, you should have saved it. Ah, whatever. <laughs> this man's got mutate over here. Ooh, mutate. Mute. I like how you say that, and you're like, play an island. And I play this. Um, I'm going to pass turn. I did notice that Johnny's commander is wrong. That's Traxos for some reason. Oh, what? <laughs> what, what did I do? Playing? What did I do? I put Grixis, and then I selected Traxos. Hell yeah. Who? It's a Thraxamundo. Yeah, I... Oh, okay. Like Thrax, I can't. Yes, I fat fingered the fuck out of that. And the uh, <laughs> the zombie. It's gotcha. Sorry, uh, Horse Father, you said you were done? Yes. Okay, okay. All on top. Play caves? I'm gonna tap the caves and play a soul ring. <laughs> I'm kind of upset, Johnny. That was a a dick move. Yeah, I will yeah. cast. I will cast my commander Yannick. Uh, he cannot be countered, so don't even try, Johnny. And then <laughs> I'm, gonna exile I'm gonna put two counters on my Sylvan Keratid. And then uh, I'm gonna pass the turn to you, Johnny. Anything have Death Touch out there? Nope. Yet. No. <laughs> All right. Let's. Uh... Play my island. Derp. McDerp. All the McDerpies. That's right. We're going to play Thrax Mundar. It has haste. And whenever it attacks, defending player sacrifices a creature. When a player sacrifices a creature, put I might put a 1 1 counter on Thrax Mundar. Okay. So um, let's see. I'm going to put a stop on your combat or before combat. Um, I'm going to pay six to uh, mutate Dirge Bat as Flash um, onto my Glade Cover Scout. Uh, whenever this creature mutates, destroy target creature or planeswalker and opponent controls. I'm going to destroy the Ducks of Mundar. 
Damn. And I'm gonna draw Oof. Card. Seems fair. I guess I'm passing the turn. Oh no, I'm gonna waste Good. this counter. Oh no, Well, I mean, you couldn't counter this with that. It was a non creature spell. Shh. I'm trying to make a point here, Johnny. <laughs> 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 Why are you raiding on my parade? <laughs> <laughs> We're going to play a windswept height. What the fuck? Uh, let's see. Uh, how am I going to do this? Um, yes. Yeah. Okay. We're going to play Kindred Discovery. As it enters the battlefield, choose a creature type. Elementals, I guess. Uh, whenever a creature of the chosen creature type enters the battlefield or attacks, draw a card. We're swinging over there at the Trash Master for a whopping four damage. <laughs> and I will draw two cards. with my face and unfortunately that's gonna be it I didn't get what I wanted so uh, yeah pass sure I'm gonna go get more of that piss sauce sure thing okay let's shock for a steam vents Let us see. Um, I'm going to cast Citizen Training. Um, let's do it like this and this, I believe. Or no, like this. So I'm going to cast it. Um, Enchanted Creature you control when Citizen Training enters the battlefield, draw a card. Enchanted Creature gets 1 0 and has trampled. I'm going to put it on my Dirge Bat. Um, I'll be drawing two cards because of my certain general commander and that. Um, so let's do that real quick. Okay. Um, hmm. I'm going to mutate. So for five, I'll be mutating Trumpeting Gnar onto my Dirge Bat. Yeah. Nice. Uh, it says whenever this creature mutates, create a 3-3 three, three green beast creature token. So I'll create a 3-3 three, three, and I'll be uh, triggering Dirge Bat's ability uh, to destroy the Risen Reef. Yep, makes sense. Um, I'll also create a 3-3 three, three and draw a card. You're not going to get rid of his commander? No. Hmm. His commander's still. Uh, move oh. to combat. <laughs> Swing over at Brandon for, th for four, actually. What? Okay. Eat, eat eggs. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Suck on these huevos, Johnny. All right, passing the turn. Already <laughs> on top. <laughs> Phantom's over here, 40 life. He's just like, y'all can duke it out. Leave me alone. I'm about to eat it, you guys. Ain't no attention to me. Right. I'm just a skulking in the bushes. <laughs> this, this is my little beast of burden right here. It has a hat. I love it. This beast is okay, very it. burdened. Is that a backwards hat or is that a sombrero? Uh, it's some kind of Abraham Lincoln ass top hat, but you know. Why is then? Sh I have so many I questions. Have <laughs> uh, just tapping three and playing my other commander, Nakara. So it's uh, whenever another creature leaves the battlefield if it had one or more counters on it i draw a card and i would lose one life uh and i think i'm just going to uh johnny you have a three three or two two three three have... oh yeah oh it is a three three okay oh, are we gonna squab are we squabbling right now you want to you want to squab <laughs> no, no no i'll while I, while i can <laughs> i'll, I'll I'll pick at uh, the Trash Master for three. <laughs> little, little trash I feel picking. like the top half of this board is I'll attack, like... Yeah, I'll attack the Trash Master for three and uh, Doing I'll just pass good. it to her. 
And the bottom half of this board is doing not so good. <laughs> you're, you're not going to politic your way out of this, Mr. Tr <laughs> Mr. Brandon. Mr. Discovery bullshit. Dude. You're not politicking out of this one. I didn't even get a land from it yet. Yeah, Whoa. that's right. <laughs> <laughs> GMGC right. gifting a sub. Thank you very much. We're, uh, I'm at uh, was 31. There any, did you, yeah, you're at 31, and then it should be Johnny's Yeah, I'm blocking with my face. All right, so we untap. And I'm like, oh, oh, can you on my screen, please? please? Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. One, two, three. And Harrison, thank you very much for joining us. And, yes, throw up that mana screw. Uh, this is... Attributed to me always not having mana, so whenever you see someone else without that mana, you better throw that out. Thanks for that, uh, Gifts of right, GMC. Gone for a minute now. I'm, I'm going to take another one point of Hell damage yeah, off the of mana vault. Six one. So I'm down to 30. Draw my card. All right, Thank you again, then, GMGC. Uh, Appreciate it. Pay a red. Uh, or put a mount, play, I'll play a mount. Okay, red. You're my special friend. <laughs> Hashadamas. Thank you for that follow. Thank you. Hashadamas. <laughs> Johnny, is that an old school Sonic's jersey? Yes, it is. Good eye. I call All right. it the I'm gonna uh, play... Space Jam jersey. Mm -hmm. It is very Space, space Jam. Jam jersey. I'm going to play Chandra Fire Artisan, and I'll plus one her. She's at five. I'll draw. Oh, Can you um, list off the rest of the abilities? Uh, all right. So the Fire Artisan, no, whenever Chandra, or whenever one or more loyalty counters are removed from Chandra Fire Artisan, she deals that much damage to target opponent or Planeswalker, plus one ability. Uh, exile the top card of the library. You may play that I'm card this turn. Minus away. seven. Exile the top seven cards of the library. Everywhere. You may play yeah. them this turn. All right. So I'm gonna plus one. We're exiling. Do I have to reveal that? I just exile it, right? Peek. You know yeah. that looks really weird backwards. Yeah, it's kind of scary. Chandra backwards. It's Peyton. <laughs> And now we flip it back on over. And I played my land that's going to be exiled, and... Yeah, you exile and, it face and... up. Face up? Alright. Yeah, unless it says face down, it's exiled face up. Alright, so I've got a swamp face up, and I'll pass the turn. Because I already played my land this turn. Daisy. Ah, someone killed my Risen Reef, which is very unfortunate. Who would do such a thing? That's kind of right? fucked up. What kind of monster does that? piece of shit? Savages. Fuck that guy. Fuck that guy. Um. Right ear hole. All right. Uh, we're gonna swing Imposter of the Pride over at Chandra for three. I will draw a All card. Right. Chandra. Is that two? Fuck. And its ability triggers. What? Oh. As a static. Never one or more loyalty comes. Target opponent. Surprise. Oh, yeah. You're right. Oh, all right. So, any planeswalkers out there? No. Yet. Okay. Um, Phantom, take three. <laughs> Finally. Yep, I'll take it. Okay. Uh, what am I gonna do here? I uh, I've got I got five on it. Oh, dude, Roger Grin, a fucking uh, NBA Jam is so good. They they have it at the little arcade next to the Fox, um, and over in Oakland. Been jamming that after shows. Actually, <laughs> fucking shows, dude. I forgot what a show was. I haven't seen a concert in forever. Oh no, oh no, I made myself sad. <laughs> oh no, Johnny got oh, the downs. No. Sad. Sad. Hmm. <laughs> Pick a minor. One, two, four, five. Hello. Fuck. 
for two, I'm going to play Prismatic Omen. Uh, lands you control are every basic land type in addition to their other types, which means I don't have to crack Windswept Heath. Uh, I'm going to tap four. And we're going to play War Spike Changeling. It's a changeling in addition, so it becomes, I'm sorry, it is all creature types. Uh, one red gains first strike until end of turn. It is a 3-3. Three, three. Uh, trigger from Kindred Discovery. Draw a card. And that's not what I wanted either. So I will now pass. Great. All righty then. Was that a Jim Carrey reference? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I don't uh, know. Tap and draw in. I don't know. <clears throat> Who would One, kill two, a baby three, Jace four, with five, zero six, cards seven. in his graveyard? <gasps> That's true. Who would do that? Those are savages. Monsters. For four, let's mutate uh, Glowstone Recluse onto my Dirge Bat. So it's uh, whenever this creature mutates, put two one one counters on it. I'll tr trigger Trumpeting Gnar and Dirge Bat. Nice. So I'll create a... Um, put two guys on this. I'll create another beast. This this Vigor Turtle is a fucking beast. What Who made the this Vigor Turtle? Are you doing? Who I'm going to make so you a beast. This mutated creature, does it have Hexproof? It Not does. Yet. It does. What? From what? Glade Cover, Glade Cover Scout was the oh, initial one. Oh, got it. It does have Hexproof. <laughs> oh, oh man. I told you guys, save that counter, but no. Well, I mean, you couldn't counter anyway. It's yeah. not a creature, you asshole. Um, hey, Phantom, if I don't destroy your shit, will you leave me alone? <laughs> wow. <laughs> I, yeah, like... I don't <laughs> <laughs> not, not giving you many options, huh? Uh, I'm going to destroy Brandon's fucking War Spike Changeling. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I don't okay, bro. Draw a card from my Surgeon General. <laughs> Oh god, this is funny. All right, <laughs> let's play a Ralgren Triome in Taps. That's Just Guy one. Um, I'm going to cast for two black and another a Demonic Embrace. Uh, enchant creature. Enchant creature has plus three plus one. Has flying and is a demon in addition to its other types. I may cast Demonic Embrace from my graveyard by paying 3 life and discarding a card in addition to paying it to the costs. So we're going to slap that thing right over here on, on this big boy. Draw a card. I'm going to move to combat. And... Uh, I'm sorry, Brandon. The wait, wait, wait. I'm making this for you, so you can't swing at me. I guess, okay, I won't swing at you with the fucking... with the bat. I'll swing at you with a 3-3 beast, though. And that thing's All still right, dead. All right, I'll take three. One, <laughs> two, three. And what? That, that War Spike Changeling is dead. Oh, you killed it? Yeah. I killed oh, it. why? All right, Dirge Bat's coming over at Phantom. How big, how big is, is the Dirge How bat? big is it? So six plus three more. That's a nine. Wait. That's nine damage in the air. Six plus three Oh, more? in the air? Yeah. Wait, what do you mean oh, six? Oh, actually, no. This yes. five plus one. Yeah, it is, it is six. So five plus one here what? plus three. Does it give? It is a one out. Enchanted. Oh. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't see that. That was an enchantment. Yeah, I thought it was a creature. Yeah. yeah. I was like, how? It's on top of whatever. Yeah. So I, I'm oh. I'm taking nine. Yes. Okay. I I have no blocks. It's in the air, right? Yes. Are you all playing together, or um, someone is remote? passing turn? So uh, both these two, the top right and the bottom right, are both remote. And then Johnny and I are here in the same room together, uh, but we're we're miles apart here at this table. It's a long reach to the other side. And he comes an inch closer. I will chop his hand off. The knife's ready. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. Go ahead, Phantom. Yeah, uh, I just played a swamp, and I'm tapping two for a uh, ramble with Paragon. Uh -huh. um, it just pretty much says each creature I control with a one-one counter has trample. Uh, I'll move to combat. You have uh, how many blockers, Johnny? Uh, uh, not Trash Master. I have one three-three beast. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'll come at you with uh, Nakara and Yannick for five. So, did that first strike? Uh, Nakara has Menace, but this is just a 3-3 Vigilance. Um, I'll block the 3-3 Vigi with the Beast. Okay. I'm gonna send, uh, Yannick, uh, to the command zone after- oh, well, it'll dive, but go to the command zone. Sure. And then Destiny Spinner will return. Uh, and, uh, pass- I'll pass the turn to, uh, Johnny. I took two, right? Two commander? Uh, yeah, two- two commander. Gotcha. Right. Next time, so can you just pass the turn to me? Just skip Johnny. Ooh, fuck him happen. up, Johnny. I'm he's gonna... talking shit. Oh, he's always talking shit. Well, great. Johnny's over here counting my sh countering my shit when there's other things to worry about. Said Only for you, really. I know, it's with true. <laughs> Please. I'm not feeling sorry for that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm untapping my mana, whatchamacallit. I'm drawing my card. <gasps> Oh, Sounds it's... like you just took a shit. Almost. Nearly did. Hang on. Wait for it. <laughs> I'm going to tick Chandra up. Let's see what we got. What's in the exile? Oh. Torrent. I think, uh... I think, uh... Oh, can I... Can we live the dream? What dream can we live here? I'm gonna play my swamp. Mm -hmm. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Alright, I got black, black, black. Yeah, got it. We're gonna tap this. We're gonna go triple black across the board. I get to play this for off of the Chandra, and then I'm going to play a Fleshbag Marauder. All players sacrifice a creature. And uh, Fleshbag's going in the yard, and y'all get to pick something to sacrifice. Second and Beast. And I'll pass the turn. Hmm. So, question, what's in everybody's graveyard, creature-wise? Not that. Uh, oh, well. Over here at the uh, Thraxamundar's used car lot, used corpse lot, sorry. <laughs> uh, it's just a flesh bag, sorry. <laughs> Fantastic. I have a Ramblewood Paragon. It's a 2-2. Each yeah. other creature with a 1-1 counter would have Trample. Hmm. I'm going to do it. I'm going to make anime real. I'm going to tap all black. I'm going to play Patriarch's Bidding. Each player chooses a creature type. Then each player returns all creatures of the chosen creature type from their graveyard to the battlefield. I'm going to choose Elemental. I guess I'll choose uh, Elf Warrior or Elf. All right. We get to choose each of us. Cool. I'm going to choose zombies. All right. And to the battlefield. I'm not sure, but I hold on. I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to can I, can I respond to like the who who gets what? Like um like before that card resolves, can I actually respond to it? Uh, with this, okay, so here's... You can respond to anyone, You like... can respond to the spell on the stack, but once this spell resolves and cards start coming onto the battlefield, you uh -huh. cannot respond to that until ETBs are stacked. Does that make sense? Yeah, when, yeah, when, yeah. once it's resolving and people are choosing things, you can't respond to that. Right, so if I'm casting this, you can respond to this with something else on the stack, but if this is clearing and resolving... You cannot respond to what has been chosen to come into play. You can respond to ETBs on the stack. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. All right, thank you. Yeah, uh, it, it happens. Yeah, you can get okay. uh, flashback. All right. 
cool. Uh, since, and now this is one I'm not 100% sure on, but I think it is, is it with Risen Reef coming in, uh, it sees the other two coming in, and so it's gonna trigger three times. Is that right? I think that's right. Correct so, me if I'm wrong, but I think that's how that's gonna work. Sounds right. And then, Okay, and then Fleshback's going to come in, and then we have to choose to sack another creature again. Yes. Okay. Yes. Great. All right, so I'm going to do my Risen Reef triggers first. Uh, so I will do the top three. So the first one, it is not a land. Second one, not a land. Shit. Third one, it is not a land. Fuck. Uh, Kindred Discovery trigger. One, two, three. I'm drawing three cards. Still no land. Sack my commander. All I'm, right. uh, sorry, I'm just, I'm floating, uh, a black with carotid, and then I'm going to lose a life and draw a card, Johnny. Oh, wait, you know that you got your Bramble Paragon in the battlefield, right? You still want to do that? Does it go into the battlefield? I thought it goes to your hand. No, no it, it goes, goes to the battlefield. battlefield. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure. I, I'll, I'll do carotid. I'd rather just draw a card. Okay, cool. Uh, I will get rid of Imposter of the Sixth Pride. That's going to go there. I'm going to tap Gaia's Cradle for three while I had them, I guess. Actually, I cannot respond to that. Johnny, I lose one life, by the way. Oh, sure. You got it. I don't think I can respond to the state-based action of it. Oh, no, because the ETB goes on the stack. has to be observed. So if I respond to that on the stack, I can tap Cradle for the three yes. that I have here. Okay, sorry. You're good. I'm just going through it through my head. You're good. Uh, oh, it's only three. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to throw down a Priestess of Titania for two. And with the one floating, I'm going to tell myself to go get fucked. So... Past turn, I will have to discard down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have to get rid of tree cards. One. Temple of Plenty, you want to scry one? Two. Put on the bottom. Let's cast a Staggering Insight. Uh, Enchanted Creature has plus one, plus one, and has lifelink, and whenever this creature deals common damage to a player, draw wait, a card. Wait, wait, wait. What? Oh, you sacked your commander. Yes. Um, move to combat. Because Brandon keeps asking bad questions, I'm going to swing at him for a lot. What the <laughs> fuck? Why? I keep asking questions I don't like. Like, what did you sack? Because I yeah. wasn't paying attention because I was well, doing my own now, thing? Now I guess you're taking 10. <laughs> wow. And I'm getting 10. <laughs> and I draw a card. How's that 20, right? Or 25? <laughs> yeah. I'm okay. um, going to play a Paradise Druid as Hexproof. Uh, shit, I guess I'm passing turn after that. Go ahead. All right, I'm tapping six mana for uh, Yannick again. Uh, it'll enter the battlefield. 
Uh, this time, I will exile um, Bramblewood Paragon. I'll distribute two counters on uh, on any number of creatures. Yeah, I'll put it on uh, Nakara. And or hmm, tough spot, tough spot. What? How are you in that tough spot? You hear him? Kill this man, right? <laughs> I'll put on Destiny Spinner instead, uh, and then I'll move to combat, and I will. Uh, attack uh, horse father with uh, the a four five, and then I'm gonna attack the Chandra for for two with menace. Cry I'm taking harder. four. Cry harder, Brandon. I want to taste those tears. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Hush, Domus, uh, mutate is uh, casting a creature for an alternate cost. Um, you get to put it on a uh, non-human creature, either over and under it. It will have the body that's on top of the stack um, and has the abilities of everything that's within that stack. It's in regards to mutate, specifically. No, I mean everything. But even if it's not a mutate creature, it'll still have... Uh, no, I mean with the putting a creature on top or on bottom yes. of the stack. Yes. After uh, that, I'm going to pass the turn to the Trash Master. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Or how I should say, oh. Uh. Oh. Oh, I'm gonna take. Uh, I'm not gonna untap and memo go out there, so I'm gonna take one point off of that. Let's go ahead. Okay, before I go play, then let's go ahead and take Chandra up, exile a card. What's going on? Hush, uh -oh. Yes, that's why I chose a a Bogles to pretty much be my my mutate feature, so it has a hexproof on it. Yeah, and then. I'm going to use my Lord of the Undead to bring bring the uh, flesh bag back to hand. I'm gonna play the flesh bag. Flesh bag is gonna help everyone picks a creature and sacrifices it. I'm gonna pay another three and put my crystal rod on the field. Boom. Sorry, crystal shard. Shard. Can you do flesh bag like... one more time? Each Brandon. Me to... No, I can't get Fleshbag to go off one more time. Um, I lose a life, Johnny. Sure. Don't think. Is there some shenanigans I can do? I don't think so. Nope, Crystal Shards in play. That's, uh, that's all I got. Uh, Hush Thomas, yes. Either um, a small creature that has like, hexproof, that's my focus, or um, usually something that has a really strong ability but has a weak body. Things like Needle Spectre, where it's a 1-1 one, one flyer for 3, and when it does common damage, that player discards that many cards. Um, and so you'll just buff the body and make it way bigger than it was supposed to be to make the ability a lot more devastating. Things like that. Uh, counters also work very well. That's why the Precon has Hydras, because there's zero zeros with counters, so the Mutate will buff them considerably. Which is pretty fun. All right, All right. So Brandon, it's your turn. Untap. I did my little okay. flesh bag shenanigans. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't even know what I'm going to do here, honestly. Uh... <clears throat> I'm fine with a board wipe. Oh, great. Are you going to play one? <laughs> That's what I thought. Because Bra Brandon doesn't play board wipe. I wish he only I had plays one. Death, Death region. Call it. At least it was a dragon. <laughs> at, least, at least you have morals. At least. At the very least. Okay. Um. Hmm. Four, 
Yeah, right. Uh, the Nissa World Waker lands have a really weird layering effect, where they get it gets overridden, so it's it's not a good thing to mutate onto. Mute just has like weird rule things too, where if if you were to like. Let's say flicker a mutate stack. They all the creatures that are on there that are mutate creatures would come back separately onto the battlefield. It's uh, it's a little bit gnarly like that. That's funky. You go from like this one Voltroni type thing to oops, all creatures. That's right. Bananas. Um, one with a win from Ixalan is a pretty good card to have in a in a deck like this, where like uh, you get to uh, exile a creature and um, its controller can play the the spell for free. Um, on their turn. So you can save your stack and then like replay everything for free separately. Okay. I'm gonna tap Gaius for two, Priest for one, and a black. I'm gonna play uh, Grave Shifter. Changeling, when it enters the battlefield, you may return target creature card from a graveyard to your hand. We're gonna return Imposter of the Sixth Pride to my hand. Uh, trigger Kindred Discovery. I will draw a card. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that that worked like that. Yeah, uh, mutate is pretty weird. Not very intuitive when it comes to those things, really. Yeah, you have a reef trigger. Yeah. Also, if you mutate a commander and cast le leadership vacuum, it'll bounce all cards mutated from the commander onto the command zone Did where I they can never return from. Right? That is correct. <laughs> that, is, that is also very correct. Oh, I did tap that wrong. I was like, for some reason, when I did the math, it didn't... It checked out, but then when I just did it, it did not. Okay, wait. Two, three, four. Be right back. Oh, I guess it doesn't. That's why. Okay, never mind. I messed up on that. Okay. Let's see. What are we gonna do? I, I think I should be a twenty-nine life. Don't the man of all. don't know what to do here. If he slaps me again with that flying piece of shit, I'm gonna be ultra dead. I've gotta have something out. Um, okay. Fuck, if he mutates, he's just gonna kill it. Oh god, this is agitating. Does anyone have any way of dealing with that thing? Uh, uh, thing I got yeah, nothing. Me. Sorry, I mean, I've been just drawing lands. I'll be straight up with you. Okay, so your fleshback's going to take a whole nother turn. He's just going to play another right. creature. Right. you got to find a way to do fleshback twice. That's, uh, that's a tricky... Oh, shit. Well... Okay. Uh, I'm going to play Vampiric Tutor. Search for a card. Some very nice ultra of a Vampiric Tutor you got there. I know. You like it? Very uh -huh. in.
Ah, oh, fuck, I missed a Risen Reef trigger, but whatever. It's my fault. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna live very long. So instead of going for anything really, I think I'm just gonna go for fun stuff now. Because why not? Why not? Dash wood. Anyone have any creatures with flying in their graveyard? No. Uh, nah. Eh, okay. Figured I'd ask. I was thinking of doing something funny. You know, doing something funny. Yeah. Okay. Put these back. Okay. All right, chosen card is going into my hand. Okay. I'm gonna shuffle real quick. Cut, please. Uh, not exactly. It depends on how they leave the battlefield. If they die, they all die together. If they're bounced, they all come back to your hand because it's considered one creature. Flicker, they all enter separately. Um, that's how it happens. It's better to just read up on the cases because it's not very clear. Imposter of the Six Pride. It's gonna trigger Risen Reef. Reliquary Tower enters the battlefield tapped. Uh, and that's uh, that's going to be it for me. That's it. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have to discard a card. Do Path of Ancestry. It must be how like, Matt feels like playing Voltron. I love it. <laughs> uh, let's... To be fair, Matt's Voltron's decks are pretty fun. I don't know why he got rid of his uh, XX. Uh, oh, Rasheen? Yeah, Rasheen. Ah, he doesn't like it anymore. What? The deck was fun. Oh, Tower, why discard? You're right. I'm an idiot. I think he's just tired of doing the same thing with that. Let me see. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, for six, I'll be uh, mutating Auspicious Derricks onto my bullshit. And I'm going to mutate it over the Dirge Bat. This is a 6-6 six, six body. Pretty big. Um, it's going to trigger everything on the stack. I want to get two counters on it. Um, I'm going to create a beast. Noise. Let's use Brandon's beast. Hell yeah. Um, I'm going to um, do. I'm going to kill something. Let's kill the zombie that Johnny has. Oh. Oop. Because I don't want to get flashbacked mm. many more times. And auspicious Asterisk itself is going to do a crazy effect. So whenever this creature mutates, exile cards from the top of your library until you exile X permanent cards, where X is the number of the times this creature has mutated. Put those permanent cards onto the battlefield. Uh, this has oh mutated God. a total of four times. Yeah. Damn. So we're going to get four permanents onto the battlefield. Let's see, Temple of Silence. Nice. Comes in. Uh, Pouncing Shore Shark comes in. Hydroid Crisis comes in to zero, 0 so it's going to die. And Command Tower comes in. Uh, I'm going to scry nice. one from this. Let's keep this on top. Uh, fix my deck. Okay. Um, and we're going to cast Ancestral Mask onto my big-ass creature, make it even bigger. Oh, gross. Enchanted creature gets plus two, plus two for each other enchantment in play. Uh, two oh, from no. me? So it gets four from you. Then uh, one, from two, me. three, six. And how many from you? Oh, uh, none on both of you guys' side. Okay, gotcha. Zero, zero. All right, cool. So it gets a 10-10. Ten, ten. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kill Brandon. Are you sure? Yes. I'm giving you the extra bonus. No, I don't care. Oh. <laughs> what about me? What, what, what about me? No, it's killing Brandon. 
It's time for murder. Don't forget to destroy. Oh, you already did. Yes. All right. I told you, everyone, that's how it was going to happen. Uh, so I, I was saying while you were out that I should get a flying creature on the battlefield to block with. Yes. I figured uh, you would do something to fuck me thing, fuck me up a little bit. No. And I was just like, I'm just going to go for fun. Uh, I, I went for a cryptic gateway because uh-huh. uh, there's a lot of fun you can do with oh, that. Oh, yeah. That would have been sweet. Uh, so the, the idea or plan. Do you have a dragon in hand? No. The uh. idea in hand was to do a, a really a war leader and then do a kindred summons for dragons. And then get the dragons oh, out, wow. and then war leader, yeah. and then cryptic gateway would bring them out for nothing. Yep. Uh, so that was the plan, but yeah, you got me. Yeah, I did twenty five damage to that swing. I, 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 li- I literally said it right when you were out too. I was like, I need to get a flyer, otherwise he's just gonna kill me. And draw a card, and I'm gonna pass the turnover. Uh, what? Are, <sighs> what what's in your graveyard, uh, Johnny? I've got a Paradise Druid, Prismatic Vista, and a Hydroid Crasis. I'm going to tap a Swamp and cast a Cling to Dust, targeting the Hydroid Crasis. It's going to exile it, and I'll gain three life. Sure thing. Now, Johnny, what are you not going to do next time at the beginning of the game? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> it wouldn't have helped, Brandon. It fucking would have. No, it wouldn't have. I've been casting creatures. <laughs> you it li- would have given me uh, something to battle you with, okay? You, you tiny baby. <laughs> you little baby. Why'd you have to count on my shit? Well, what were you going to do, you little baby? <laughs> oh, you little baby. Uh, I'm just saying, learn from your mistakes. Don't let this man do anything. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> It is a, a solid foundation that you built with the creatures having hexproof or indestructible. And they stuff have like to. That. They have to. Yeah. Well, it it makes fucked, sense. Dude. It totally <laughs> makes sense. Well, let's get like, you know, five for one. This is the, <laughs> wait, this is the second time that I've had to deal with your deck in a deck that I just don't have any removal. Wipes with? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Surprise. <laughs> I feel I... like you planned this. Damn it. I don't know. Having removal is pretty good, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I will uh, play Revel Arc as my flyer for the turn. All right. Nice. And uh, <laughs> I guess I will. I refuse. Move to combat. How big are? How big is your stuff, Johnny? I mean, like not. Yeah. How big is your stuff? How big is the Sore Shark? And uh, so I got a three three and a four three open. A oh, four three. Okay. I'm really kind of sad that the Sword Shark came out that way because it would have been really fun to see you mutate that. Yeah, it would have been sweet. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I just I'm gonna come at you, Johnny, with uh, both my creatures. One's a three three, and one's a two two with menace. Okay, I'll block the two two with menace with both creatures, and I'll take three. Brandon Cruiser instead of Battle Cruiser. Okay. <laughs> um, I mean. The, the nice thing about Reaper King is it's a uh, destroy target. It's a lethal... We- what is it? Not lethal weapon. That's a good movie. Uh, <laughs> legacy weapon. Yeah, it's yeah. legacy weapon on a, on a giant stick. But the yes. problem is with the hexproof, I, I don't have any removal for that in this deck. I should probably uh, put a spear in here. Tony, I'm going to pass the turn to you. I'm going to put uh, Nakara in my graveyard. Sounds good. Right. Uh, I'm going to just... That's what I should do. 28 off of the Mana Vault. Oh, my card. Uh, Take Chandra up. Oh, true. Legacy Weapon does Exile instead. Yeah. Fuck. Exile. Well, it's close. Not exactly, but it's close. Play the Swamp. It is all super hexproof, yes? This is. Uh, these are not. Okay. Fun times. And you're tapped out. Okay. Well, how about this? At the very least, Dr. Roxo makes his appearance. And then, uh, Johnny, I'm going to go ahead and pay a blue. And I'm going to attempt to Crystal Shard bounce your token back to your hand. It gets bounced. Unless you pay the one. 
Okay. You pay the one? No. Oh, all right. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> and uh, oh, all right. That's my turn. Okay. Let us uh, tap, draw a card. Hmm. Um, I'm going to mutate Sawtust Demolisher onto my my Sterix. Um, it's a trample and uh, six six. Whenever this creature mutates, destroy target non-creature permanent. Its controller creates a three three green beast creature token. So a beef within. Yes, it's a beast within, but can't target creatures. Um, we are going to destroy uh, the Crystal Shard. You get a 3-3 beast. Um, and Dirge Bat's going to kill Phantom's Commander. Um, I'm going to get two counters so on this creature. Create a beast. Um, and I'm going to exile... So one, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna exile five cards from my li five permanents from my library to put onto the battlefield. Uh, we have Zagoth Triome comes in tapped. We have a swamp. Uh, Rancor comes in onto my creature. That's three. Um, Season of Growth. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield under your control, try one. And whenever you cast a spell that targets a creature you control, draw a card. And five is going to be a Shittering Harvester. Four, six. So uh, shitting so Harvester? Yes. Yes, a Shittering so Harvester. So if a chicken inside a duck inside a turkey is a turducken. Scry one. What the uh, hell does Johnny have over there? <laughs> put this on the bottom. <laughs> Some kind of abomination, let me tell you. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> um, uh, one, for two. Bat yakin for bat so this can one shot someone, I'm Seven. presuming. Yeah, pretty much. Um, it has trample now, right? Or did it have trample already? It did have trample already from the citizen training enchantment. Um, I'm gonna bestow Chromanticore onto it. <laughs> Jesus! Because <laughs> I never got to do it. I love Chromanticore. I never got to use it ever. <laughs> but now it's here. It gives it four four flying first strike vigilance trample and life link. Oh my god, that's. Move Badness. to combat and gonna go uh, swing at Phantom for a lot. Uh, I have three toughness. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> so, 12, 12, 13, 16, 17, 19. 23 and okay <laughs> oh god I think I think you're pretty much dead 23 plus uh, ancestral mask 2 4 6 8 10 so 33 coming at you yeah I'm, I'm just at negative one you got me all Good right game. damn one two, two, one two three I draw a card I'm gonna pass the turnover Gee, what's going to happen? I think I'm going to take another one off my mana vault. I'm going to uh, draw my card. and Where, with hell... Where was that last game? <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. I'm going to take Chandra right, up to see what I get here. Vigilance. Thank you. I lost track of things. <sighs> hexproof. Freaking hexproof. Swear to God. <laughs> Everyone's favorite mechanic. Definitely a big pile. It's a fat ass beef. pile right there. It's a lot of a lot of my deck right there. That's a, it's a thick pile. Mm, Keyword stew. Mm. Okay, well, track of every ability this. in that stack. I don't believe you. <laughs> Bloody nut stack. What? The next what time he I? mutates, it's just like the uh, what is it? The mathematical thing, just like floating around. Yeah. Him. Oh god, is it over yet? I think it's over. I think I can... I'm gonna do this just for the sake of doing it. I don't think there's anything to actually hit. I'm gonna overload a Vandablast, cause whatever. 
Okay. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna play a red boar, and I'll hit your what was it the shore shark thing the sharky mutant yeah shark that's hitting the gym there you go <laughs> there you go stuff up and put shark, it down. wait isn't that a cartoon yeah. those are these, these like buff ass sharks those are cartoons you're talking about uh, street sharks bro. yeah street sharks that's what it was yeah <laughs> they played hockey oh yeah that's what it was okay then i'll pass the turn and yeah there you go mountain face. says uh street sharks yeah sounds good it was that uh, what else came out around that time biker mice from mars uh, move what? to combat, swing for a lot. Yeah. 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 He All got right. it, he got it. Okay. The pile. And then, what? uh, what else came out around that time? Bucky O'Hare was another one. Bucky O'Hare. I don't recall that one. I don't recall Bucky O'Hare. Alright, good game, y'all. Yeah, if fucking, uh, if that was a board wipe, that would have really fucked my shit up. <laughs> Quite honestly, <laughs> Bucky O'Hara was like a bunch of like innuendos that were not meant for children. Definitely oh, yeah. a show the, made the for tick adults. Was around then. What was it? The, the the second tick iteration was around that time. Yeah, Tick was around that time. What are the weird shows came out around that time? Toe Jam and Earl, I think, had a a short stint. Yeah, I did. And then Sonic the Hedgehog had a short stint. What about the show with Battle the two Toads cats that had a mech or something? Like, That's called Swat Cats. I'm pretty sure. I think that was Swat Cats. Feral cats, <laughs> pretty much. Feral cats. Ren and Stimpy. Oh God, that cartoon. Is Mega so... Man. Oh, Kirby had a show out around that time too, right? Or was that two thousands? Uh, I think that was two thousand. I, mean, I, I don't know. I think that was like early two thousands. You know, th- as a grown up, going back to like rewatch some of the Ren and Stimpy, and thinking to myself. I can't believe my parents let me watch this crap. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, that's that's definitely not a good one. Oh yeah, for Kirby children. Has late 90s. There's okay. some in a, there's some things ah, that gotcha. just don't belong. Rocco's in Modern Life. Head. That was another good one. Acrobats. Uh, hey Johnny, do you have a list for that deck? I've also built a five color mutate deck, and I'm interested in your version. Um, I do have a, a list. I'm going to update it to be sure it's 100 accurate uh, to what I currently have. Um, there's a couple things I might swap in. Um, I forgot to update it, but uh. If you join our Discord, which is uh, free to do, or if you if you pay one dollar, you get access to like all these other rooms. Um, if you hit our Discord and message me, which is Horsefather Deluxe, you can also message Horsefather, Horsefather Deluxe on on Twitch. Um, DM me, and I'll I'll send you the link to the list, so you you don't have to worry about it. Uh, feel free to bug me because sometimes I forget. It just kind of happens, but uh, Horsefather Deluxe on Discord or on Twitch, and I will hook you up with the list. Yeah, and uh, we try and keep the list up to date. Um, so on and so forth. Uh, before we we continue forward, it is eleven. I know some people turn into pumpkins. I'm good for one last game. I'm oh, down for one more. What do you guys I, think? I can, I, I'm down for one. I'm down for one. Johnny, you down for I the last am, game? Can I, I convince need you? Pumpkin. <laughs> no, it's two a.m. out here. I have, I'm a pumpkin. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> it's okay, pumpkin. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> you deserve rest, my friend. <laughs> All right, Johnny. Well, before you leave, please tell us about yourself. Shameless plugs, as many as you can. I'm shamelessly plugging. I'm on the Twitters at the Johnny Mulligans. Uh, you can find me over at the They Said We Said channel occasionally doing bad movie, re- movie reviews about bad movies. Some that are even worse than others, but not quite Samurai Cop. Not yet. We are... Uh, <laughs> So far, the worst one has been Cabin Boy. Ugh. That's that's yeah. one, yeah. <laughs> that one was rough, but Samurai Cop really takes it down. So, uh, and then you can find me hanging out in the Discord, possibly picking up some pickup games and picking picking up picking up picking up. I'm gonna yeah. This time I'm done. <laughs> Dumb toes. <laughs> <laughs> I feel that. Well, thank you so much for joining us. You you rest up and have a good night. All right. Thanks for having me, guys. You're awesome, my friend. You take care. Johnny, good game, man. Take care, dude. Take Take care, Johnny. All right. Hey, The Strange, what is up? If you guys didn't know, go check out The Strange. He does uh, awesome retro late night gameplay. I believe he's doing some tonight, too. Um, He plays old games. He plays new new games. We have him here on stream to join us. I love uh, The Strange. We're sweetheart. Uh, So go check out The Strange. Really great guy. Really love him. Dale subscribed. Hell yeah. Dale, you better take that back. 
<laughs> Dale. <laughs> I'd offer to join right now, but my laptop is fucked up. Oh, it's oh okay. that's okay. Uh, that's strange. Okay, oh, we love you too, brother. All right, so we have one opening, and I'm not just saying that love about you a all certain too. Uh, love you all too orifice. Well, that was kind of too easy. Now I don't know if I if I feel the same way anymore. <laughs> oh God, <laughs> been lurking here the whole time. Hell yeah. All right, so we have one immediate opening. If someone wants to hop in here, stupid quick, let's do if it. Not, I don't actually don't mind playing a three player game. I don't really give a shit. Oh, you know what? If we do, let's do some plane chase. I, I wouldn't uh, mind that either. I, I'd be down. Yeah? yeah. Yeah. All right. Ah, I I don't know. The strange. You want to hop in here? Out. You got the time. I know you're about to start, so I don't think we can finish before the hour's up. Uh, Mountain Mage. We usually we keep it to um, usually uh, people that we're associated with, uh, either content creators or things like that. Occasionally, we'll open it up to to viewers and people that have been with us for a good minute. Mostly on um, Tuesdays. But, yeah. Yeah, but usually not like yeah general people. Um, it depends. Like, if we see you around a lot, then there, there's definitely the opportunity to do that. Because, you know, we'll build a relationship and we can trust you not to be a piece of shit, which is really all that we On look stream. for. On screen, right. <laughs> we, don't uh, have, we don't have strict standards. Just, like, don't be a piece of shit, please. That's all we care about. <laughs> so prove that to us by sticking around and becoming friends. And, yeah. And, you know, maybe in the future let's, we can get that going. Let's get to know each yeah, other. Yeah, exactly. I, I'm not going <laughs> to... I'm not going to say that we don't do it. We don't discourage it. That's for sure. Because we do have a lot of fun with a lot of our viewers and stuff like that. But exactly. We don't want Rando screwing up. Because if someone comes in and just starts spewing a bunch of shit, it, it could potentially get our channel shut down. So we do want to build up a little rapport, get to know you, you know, have you take us out to dinner, maybe a movie. Might get a little something <laughs> out of it at the end, you know. But for the most part, we right. try and keep hey, it. Brandon, in the meantime, uh, can you put up a poll for me with just uh – Four selections, please. Absolutely. Luckily, we've been uh, we've we've had a pretty good community, and I'm I'm very proud of that. Uh, we've we've only had like maybe two or three pieces of shit I can recall, and you know they, they got booted real quick. Shout out to the mods for for that. Thank oh yeah, you so yeah. much. Thank you to our mods who are constantly watching and making sure that people don't fuck with our shit. That's I right. Really do appreciate it. Except for me, right? Except yeah. for you on, on uh, what part? Yes. Mm, on, on which part of that? Mm. All the parts. <laughs> I may pretend mod. <laughs> <laughs> Corrupt. You're loved. All right. Uh, so if I remember, I'm a piece of shit. What is it? Uh, what was that song? Because I'm a piece of shit. This is true. I, I don't know the piece of shit song. No. Oh, no. It's, a, it's, a, a, it's a Camaro song. Camaro song? No, Camaro. Camaro. My car's a oh, piece of shit. Oh, that's what you're talking about. Yeah, I gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Stark, we love you, man. Daily Dally says, I tasted Johnny sauce. Mm, it was powerful. <laughs> <laughs> g g give me your opinions on it. I actually need to know <laughs> what, you, what you think of the flavor and Ela like elaborate. All, 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 those, all those details, please. I really need to know. Because I want to make it better. <laughs> I, need, I need to make a good sauce. I need to make my sauce tasty. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so I'll just go over a couple, a couple of my decks. Uh, I have Perforos here. He's just, uh, you know, shock you till you die. <laughs> and uh, then we got uh, Riel, just a good old Is It uh, wheel deck. And then I have uh, Milstrom Wanderer, just Cascade good stuff. Uh, like some some elemental tribal in there. Um, and then uh, Jishath, my uh, Jurassic Park deck. She's watching Twitch and she's watching Netflix. <laughs> it's a party in the other room. Right? We're all missing out. <laughs> no, the Dale. Diarrhea. no, Dale, don't vote for the Dinaria. I almost Not thought you Harper said Doria, and I was thinking, what? When did Ganon get here? <laughs> 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 uh, I'm just playing Smash. It's been a minute. 
I know. Oh yeah, bring up. We whoever. have no. We have an open challenge with CRGR. Yeah, for I, a smash. I, I I saw something like that, and I really want to dunk on them. I would like to. There's also I think you need to I, come I, over to my place to do it because to have us like go from like all these different locations. Oh, I would to love do it. to. Yeah, yeah, that'd be the best thing to do. Also, I think I need to dunk on Jim from the Spike Feeders and Smash. I think that was something that G3 mentioned. Mm. And so I really need to dunk on this person. Oh, we not, should not, not to be cocky. You know what? <laughs> we should do a Commander Smashdown. I'm down. I'm down for the Smashdown. Let's get a little tournament bracket going. Fuck yeah. I am 100% down for this. Fucking do it. I almost thought of Daria. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. Well, I have the chance because I like doing this now. Chad West, what's up? Mountain, good to see you. Loco, still in it. I love it. Grinning, Roger, fuck off. Corrupt, how's it going? Stark, good to see you. Mad Strange. Guap, hello. How's, how's it going? <laughs> Dale. Well, I'm glad you're taking a night off, Dale. Yeah. We've got Matt. What is that? Mad Guap? Mad Guap, mad thank guap. you very much for joining us. Making G3, that Mad get Guap. Fucked. Uh, <laughs> Ac Acrovets. Oh, God, I'm probably fucking that up miserably. Ac Acrovets. Thank you very much for joining us. Junior Weiss, how's it going? Uh, Peak a minor. <laughs> God, I had to read that slow like a, a dummy. Peak a minor, thank you very much for joining us. And Palazor Fleshburn, thank you very much for being here. Can we play non CEDH Smash Brothers, like with items on the stage? I know to your lists. No. That's not how Smash is played, my man. <laughs> <laughs> it's a party game, why not? You pleb. No, no. So I play a lot of melee, uh, and there's like a strict like no items, no nothing, right? And uh, my friend loves to do all the wave shines and the stupid towering and all that other bullshit. And so I make fun of him because I said he, I keep telling him how hard he goes in a child's game. Yeah, people do get mad at that. It's great. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get I'm just gonna play Rio. It looks like it's the majority. Sweet. Hell yeah. You know, something I enjoy doing is um, with my little sister, because, I mean, she wasn't really, like, super, like, good at that. What we would do is we would make a custom stage where we had, like, two platforms, and we had a uh, Pokeball set on high, and we oh, just keep throwing Pokeballs on, on each other's platforms and seeing who dies first from all the Pokemon that are appearing. That is awesome. That was, I like that. Fun. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> uh, Chad West, uh, what kind of a software app is used to play like this? Um, currently, we have a custom RTMP server which ingests everyone's video feed um, from whatever respective source they have. And uh, in addition, we are using OBS to broadcast. So most of all of what you're seeing is through OBS. Man, Hurricane's going to brush where I live, but I'm betting I won't see winds over 30 miles per hour. Uh, you stay safe, Loco. Love you tons. Uh, hope everyone out there stays safe. It's what, fucking crazy. Uh, G3, I know you're in here. What was the link to that planes chase thing? Also, keep your kites inside, please. Keep your arms and legs and kites it's, inside. It's, it's time to put away the Benjamin Franklin cosplay. Uh, you don't need to do it tonight. I don't even have any keys, so. Did you know that Brandon's favorite song is um, actually something you can find on YouTube very easily? It's called Thomas Jefferson Type Beat by Conics. And Thomas Jefferson, Jefferson Type Beat. Type Beat. That, that's I've a, never that's, heard that, of this, but it's my that, favorite song, right? It, yeah, it's okay to lie, Brandon. Okay, yeah. Anyways, no, uh, that's clearly a song, I, so if you get a chance and you, you need something to fall asleep to, just put on a Thomas Jefferson Type <laughs> Beat. Something to wake up to, you know. <laughs> it'll, it'll set the tone for your day. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Oh my goodness! Oh, okay, my wife's family is in abroad. I, I don't know where any of those places well. are, but I hope they're all fine. <laughs> That's all I can say for that. I hope they're all okay. <laughs> oh, here we go. Okay, thank you, G three. Very, very swell of you. Let's see if I can get ah, this gotcha. to work the way that we originally wanted. Yes, yes, this all is working okay. All right. Cool. I'm going to set up a planes chase mode for us really quick. Give me 10 seconds. In the meantime, Johnny, it is your turn to talk about a certain gaming. 
<laughs> All right. So if you didn't know, we're affiliated with Flipside Gaming, and now you know. You can enter the code Lexicon at checkout for 10% off your order of $10 or more, excluding Warhammer products, but you can spend it on whatever the fuck else. Uh, you know, Pokemon cards, Yu-Gi-Oh cards, Magic, I don't give a shit what you're into, really. Just have a fun time and enter that code at checkout for a discount that you kick back to us so that we can put it back into the stream and put the stream into your eye holes. Ooh, Ooh the whole hole. That's right. We're just put it on in there. So if you want some distilled lexicon of the highest purity, enter lexicon at checkout on flipsidegaming.com. Yeah, that's right. We also have uh, Patreon and all this other shit that's in chat. So check those out too. We never mention those, which we probably should because they're kind of important, aren't they? Um, but yeah, support those. Like if you support us on Patreon uh, for a dollar, you get access to our Discord um, in its entirety. You can you can uh, enter the general channel for free, but you get access to all this other bullshit, um, which is mostly pretty entertaining. It's very cursed. You otherwise. get a pretty sweet uh, foil token too. You that's probably show them. That's right. You get a sweet foil lexicon token. We have an example right here. Let me just take it out of this fucking sleeve. Just, yeah, don't take it out of the sleeve. Well, I'm gonna don't be a dick. I'm oh, gonna do it. Look at that. Oh my god. Look at that nice foil token. See? You get to put it into a sleeve and draw whatever the fuck you want over it. I mean, you can really create any kind of token you want with a dry erase mm. marker. And it just comes out clear as day, beautiful. I hate you so much. <laughs> I'm sorry, I drew a portrait of Brandon and he really didn't like it. <laughs> Ruined my day. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, I'm doing the last touches. Yes! Yes, I can't believe I make all of this work. I'm gonna suck my own dick for a second here. You should. Hell yeah. Because you right. deserve it. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. All right. So we got our planes chase up. Hopefully y'all can read it. At the beginning of the game, we're going to flip over a new one at random. And this should work, theoretically. This should work the way that planes chase normally. Can we start yeah. on another plane? <laughs> I said, like I said, at the beginning of the game, we are going to flip it. So this is not oh, no, what the game's going to start with. That's actually really funny. I like this plane. He rolled a crit. You hear loud when he comes 20. <laughs> <laughs> Sanctum of Sarah is a lit place. <laughs> I like this. Yeah. All right. Uh, and then last but not least, I'm sorry to, to drag on as we do all of this, you know, shenanigans. Uh, we're going to make this really quick. We're going to do this in under, let's say you guys have two minutes to choose. All right. I got to pull up here for you guys in the decks that I have that I want to see that you want to see me play with. We've got Jalera Master Poly stuff as Zur, the Cursed Chanter, everyone's favorite. We've got Mizics of the Assholeness. Please choose in the next couple of minutes if you're hanging out, lurking around in the background, or just stopping by and looking for a good time. Please, really quick, tell me what you want to see me play with next. I'll keep this hand. But everyone can see the plane all right, right? Does that look good? Brandon, can you change my good. commander to uh, Riel, comma, the Everwise? It's the, a blue-red one. What's that? Riel is... You don't mind, if you don't mind changing my commander, because I'm still on the, the Abzan commanders. Yeah, no, I'm just saying what's that? It's on Akoria. Uh, Akor Akoria. Fuck. How do, you, how do you spell it? It's R-I-E-L-L-E. -L -L -E. I already spelled it wrong. Comma? There you go. I got it. Yeah, okay, gotcha. Thank you. No problem. I am also switching uh, to Aminatu. That's what we have. Yes. Thank God. Yas. I would really honestly pay someone to go and do this for us. Oh, yeah. I got to fucking learn that shit. Well, whoops. Johnny, you piece of shit. Is it... Okay, and you said you're doing what? Aminatu. Aminatu. Ooh, it looks like Zur and Mizix are tied. I'm in Canada, eh? They probably won't let me make it into the country right now, eh? 
Yay. <laughs> I don't think they actually say A every 10 seconds, but that in my oh, yeah. mind, that's how I... No, that's exactly right, yes. You, that is, I've been to Canada there's, before. There's, so there's yes. a guy, he's called the Detail Geek, so check him out on YouTube. I get odd pleasure watching him odd like pleasure? clear, like clean and clear out like cars and detail them. And uh, the way he says uh, garage makes me laugh every time. I just I die from it every time he says it. It's great. Related side note: Odd out. Pleasure is a very good Joy Division album. Oh, I I will now have to check that out. <laughs> I will if you want, Brandon A. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. All right, we gotta break this tie. The first person to break this tie for either Zer or Mizix, please post that up here in the chat with a number of either two or three, and we're gonna get this game started. On someone, there has to be. <laughs> I like that, Roger. <laughs> One person out of these 40 viewers, please. Yes. Yes. All right. That's it. It's closed. It's done. There it is. I'm not going to let an opportunity for this to go away. <laughs> yeah. Johnny, what's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to pull out Zer. I'm going to shuffle up. We're going to be getting going on the next game here, and this is going to be the last game for the night. So I'm going to open up betting. Make sure you put in your bets. I'm going to make you eat eggs. You're going to eat eggs, Brandon. A dozen, a baker's dozen, two baker's dozens of, of eggs. Of eggs? Yes. You're eating the whole coop. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to shuffle up. We're going to start by going around the table, introducing ourselves, talking about our decks. Please make sure to reset life total. Oh, you already did. Uh, we're going to talk about our decks. We're going to read some lore, and we're going to get started on the next game. Player three doesn't exist. Let's try that again. Player two, Phantom, you are going first. Excellent. So go ahead and introduce yourself. Shameless plugs if you can. And uh, sure, sure. some hey. lore. Read off some lore. Hey, guys. Uh, Phantom 5, uh, one of the old school viewers from the LexCon. And uh, also a uh, another member of a uh, another Twitch community called uh, Commander Connections. We stream on Tuesdays and Fridays. Wasn't it Oakville? Uh, yeah, we actually just changed the name uh, to Commander Connection. Just sounds better. We don't really want to dox ourselves too much. Huh. Right. Well, do us a so, favor. Uh, put a link to that here in the chat if you can. I'm playing Real Everwise. It's just a uh, red-blue uh, wheelhouse deck. Uh, get as many spells in the graveyard and maybe one-punch someone. Or, you know, troll the board. Do something like that. Nice. And uh, what do you got for a lore card for us? The uh, Mizium Sphere array drove her mind deep into thought field where only the rarest motes of genius may be plucked. Ooh, I have no idea what the fuck that is. I like it. All right, well, I'm down here in the bottom left-hand corner. My name is Brandon, a.k.a. The Producer, a host here at MTG Lexicon. Tonight, I'm going to be playing with Zura the Curse Chanter. Uh, if you're unfamiliar, it is a Curse Tribal deck, and the whole point is to not exactly stacks, but stacks. I don't know how to, like, explain everyone stacks. Stacks. But not single stacks. But I can single stack someone if I really dislike them. You're saying a lot of double negatives. That yeah, really I, mean nothing. I'm just going to say it's a <laughs> lot of fun. Everyone loves it, and everyone likes it when I play Zer. How about that? That's the good way to describe Zer. I mean, if we're all talking lies right now, then this <laughs> is also just a fun deck that Brandon will love. And it's definitely not going to go after him, this game. <laughs> I'm playing Aminatu, the, the fucking Fate Shifter over here in this corner of the room. It's a little blinky blinky top decky deck. Well, that's what I'm doing. Uh, looks like Phantom's going to go first. I'm keeping my hand. Yep. Keeping. I'm good to go. I'm keeping. keeping. All right. Let's get started. All oh, right. yeah. We got uh, to flip a fucking plane. We need a, a plane. Right? So <laughs> uh, everyone's keeping. We're going to start by flipping to a new plane. Cut, please. 
All right, everyone ready? Yep. yep. Uh, All right. The car you ready? Here we go. Where are we going? Huh. Whenever a player casts Tommy a spell, that player Gala. may draw a card. Okay. Whenever a player casts a spell, that player may draw a card. Whenever you planes chase. I'm sorry. Whenever you. Roll six. Each Roll six. May return a blue card from his or her graveyard to his or her hand. There you go. Sweet. Uh, so what we're gonna do, just to make it fair and easy to follow and whatnot, we're gonna type in exclamation mark roll space six in the chat. That's gonna and that chat bot to I'm sorry MTG bot to roll a random die for us. If it's a one, we planes chase. If it's a six, we chaos. That's what it's called, chaos. I couldn't remember it was. Oh, is it possible it. To, to roll my uh, planner choice, uh, dice on on stream? Is that okay? Yeah. I think uh, fine. Yeah, yeah, that should be fine. I just figured it would Thank probably you. be easier to do it through the chat since it's logged. All right, so I'm going to play an island for turn, and I like this plane, so I'm going to pass. Hmm. All right. We are, hmm, we're going to throw down a Reliquary Tower, tap it, and we're going to play a Soul Ring, playing a spell, so I get to draw a card. And pass. Okay. Draw a card for turn. Going to play an Island. Going to cast a Soul Ring as well. Draw a card. And pass the turn. Pretty draw. <laughs> yeah, tripping soul rings. Very fair. <laughs> my special Play a mountain a and you throw two I'll pa pass, pass the turn to Brandon. Hmm. I did not want that. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. Do -do 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 -do. All right. Um, Looks like you're lacking some colors there, Brandon. We we are lacking some colors here, and you know what? Yes. It makes me sad. Yes. <laughs> Get your mana screws out, boys. <laughs> Throw those mana screws up in chat. We're going to play an Arcane Sanctum into Battlefield Tapped. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Pass. Stark, thank you for the 69 bits. Hey, thank you. Stark, I will break you. Huh. I guess we're all still very chill. Was that a soul ring in play hand? Dismal play Blackwater hand? will come Feels into like play. It. Tapped, gain me a life, and I'll pass turn. God, Phantom, please play a fucking artifact. I know, I'm playing an island, and I'm playing my, my grandma, Riel. And uh, I'm gonna pass the turn. You want to go ahead and read a, uh, read Riel off for us? Sure. Uh, Riel the Everwise gets plus one zero uh, for each instant <laughs> and sorcery you. card it in your graveyard. <laughs> and whenever you discard one or more cards for the first time each turn, draw that many cards. Sweet. And uh, thank you, G three. <laughs> thank you, G three. Hmm. We're going to throw down a Polluted Delta. I'm going to tap it, lose one, crack it, get a dual land. Uh, I'm going to tap one blue, dual land, one other. I'm going to play Memory Erosion. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, I played real. Can I draw a card? Yes. Go ahead. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Fuck, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Roger. <laughs> I'll fucking oh, cheers to that. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to play Memory Erosion. I'm going to draw a card, but Memory Erosion says, whenever an opponent plays a spell, that player puts the top two cards of his or her library into their graveyard. And I will pass. Oh, wait. I can't I can't draw this one yet. I got to search and then draw. Yes. Um, all right. Let's untap. Draw a card. Getting that dual land. Let us play Pong and Island. Um, I'm going to tap three for 
uh, Commander Sphere. I'm gonna mill two cards. Milling Mortuary Mire and a Conundrum Sphinx. I think you draw off. Oh, yeah, I would have. First. Well, okay, so. Oh, yeah, it's app now. I would have <laughs> drawn first. It's active, non active, so. Yeah. Really, really? Yeah, you're gonna draw first. Sir. Yeah, draw first. All right, so I'm milling a Brago. Sad. Um, okay. For three, I'm gonna cast Reflector Mage. Let's draw a card and then <laughs> mill two. G3, really, really, fuck is there. Milling Solemn and Talisman of Hierarchy. I'm gonna bounce Riel to your hand. Yep. Hey, Black and White, how's it going? And then I'll pass her. A Caesar, what's up? Cut, please. Johnny, I actually really like the sauce. Spicy, but it does not linger. It does not punish you for drinking water. Oh, I'm glad you like it. Speaking of sauce, we have your favorite piss sauce here as well tonight. Yeah, the piss sauce is tasty. <laughs> you know what's funny is I learned how to make killer piss sauce from Alberto. Alberto? He, he yeah. is the king of piss sauce. He is. I miss Birdo. It's been a minute. Do you make hot sauce, Johnny? Um, I just tried. I did uh, try to make my own hot sauce recently, so I did that my first batch, looking to improve it. I'm going to three and play a trinket mage, and... Uh, I'm gonna draw a card uh, first I'm and then mill. Yeah. Oh, it's supposed to be tapped, sorry. Mountain Mage, me too. Me too. A little bit too much. Is that it for your turn? Uh, sorry, I'm going to get a Soul Ring, and I'm going to tap the Mountain to play the Soul Ring, and then I'm going to tap two for a Rune Chanter's Pike. Damn. All right, well, and <laughs> it seems like everyone here is having too much fun. Uh, uh, oh, wait, don't mill? Oh, yeah, so, so draw first and then mill two. Right. The day Johnny doesn't bring spice is the day I attend Jeff and Steve's wedding. I we'll played a uh, root change for spice, so I'm going another two. Okay. Damn, some good ones. All right, yeah. all right, and uh, I'm done. Everyone has having way too much fun here, and I don't like it. I hate it. I'm going to play a swamp. And then I'm going to... Do the dirtiest thing I can. Done dirt cheap. Dirty deeds. And they're done with sheep. Dirty <laughs> deeds. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, I'm going to do like this, like that, like this. Yes. Yes. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, sorry. Uh, I'm going to play Energy Flux. It says, during each player's upkeep, destroy all artifacts that that player controls. That player may pay an additional two colorless... For each artifact to prevent that from being destroyed. I'm then going to tap three and I'm going to play Estrid's Invocation. You may have Estrid's Invocation enter the battlefield as a copy of any enchantment you control, except it gains at the beginning of the upkeep. You may exile this enchantment. If you do, return it to the battlefield under its owner's control. Mind you, it does not say target, so even if it had shroud or hexproof, I can still target my own stuff. And this is going to go on memory erosion. I will pass turn. At the beginning of your upkeep, you have to pay two to keep right, right, your right. artifacts. Shut up. Um. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> <laughs> Let's sack Commander Sphere, draw a card. Did you want to tap it first and then sack it? No, I don't, actually. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to use Sol Ring to pay for itself. Okay. I was going to say, because you could tap to make a mana with the Commander Sphere, tap an island or a, whatever it is, and then keep Soul Ring untapped. Wait, what? It's, it's so, two for, for every artifact, right, right, right? So what I'm saying is you're, you're one there, one land. To pay for the Soul Ring to leave the Soul Ring untapped, you'd have four mana instead of three. Uh, but I have to. I don't have to pay. No, it's it's fine. I'll leave it alone. Actually, oh. okay. Even with that, it's not really what I want to do. Um, 
Let's... Oh, I gotta draw two cards. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, this sucks. Let's shock in a godless shrine. I'm going to cast my commander. I am gonna mana screw myself. I I don't even. Oh, I have one basic so far, so not great. <laughs> cast my commander. Draw a card. Mill four. Milling Glenelendra, uh, mesmerizing Benthid, swamp. And a Merciless Eviction. Brutal. Going to plus one Aminatu to draw a card, then put a card from my hand on top of my library. Seems good. Eh, it doesn't really matter. I uh, guess I'll put this on top. Move to combat. Swing over at Brandon <laughs> for two. One, two. And then I'll go to discard. Discard an island. Pass turn. All right, you know what to do, Phantom. The beginning of your upkeep. Destroy I, uh, or pay two. Yeah, all right, Rune Enchanters will die. Uh, Soul Ring will just tap and pay for itself. And what about uh, your other? Yeah, Rune Chant. Yeah, yeah, the Pike. I I sacrificed it. Okay. That is pretty cool, isn't it, Dale? It's uh, it's Soul Ringception. It'd be cool if there was a picture of a Soul Ring on the picture of the Soul Ring. That would be sweet. Shit, I should do that. I should make I'll, an I'll altar just... that's just like it, like infinitely there, and that have the play mat. Cast, cast Riel. Uh, you don't have like Ghostly Prison or anything, right, Brandon? <sighs> Come on, what am I? Some kind of asshole? Okay. I'm gonna attack you for two. And uh, I'm gonna roll the planar die. Or actually, sorry, I'm going to draw from Riel. And Mill 4. Uh, and Mill 4. Mill, mill 4? Yeah, yep. he has two copies of uh, Memory of Roja on the battlefield. Sawi. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, I'll just play a Mountain then, and then... I'll tap two and play uh, Cathartic Reunion. Uh, I have to discard two cards. Yeah, so you're going to discard two, draw from Cathartic... Discard two... Sorry, you're going to do your Cathartic first. So you're, then your draw happens, then yeah. your mill. So I'm, yeah, discarding from Cathartic... Uh, trigger Riel. I'm going to be drawing two from Cathartic. Right. And then uh, and then I'm going to draw from the plane, Minanimo. Yes. Okay. And then uh, I, it says I draw three cards, but uh, do I do I draw three or do I mill uh, before? No, no. So you're gonna you're gonna process Cathartic first. Yeah. Okay. So draw three. And then you're going to draw one from the Maimyo plane. Sorry, the, the Kamigawa Maimyo. And I, then I, 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 you're going to mill the four. No, mill the four. I have a Kozilek trigger. It's going to shuffle my graveyard into my library. Okay, well, I'm going to have to exile that somehow. Ah, that's going to be a pain. Eat pants. Eat them, Brandon. Pants. Eat them, Brandon. Pants. Eat them, Brandon. Pants. How many Eldrazi do you have in that deck? One. Just him. Dale, you want to see them guns? Don't need firepower when I'm rocking these guns. <laughs> I've got the pea shooters on me. Damn. I'm going to... I'm gonna roll the planar die because I they get a free roll, right? Yep. Yes, you do. You get one free. I mana, rolled one mana for each the after. So we're gonna switch planes. Lame. I was having fun, you know. All right, here we go. Reality shaping—it's a phenomenon. When you encounter reality shaping, starting with you, 
each player may put a permanent card from his or her hand onto the battlefield. Holy shit. Fuck yeah. All right, so Phantom, starting with you, you may put a permanent card from your hand onto the battlefield. <laughs> Did he just die? Did we lose? No, I'm I'm, I'm going to put a Thassa. I'll put Thassa on into play. That's Ooh. a good one. Nice. Which Thassa? Okay, gotcha. All right. Well, Phantom, you upset me by going to a different plane, and you just generally upset me by having Eldrazi. So I'm going to put what? an Overwhelming Splendor on you. Oh, okay. shit. Overwhelming Splendor says Enchant Player. Creatures Enchanted Player Controls loses all abilities and have a pace, power, and toughness of 1-1. One, one. Enchanted Player cannot activate abilities that aren't mana abilities or loyalty abilities yeah, so i have, i am humiliated gotcha um i'm putting soren grim nemesis onto the battlefield hell yeah thanks all right now we're going to another plane since as soon as that one's oh my dog What kind of world is this? Time distortion. When you encounter time distortion, reverse the game's turn order. Hey, it's going to be my turn. <laughs> hey, hey, you're welcome, Johnny. Thank you. Fuck. <laughs> I, 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 won't for, I won't forget this, Phantom. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And now we're back to an actual plane, a Gyrium. Whenever a white creature dies, return to the battlefield under its owner's control at the beginning of the next end step. Whenever a non-white creature dies, return to its owner's hand at the end of the next end step. Uh, whenever you roll chaos, creatures can attack you until a player planes walks. Shit. That's crazy. All right. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> All right. I'm going to untap. Get wrecked, Brandon. I will be paying for my soul ring. What it did. With itself. Draw on a card. Um, let's... Fetid Heath. And... Plus Aminatu. Uh, should we plus Aminatu? Uh, let me see. Yeah, let's do that. Draw a card. Put a card from my hand on top. DV, sure. what's up? Hey, thanks for the host. Uh, okay, I'm going to have an amazing night. Hell yeah. Plus one Soren, A real top card of your library and put that card into your hand. Each opponent loses life equal to its CMC. Oh, nice. Revealing top, it's going to be Oath of Liliana. Everyone loses three. Yes. Hmm. Um, they don't really have to worry too much about a lot of stuff. No, I, you're pretty. You're pretty good at the moment. Move to combat. Uh, swing over at Brandon too. All my creatures just lose all the abilities, right? And they are one one. Yeah, so correct. Okay. All right. Uh, pass and turn. All right. Untap. Oh, it is turn. Yeah. Okay, you didn't, you didn't play a card. No. Been chilling. Uh, Soul Ring will pay for itself from Energy Flux. Hmm. Uh, we're going to play Prairie Stream. I only have one non-basic, so it's going to enter the battlefield tapped. Hmm. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll play Zur. Pass? Oh, by the way, did you draw and mill for... F oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. No, 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 don't, don't listen to me. Michael. Oh. Is it, is it my turn then? Um, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna roll the planer die. Uh, I want to get out of here. This place sucks. This place is sick. Fuck. I got nothing. Ah, uh, eat eggs. All right, just go. Got me all sad and shit. Huh. 
Uh, use Soaring to pay for itself. I'm gonna scry. I'll put it on the bottom. Draw. Uh, okay, I'm gonna... Six, hmm. I'm gonna roll the planar die. Sounds good. So we are plane hopping. That dice is loaded. There's no way. All right, here we go. The next plane. The next plane is Grove of the Dream Pods. You want to read it? So when you planeswalk to Grove of the Dream Pods or at the beginning of your upkeep, reveal cards from the top of your library until you reveal a creature card. Put that card onto the battlefield. Holy shit. And the rest on the bottom of your library <laughs> in a random order. <laughs> Yes! When you roll Chaos, return to your creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Okay. It's funny because all of the decks that we're playing with have all almost right. no I, creature cards. I have a 1-1 uh, one, one Eldrazi. <laughs> Hell yeah. 1-1 one, oh one Kazi. Hey. Uh, and the, what, what happens to the other ones? They go to the bottom in a random order? Okay. Yeah, yeah. in the bottom in a random order. <laughs> the 1-1 one, one Kazi like. <laughs> <laughs> Little baby. <laughs> oh boy, that's fucking funny. I miss you too. Brandon shoved me into a mirror and now I can't get out until I solve a series of riddles. Yeah. <laughs> it's baby. I'll pay. Don't fucking do it. I uh, want to stay okay. on this place. Um, I didn't, yeah, yeah, I'll pay one and we're going to roll again. Uh, with your loaded ass die. Sick. I got a Yorian. That's a 1-1. One, one. That die is so loaded. It is not loaded, dude. <laughs> Show me a time right. where it doesn't hit either of those. Right. I'm taking two to roll it again. Hey, we're planeswalking. That is a loaded-ass die. I want that shit out of here. Starting from this it point forward, you're going to type an exclamation part, roll, space, six. Loaded. That it's is some loaded-ass loaded shit. It's not loaded, <laughs> I bought this from the anthology. You want to see the box? Yeah, the anthology's fucking loaded. <laughs> oh my god. That is. I'm just getting luck. That is not what luck. Can I say? Oh, oh yeah. All right. Yes. I'm okay with this. Get fucking yeah. wrecked. You know what? Roll again, okay, bitch. Go. Roll again. Roll again. <laughs> oh god. This Roll perfect. again. This is perfect, actually. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna chill, and uh, I'll pass the turn. To sure. <laughs> oh god, Sawing pays for itself. I'm so salty. His dice is fucking straight up loaded. It's not. I'm just a god roller. Uh -huh. I should be good. I should be casino right now. I am straight up not believing that shit for a fucking minute. Um, Reflector Mage is gonna. Oh, so I'm going to flick a Reflector Mage with Aminatu, bouncing nice. Azur. Uh, yeah. That's fine. Um, let's plus Soren. Is that eight? It just puts it to my hand, right? Yeah, and then uh, you can't play it until after my next turn. Okay, that's fine. Really in the top card, Halamar Depths. I draw it. No one takes damage. Sad. Oh. What's that uh, Soren pop at? At nine. Oh, okay. Well, shit. Like, drawing a lot of lands, so I guess we're gonna play a fucking land. Noise. And pass the turn. Gonna have to discard down, discarding a land. Um, let's see. Oh. Wait. You didn't cast a spell, Phantom, did you? No, I didn't. I used the plane to get back oh, here again. Yeah. Right, right, right. Okay, cool. Untap. Uh, Soul Ring's going to play pay for itself. Uh, 
We're going to have Estrid's Invocation copy Overwhelming Splendor, and we're going to put it on Johnny. Because I don't want to deal with that fucking flicker bullshit. Uh, we're going to draw a card. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. We're gonna play Bitter Heart Witch, Death Touch. When Bitter Heart Witch dies, you may search your library for a curse card, put that onto the battlefield, attached to target player. Then shuffle your library. Uh, I guess I'm gonna pass. On okay. Planeswalk? Uh, yeah, actually, sure. Uh, I'll do my free roll. Let me find a loaded die real quick. Yeah. Finally, <laughs> it's not loaded. I just Whatever. <laughs> Show me it landing on anything other than either of those. Three, nothing. Okay. Eat eggs. I mean, I I really want this to pop too. So. You said you're passing after yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're good. You're good. Uh, yeah, same thing. Soul Ring will pay for itself. I'll scry. I'll bottom it. Draw for turn. Play a mountain and... Uh... Yeah, I'll do my free roll. Do it. Nothing. Uh, pass turn. Okay. You fit uh, it, turn, you piece I'll, of shit. <laughs> and a turn, I'm going to cycle a fetid pool to draw a card. Then I'm going to untap and draw a card, paying the tax with Soul Ring. Would have been funny if you did hit the chaos, though. Well, that's a plus Amanatu. It's a A. Oh, damn. Too bad. I'm gonna plus Soren, revealing Lavinia the tenth. Uh, Y'all will take five. Ouch. Oh, I'm out of piss sauce. Hmm. I'm going to. <sighs> That's fucking annoying. Gonna play Birth of Miletus. I'm gonna mill four. Milling Kiara Best of Sea God while the You are not milling four, you're milling two. Stop. Oh, fuck. Milling two. Oh, Esther's Invocation is that bullshit. Yep. Uh, Kiara Best of Sea God and Wall of Denial will be milled. That fucking sucks. Um, Saga, search your library for a basic planes card, fill it, and put it into your hand. Then shuffle your library. Noise. What's in the sky and on the ground? What's in the sky and on the ground? My ass? Yeah, you can planes? feel it all around. Air. There you go. Thanks. I'm uh, gonna play that plane. You for can't turn. feel light. You can feel radiation can't feel light okay uh shit i guess i'm just gonna pass a turn and discard down you want to pop that sarah's discarding your planes no damn <laughs> damn it all right untap upkeep i'm gonna have uh soul ring pay for itself uh we're gonna leave estrids where it's at and i'll go We're going to put down a planes as I land for turn. Uh, let's play Zer. Yeah. Okay. 
Making sure I tap right. Always fucking that part up somehow. Okay, and then we're going to swing over at uh, Soren for one death touch. That's Soren. a one, two. Soren will take one. Going to eight. Oh. Should have blocked. All right. Um, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You're my special friend. Fast turn. Hey, thank you, Zzz24, for the follow. Much appreciated. Phantom, it is your turn. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, I'll untap, pay for soaring itself, scry. I'll leave it there. I'll draw. Play an Aventor's Fair. Um, Who watches the watching? And... Voyeurs, duh. Uh, roll the player die. That I will not dude. have my life total be got 20. <laughs> All right. Dun, dun, dun. That loaded piece of shit. I think you're banned from making these rolls. <laughs> just what are you talking about? Just, I missed. Whatever. I'm, this I next one, if, it, if, it's, if it's a plane or chaos, uh, dude, fucking throw that dice away. If it's a plane chase or chaos, throw that dice away. I want to see you with a cup of water, and you put that shit in the cup of water. I want to oh, see D6 it. That, like, does it matter? All right, I'm paying two. I'm doing it again. All right. I don't know. Seems rigged. What is that? It's nothing. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, okay. so now he has to pay uh, three gotcha. if he wants to roll yeah, again. I'm, I'm just gonna pass turn. Oh. Sure. Uh, I'm gonna create a zero four wall, which is a one one. <laughs> it's terrible. It's an move. upgrade. <laughs> <laughs> it's so totally an upgrade. Draw a card. Um, who key? So Halamar Depths gonna come in. It's a land. Um, when it ETBs, look at the top three cards of your library. Put them. Put them back in any order. Oh, nice. That is a good land. Did you get more lands? Hot. Hot. Uh, fine. Plus, I'm not to. Do the same old bullshit. Reveal Lavinia. Hmm. Ouch. Five. Uh, shit. Uh, probably not gonna cast anything because things could get wiped. So I'm just gonna discard down. I'm um, discarding an island. Come on, roll, Johnny. Do oh, it. I'm good. <laughs> you, you guys can keep doing that. <laughs> so this is how we play a regular game of Commander, huh? <laughs> to keep Sarah Sanctum out. Yeah. Uh, so we've got Soul Ring tapped. Pays for itself. We'll keep Estrids on Overwhelming Splendor. And you guys really haven't cast any spells. I'm very upset. I'm going to play a Plains as my land for turn. All right, um, what the fuck are we gonna do here? Hmm. Born's ultimate. We're going to swing one in the air at Phantom with Xur. Attack trigger. Uh, Storm's ultimate is uh, put a number of 1-1 one, one black vampire knights uh, with lifelink onto the battlefield equal to the highest life total among all players. Okay. I should be at uh, 26. Oh, did you gain life from something? Did I? 
Uh, I, maybe I miscounted on the the Soren trigger. You're, you're losing from Soren's top his his number one trigger. Uh, that's yeah, why yeah. I'm at twenty as well. I'm, okay, I'm at fifteen. Yeah, it's because you you went to twenty from the from the roll and then you lost five from Soren. Knowing that everything is going to get blown away, I'm not really sure what to grab here. Nick, I think we're uh, good. We're actually finishing up with this last game for the night. Thank you. I got uh, four, five, six, seven, eight in total. I'm going to put a land tax out. Yeah. Sure. Because I'm not going to be upset if that gets destroyed. Yeah, the artwork that goes into yeah. is Okay. All right. Yeah. Me. All right. There you go. Thank you very much. All right. And then I'm going to cast for one, two white. One other. We're going to play Shielded by Faith. Enchant creature. Enchanted creature has indestructible. Whenever a creature enters a battlefield, you may attach it to that creature. Okay. And... Pass. Come on, roll the player dice. Your loaded die. Oh, me. Me. Okay, yeah. I'll do it. It's a two. Nothing. Okay. Sweet. Wait, well, wait, you, wait, wait. You know what? You have mana. You have mana. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'll tap one. I'll do it again. Yeah. MDG bot, come on. Don't fail me. Oh, two. Uh, <laughs> Get wrecked with actual random shit. Loaded. Yeah. Loaded Twitch stream. The Pass. Okay, okay. On tap. Uh, soaring will pay for itself. I'll scry. Um. You know, you could activate Thassa, and eventually we will kill Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> this is a I can't. I can't. It's, it would be. It doesn't do anything. I don't think. Oh, that's an overwhelming word. It doesn't block. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I thought that was an unblockable <laughs> one. Oh. Dude, you gotta Sad. you gotta smack that uh Soren, dude. Uh how many blockers do you have, Johnny? I got two. We're just gonna lose five life next turn. Yeah. What? what how many alt? Or what's the minus like for its ultimate? Is it ten nine. or minus nine? It's minus it's nine. nine. Yes. Oh, okay. Is your devotion high enough? Oh, is your devotion five? No. No. Four. One, two, three. Oh, yeah, yeah, four. Well, you don't want to play another blue card, that's for sure. All 
All right, I'm tapping seven, and I'm gonna attempt to cast a cyclonic rift. Hell yeah! Shit. Well, well, well. Um. Well, I can't do anything about that. Nice. Oh, I don't know what I'm so it resolves? Yeah, I think so. Uh, don't forget to mill two. Okay, uh, I guess I'll... Yeah, I'll do this now. I'll cast the Telerian Winds. And discard, uh, five. Uh, because I'm casting it. How does the... Oh, wait, there's no more memory erosion. Okay, so right. I can just, uh, discard five and draw ten. Yes. God, how do you spell Tolarian? T O L A R I A N. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, I will move to combat, I think. Johnny, I'll attack you for uh, six with Riel. Okay. And uh, six and we'll just do we'll do a total of eight. So six being commander, two's the other damage, and then uh, Brandon, I'll attack you for fourteen with uh, Annihilator trigger. Okay. Uh, just one Annihilator. Uh, no, it's like Annihilator, what, three? Annihilator four. Oh, Annihilator four. Oh, yeah. well, I fold then. Good game. I'll uh, play a Mana Crypt, tap it, and I'll play a uh, Talisman of Creativity, and uh, pass turn. Sure. <laughs> nice. Let's uh, draw a card. City of Brass, uh, Reflector Mage, the um, Kozilek. Wait, so you drew 14 cards? Uh, 10. Well, yeah, he drew, drew 10. Yeah, 10 cards. 10. Oh, so you had yeah. 5. Okay, cool. I was like, wait, you're supposed to draw extra cards. I didn't hear how many you drew. Man, so one six chance of losing yep. eleven life, one six chance of being at a really good advantage. Well, well, shit. Uh, it's a May ability, so you don't have to lose the life. Oh yeah. Oh, I thought that was fucking. You, you have to. Uh, I'm gonna roll the die. Uh, let's roll it again. So that's a, you, uh, I'm, 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 just, I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> we're, 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 gonna, we're gonna fucking do it. You just gonna keep so rolling? Up 20. We're going out 20. Uh, <laughs> just keep rolling, dude. Just keep rolling. Just keep doing it. Dude, do it. Do it. I have option. Soul Ring. Yep. Azoria Signet. Um, Lavinia the 10th. So. Yep. Yeah. She has pro red. Lose a life from this. And uh, when she ETBs, detain each non land permanent your opponent's control with CMC 4 or less. Uh, until my next turn, those permanents can't attack or block, and their activated abilities can't be activated. Um, I'm going to go to end of turn and discard down. Oh, you're all tapped out. Damn. Go ahead. Let's 
gonna be, I was gonna say you should pop the Sarahs. <laughs> Roll for uh, odds is damage. So you're, I'm not, safe. Sure. you're not rolling that stupid planes chase dice, are you? I rolled a six. <laughs> you're good, my friend. If we ever do this again with him in the future, he is not using that stupid ass dice. <laughs> okay, okay, Brandon. You're rolling so wait, goddamn bot. Uh, can you read Lavinia to 10th again for me, please? Sure. Uh, protection from red, and when Lavinia and ETBs detain each online permanent CMC for or less, that you're my opponent's control. Uh, those permanents can't attack or block, and their activated abilities can be activated. That includes the Mana Rocks. Oh, Grinnan, that was, that was uh, for Mana Crypt Roll. Yeah, that was for Mana Crypt Roll. Uh, draw this card. Cast the Thought Vessel for two. Okay. Damn, so I can't even attack Detain. Detain's annoying. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to just uh, pass the turn. Sure. Well, CNC, his is loaded, so there's nothing to worry about there. But for the rest of us, yes, it's very hard to hit. <laughs> Not loaded. <laughs> All right. I want to see that shit go in a, a glass of water. Ooh. Okay, you want me to get a glass of water? Not right now. We'll do it in a little bit. That thing's definitely loaded. Um, we will play a Mortuary Mire. When you ETBs, you may put target creature card from your graveyard on top of your library. Um, I'm going to put uh, Mesmerizing Benthid on top of my library. What is that? So, oh, I know what that is. Okay. I'm going to move to combat and swing over at Phantom with both the Reflector Mage and Lavinia. Uh, um, Reflector Mage. So, like, I can block, right? You can't block with uh, the detained creatures. And it's until, until your next turn, right? Yes. And it, it is it's your until turn. this turn, yeah. Well, actually, yeah, wait. So you're no. Turn. So I. ETVs? Oh, the tiny you'd, you'd have to blink it again in order for me to be able to unblock it. For being able to not block oh, it. Yeah. All right, let me do this differently then. Um, okay. I'm going to actually cast Amanatu, then flicker, and then I'll attack. All right. Uh, in response to you casting Amanatu, I'm uh -huh. going to cast Rea Reality Shift, targeting Lavinia. Targeting. Uh, which I'm guessing, like. You, like it, Anamatu comes in, but your target, I'm targeting Reality Shift, so yes. living it, right? Yeah, so Reality Shift will go off first. Damn, sad. Okay. Manifest the top. Manifest in the top card. It is a 2-2. Oh, well, that fucking sucks. Hmm. In that case... Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six mana, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, I guess instead we're gonna flicker the reflector mage to bounce Riel to your hand. Afterwards, we're going to cast Soren Grim Nemesis. Going to lose a life from my land. Okay. Let's plus Soren. Really, top card to be Flooded Strand. Goes into my hand. Okay. 
Let's play a Sigiled Starfish. I can tap Describe 1. It's a 0 3. And I'll pass the turn. Okay. Uh, at your end step, I'm going to tap my Soul Ring and Mana Crypt. And I'm going to sacrifice uh, Inventor's Fair to look for an artifact card. I'll reveal it and put it in my hand. Okay. It'll be a psychosis crawler. Now I see why you had to kill me first. That deck's got so many artifacts in it. It does, it does. Alright, I'll uh, roll odds as damage. Five, I take three, I go to 12. All right. Rye, uh, yeah, I'll keep that on top, draw it. Cast the Nib Mizzet, uh, Perum. Solid. Nice. Uh, so he's at seven. I'm gonna pay another life, I'll go to eleven. I'm gonna make, uh, Trinket Mage unblockable. And attack Anima two for two. Alright, I'm not dies. The closest caller for five. So and that's the second spell, so I'm gonna draw a card. Uh, and then I'm going to deal one damage to, I guess, you? Sure. Yeah, I'll deal one damage. I'm going to cast the Cathartic Reunion. Okay. Uh, so I discard two. All right. I'm going to lose uh, quite a bit of life. Well, you get to choose your targets for a Niv-Miz, yeah, but so, I'm going to lose two uh, life from the... Yeah, so Nimbus is going to shoot you for three, and then so it's going to be six damage. All right, gotcha. Ouch. 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 That's all I can do for now, and pass. Okay. Let's draw a card. Um. Huh. Interesting. Okay, so I'm going to tap the Sigil Starfish to scry one. Let's put this on the bottom, I think. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, for five, I'm going to cast my commander again. All right, she comes in with three loyalty counters. Let's plus one. Draw a card. Uh, huh, that's not bad. Uh, put a card from my hand on top. Um, let's plus Soren to eight. I'm going to reveal Yorion, the Sky Nomad. Uh, when he ETBs, exile the number of non-land permanents, uh, non permanents I control and return those cards to the battlefield at the beginning of the next end step. Uh, so I'm going to... Do I lose five life? Yes. So five to you. Oh, it's Six. becoming a close game. 
let's cast for five Yorion. We're gonna flicker. Um, we're gonna flicker all my creatures and my planeswalkers and my artifacts. He's got resolves. All right. Uh, Mesmerizing Benthic is going to come in. I'm going to create two zero two illusion creature tokens with whenever this creature blocks or creature, uh, that creature doesn't untap during its controller's next untap step. Uh, Mesmerizing Benthic has hexproof as long as I control an illusion. So I get two zero twos. Um, all right. Actually, this. I think this might be game. Maybe. Uh, let me see. I can flicker this, flicker these. Oh, this accidentally goes infinite, but we're not going to do that. Okay, so I'm going to... Um, I think you can just kill me, right? Because you get another activation of Sorn, right? Yeah, I get activation of Sorn's Nominatis. So what you do is you just put like a, a 7... CMC on top and just plus Sorn, right? And I die? Yeah. I think that's pretty much what's going to happen. Because what I can do is, actually, this, this does accidentally go infinite, because I can keep uh, Yorion to uh, keep activating Amanatu and Sorn back and forth. Um, but we're not going to do that. Um, those those return at your end step? Uh, no. Actually, yeah, it's the, yeah. the end step. Oh, my bad. So it'll be end step. I can't do this. Oh, that is fair. Okay. I thought it was going to be like the fucking cat. Okay. Cheater. So these are gone. They don't exist. <laughs> Thank God. I was fucking scared. I was like, oh, wait, I can't do that. That's kind of fucked up. Um, in that case, what Thank we're going to do is... Thank you, Claude, what's up? Okay. Okay, we're still fine. Um, in that case, I think I might still die, though. Do some bullshit. Um, I mean... And bolt me and see if I die to my crypt. Uh, no, I'm gonna have to pass the turn. Go ahead, and then my thing okay. back in. <laughs> Untap. I will. Oh yeah, bounce roll at the end of for... turn. That's right. So I guess I'm gonna bounce the. Oh right, yeah, yeah. Psychosis crawler Niv Mizzet. I guess let's balance Niv. Okay. Yeah. All right. Odds is damage. Uh, evens, I'm safe. Ow, I'm at three. Okay. Oh, this is a close game. Draw. Did you already plus one your Soren? I can't. It's in the turn that it comes in. Turns out it, it actually is fair. <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> My delicious points are on the line. <laughs> I, I thought it was going to be like the fucking... Uh, the, the Felidar cat, where he's flicking each other back and forth forever. Mm. Top three for uh, Riel. Is it good? Yes. How many cards are in your hand? I have six cards in hand? Yes. So I'm going to tap uh, for seven, right? No, uh, eight for eight, for eight mana. Yeah, so, so uh, two, three, four, five, six seven so seven uh all 
Uh, we had to take care of something real quick. Give us a second. Sure, sure. We're still alive, so. Yeah, I'm outside. She's in the hallway. Just yeah. I don't want to. Okay. So, uh, for 8 mana, uh, I'm going to cast Read the Bones, uh, the uh, X is 7. Ooh. Sure. The draw spell, right? Yeah. But he... Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. Don't you lose life from that? Well, I mean, I'm going to be discarding 7, drawing 14, and oh, then... Yeah, I'm dead. And it, like, this will kill you. There we go. Damn. Sweet. I was one mana off from, uh, I had a route, but I couldn't cast it. Oh, no. You're I, so close. You can discard cards to sack permanence. Yeah, I'm fucking super dead. Yeah. All right. All right. Good game, guys. Good game. Good game. Jeez. Nice work. I definitely should have rolled that planter die to see if I can go to 20. <laughs> I mean, again, we're all it. just going to stick to the same thing to roll these planter die. I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm not going to make it's phantom boil water and put, like, teaspoons of salt this in it to loaded. prove it. It is 100% loaded. Everyone, rewatch that loaded die, please. Go back. Maybe my, maybe my spins were weak, let's be real. He's just like, he's just like, oh, I'm just gonna accidentally throw this down. It's like a six oh, that, that or like a one that every time. No way, no way. It just doesn't... <laughs> dice don't do that shit. Alright, um, I'm ready to call it a night. I'm tired. Oh, hell yeah. I'm I'm exhausted. All right, thanks, Phantom. We really appreciate you Yo. showing up and, and playing with us. Great games. Fun. I know I gave you shit for the die, but I, I really had a great time with you. And as always, uh, we hope to see you again. I mean, it was a pleasure. Uh, if you don't mind paying out the bets, because there were some people that did bet right. on that. Uh, uh -huh. Bet on that loaded die, you say? Oh, I love you guys. Oh, what do you mean people that bet on you? You mean yourself? Oh, my <laughs> God. Wow. Fuck this guy. <laughs> All right. Well, congratulations to our winners. Thank you very much for joining us here at the Dive Bar of MTG. And as always, we are here if you're filthy. Drunken. Casual. Commander. Content. Oh, hey, you didn't say you fuck. Uh, sorry, I was you're typing. banned. Oh you're banned no! From the stream. No! It's done. I'm out. It's over. No! <laughs> All right. Well, I'm gonna throw up our donation screen here. Thank you very much for everyone who's helped make this stream real and kept us going. All the people that you see before you are patrons and supporters of the stream alike. Thank you. We could not do this without you. And as always. We love you. So with that, I'm going to set up a quick little raid on our good friends over at the Collective 808. Tell them we sent you and tell them. Actually, just throw your mana screw. When you get there, just throw the mana screw everywhere. Make sure that they know. Oh, they'll know. Oh, oh, I already did it. All right. This is exciting. All right, well, thank you very much, everybody. We will see you guys on Tuesday for Trash Day, and we look forward to hopefully some more fun games. So take it easy. You have a great night. We love you.